destroy all of my craft. It's gonna be a lot of work, but if that dragon comes, we're gonna give him a run for his money. Today is the day to reclaim what is mine. I am ready. But the dragon no! Lord! Hey Logan, we need to start building our base because it's gonna become nighttime soon and the creepers and the monsters are gonna come out and we need a place to survive. And I'm kinda getting hungry. All right, all right Jake, where, where do we start? Well, the first thing's first, Logan, we need to gather some resources so we can start working on our base. The base will be the first thing we need to build. Let's go find some wood. All right, Logan. Looks like we got our first tree here. Now I know what you're all saying, Papa Jake, you need to have an ax. I realize that, but all I have is this pickaxe, so we're gonna have to do with it. Let's get some wood. It's really hard to mine a tree with a pickaxe, okay? Timber! Looks like we got some wood, brother. Let's start working on the base. All right, guys, so check it out. We've been working on the box for it for some time now, and our Minecraft house is coming together pretty well. It's hard to see in this thing, but guys, check this out. So this is what we've been using our wood resources on. We are currently building our base so that it can be big enough for both me and Logan to survive in, but we also want to leave room for a bunch of additions. It's really hot in there. But guys, remember, we still want to add in a place for us to raise chickens. You know, maybe maybe we raise some moo cows. I also want to have a place for us to cook dinner and we might even start our very own farm. So we still have a lot of building to do. We don't have a crafting table yet though. So I was thinking, Logan, I'll continue working on the home base. Why don't you go out and gather some resources with the one pickaxe we have because we're gonna need to start crafting some new stuff. Logan, if I don't think my eyes are looking right, then I'm seeing what I think I'm seeing. Jake, what are you seeing? Our very first Minecraft dog. Yo! Oh, we can get a bone! We can get a dog! I don't have a bone. Well, I wanna get the dog, I wanna, I wanna have a Minecraft dog! Doggy, do you wanna join our Minecraft? Nope. She doesn't wanna join us, Logan, because we don't have a bone. We're gonna need to find a bone because I want my own dog. I'm gonna name him Mr. Fluffy McFlufferson. All right, guys, before we can build anything, we're gonna need to get a crafting table. So it's time to mine some wood, and we might as well get some rocks. So we've got our wood, let's go make a crafting table. Jake? Yo Logan, check it out bro, hey. coming along pretty good. Guys, check it out inside. We still don't have a roof yet, uh, as you can see. There's no roof, we haven't got enough wood for it, but we have most of it ready Jake, to this go. This place is massive. Yeah, I thought we'd start, you know, pretty big. I used up most of our resources, but obviously guys, this is Minecraft, so if we ever do need to expand, we can always expand this. I was thinking, you know, maybe I'd have my own room, so we don't, I don't have to see you at night. This is my room. It's actually the kitchen, Logan. I think, we're gonna put the, I think we're gonna put the kitchen here. Where's my bedroom, Jake? I don't know, we gotta, we gotta build it. That's the, that's the fun of Minecraft, we gotta make it. Did you get the resources for the crafting table? Yes, Jake, I have the wood. Well, the crafting table is the most important thing in all of Minecraft, so we need to put it somewhere nice. Logan, why don't we put it right in this corner here? That's where my bedroom was gonna be. Well, you know what, you're gonna have to move. Maybe we'll make an expansion onto this going backwards and add a room. You know, we can also always go outside and build anywhere we want. I mean, the world's our oyster. But here we go, let's put the crafting table down. Boom! Our first crafting table and our first achievement in Minecraft. High five, bro. This is a survival challenge and we are gonna survive out here for as long as physically possible. Which means, Logan, we need to become Minecraft people. We need to eat, sleep, live Minecraft. We are only eating chicken and pork and steak. Actually, Minecraft has a lot of food. There's apples too and sugar cane. And bread. Okay, we, uh, the, the, the food isn't the issue, but the issue is, Logan, the elements, okay? Not only is there rain, wind, sun, a lot of sun right now. There's also mobs of creatures. Like creepers? Like creepers, Logan. And creepers come out at night. So first things first, we need to get this base built, but we need some more wood. So I'm gonna use this crafting table to craft a stone axe. And boom, boom, boom! And there we go! We got our first stone axe, bro! Time to collect some more wood. Now, once it gets to nighttime, even though it's extremely hot right now, it might be cold. So we're also gonna wanna build a fire. But Logan, we need to gather as many resources of wood. Jake, your axe isn't doing anything to that wood. I realize that, Logan. In Minecraft, it's a lot easier. You just dun, 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 and you get wood. This is, this, this is really, you're gonna have to, you're gonna leave me, you just give me like 40 minutes. I'll, I'll get us some sticks. Jake, fire. you know what, I'll, I'll do it. See? Okay, yeah, or you could just do that with your stone pickaxe. All right, well, at least we got our wood, dude, but we need to use it for the roof. 
So guys, I think we're gonna start working on the roof and we'll update you when that's done and then we can start customizing the inside of our fort for survival. All right guys, so we just finished decking out the fort. Now it's not 100% complete. We, uh, we actually ran out of resources, AKA wood, to build the roof. So we still gotta work on the roof. But in the meantime, I thought it would be really fun to go inside and start decking it out because obviously, we might be here for a long while. I mean, I mean, that's really up to you guys and how many of you like the video. But if we're here for a whole week, Logan, we want to make this as livable as possible. So why don't we head into the Minecraft? Okay, I'm, I'm just gonna get a little bit of wood in case we need any. All right, so inside, I brought my Minecraft backpack with some goodies in it that's gonna help us deck this place out. We want to make sure that it's homey, but also has a lot of usable resources inside. I'm thinking we definitely need to build a chest to hold all of our gear, and before the sun goes down, I'm hoping we can craft a boat to travel across that ocean. I don't know if you guys noticed, but there is a massive ocean behind us. Yeah, Jake, if you're gonna cross this ocean, you're gonna need a big boat. This place is actually looking sick. We have put a lot of work into it, obviously a lot of resources, and made it really big, and this place is huge inside. I definitely want to get the roof finished, because the darker it gets, the more scared I get. Because obviously we got Minecraft creatures, but Logan, there's also real life creatures like raccoons. I don't know, it's kind of cool having like an open space you can pop your head out of. I have some stuff for our bedding. I've got a starter kit of seeds so that we can build our Minecraft garden, which I'm definitely gonna have to start working on tonight. And we got flint and steel, which you guys know in Minecraft is the only way start your fire. But Jake, uh, maybe no fire in the box for it. We'll definitely have to make our fire outside. And guys, remember, we are doing this for real, which means we can only eat Minecraft food. That's chicken, apples. Like I said, there's actually a lot of stuff, but we need to cook it on our fire. Before we get to that though, we gotta start building and decking this place up. I also brought Mr. Mushrooms. Jake, why did you bring this thing in here? It's a, I call what him, is this thing? I call him Mr. Mushrooms. he's my sheep, bro. All right, Mr. Mushrooms, you're gonna go over here. Maybe in the future, we'll build you your own little pen. So while Logan's working on the interior of the fort, I went ahead and used some of our resources to craft myself a shovel because one of the most important things about survival is, well, food. That's probably like up there with water. So I'm gonna be making our very own Minecraft farm, which means I need to take some water from this so we can use it to fertilize the crops and then go behind our fort and dig up some area. Now in my Minecraft kit, it came with some seeds, so we're gonna use this. I don't know what's gonna grow out of this, but hopefully we'll get some good vegetables. All right, first things first, we need some water. We got our water, now let's head to the back of the fort where we can start building our farm. All right, now I started working on a fence here to keep anything from, uh, you know, stepping on our crops. We don't want that, but I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna use a little area here. So I'm gonna dig up some blocks and pour some water down for fertilizer, and then we can start planting with our seeds. So let's start digging. Our hole's ready. Let's get some water in it. And there we go. We got a nice pool of water which should fertilize the crops to the right and left of this. Now I ain't no farmer. In fact, I have no skills in farming, but we've got our seeds here. And I guess all we need to do is put it on the left side and the right side. And we'll grow a different crop on the left side. I have absolutely no idea what's gonna grow here, guys, but as a first time farmer, I think I did pretty good. It's small, but I think it'll work. Also guys, one reason why I really want to build a boat and cross the ocean is, I don't know for sure, but I've heard that on the other side of this, there might be a village full of villagers, which will be great for us because then we can trade resources. And if we want to survive here for as long as possible, we definitely need to do that. What's up guys? Oh dude, this looks sick. Check it out. What? Okay, so pretty much we have our sleeping quarters made, which we have our custom oh, Minecraft pillows. I'm so comfy. <sighs> I could definitely sleep here for an entire year. Dude, I love the pickaxe holder, that looks sick. So we have, <laughs> whoops. A backpack holder. We have a backpack holder here. Definitely gonna need that for supplies. And we have our awesome pickaxe holder next to our crafting table. Wow. And some cool little artwork. Now we definitely need to make a chest. I wanna do that. We also need to get more resources and finish the roof because the roof Logan, although it looks really nice, that is that is screaming for raccoons to jump down here, or spiders, or even worse if it starts to rain. Jake, the sun is going down, and we don't have food yet. We need food. That's right, we're not gonna survive unless we get food. So 
we need to figure out we need to figure out what to eat and Logan unless you've seen a bunch of chickens running around I haven't seen any chickens Jake does Mr. Mushu count as food? Logan no we are not eating Mr. Mushooms he's the fluffiest thing I've ever seen in my life I don't care how much you like pork chops Logan we're not eating him I have an idea to find his food it's a little crazy it's a little early on to be doing it but I say we craft ourselves a boat and we cross the biggest ocean in the world. On the other side, I heard there was a village and maybe we can trade with those guys for resources. I'm so hungry, Jake. I hope this works. Now every good boat builder needs to start with some prime resources, aka wood. I'm ready to go. The boat has been built and I will be crossing the narrow sea. It's, uh, it's quite the boat, Jake. I, I don't think there's enough space for two people in here. You are right. I will be sacrificing myself to cross the narrow sea. Now, if those villagers are bad and they are griefers, I might not make it back. So don't touch Mr. Mushrooms. Doing this for us, Logan. We need food and we need to survive. Three, two, one. Did I make it across the ocean? Jake, I feel like I could have told you that was gonna happen. I didn't make it anywhere, did I? The boat is upside down. We're gonna need to rethink how we get our food. Now I'm all wet and freezing cold, so we don't have food, I'm freezing cold, our roof's not done, it's getting dark. Calm down, why don't we make a fire and warm up a bit? Yeah, Alright, I did bring flint and steel, so let's grab our resources of wood and let's start a fire. Maybe if we can find some food, we can cook it on there. Alright guys, now just like in Minecraft, we are going to start our fire, but we ain't got no matches up in here. No, we got flint and steel. So in Minecraft, they literally do this once and it starts a fire, but I don't, I don't think it's... This, this might take me a few tries, but we're going to get it just like you would in Minecraft. Okay, uh, J Jake's been trying with the flint and steel for quite some it's time now. It's not as easy as they make it look in Minecraft, and I'm freezing cold and I'm hungry, and I just wanna, all I brought was flint and steel, because that's all you get in Minecraft. Oh, guys, there we go, I did it with the flint and steel! Oh, dude, okay, good, we cannot let this fire go out, Logan. Make sure we got our wood resources ready. Oh, dude, that is warming me up. We have our very first fire in Minecraft survival. That's a nice fire, bro. It's really warm, but Jake, it's not feeding us. Logan, there is a very large possibility that we might need to sleep in the box for tonight without any food. We'll just have to wait for my crops to grow in the morning. Logan? Logan, we're under attack. What do you mean we're under attack? There's another player here. What do we do? Logan, where, 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 where's your pickaxe? We might have to pickaxe Jake, the other pickaxe player. My pickaxe is inside. It's the only thing we have to defend ourselves. What do you want? What do you want? No, I'm no mind reader, but might be a friendly player. Oh. Just want to enjoy our fire? Oh. Oh. And he's gonna try and- Is that food? I don't know what it is. You chopped up another player and now you're eating the other player? Oh. Jake, I don't think that's what he's oh, saying. No, no, what's he saying? Oh. What's trade? An axe. You want, you want an axe for the food? Oh. Logan, go get the axe. Here, do, do you want this? Well, then that's our only oh. pickaxe, but we really do need to eat. Well, we may have lost the pickaxe, but we got some food. I mean, pickaxes are pretty easy to repair. What, what do you give us? Cookies, bread, uh, steak. Jake, you okay. gave us a steak? I mean, we I did say we out here doing real Minecraft, and we are definitely out here doing real Minecraft. That is our dinner. Are we are we splitting it, or is this just for me? I think we're definitely splitting it. Well, we don't have plates in Minecraft, Logan. We have pretty much got to go hands in on this one. First night in Minecraft, first meal in Minecraft, steak. Could be worse, could be better, could be cookies, but... Not bad. Not bad at all. Definitely will fill me up. At the end of the day, Logan, even though we're surviving and we almost starved to do that, it's kind of nice being out here in Minecraft. Wouldn't you agree? Yeah, Jake, it's it's lovely. Yeah, that was a mistake. Logan, is that you? Yes, Jake, it's me. Yo, welcome back inside, man. We got the lights all ready to go in the Minecraft fort. I'm all fired up because I ate steak. I'm excited. How'd you like your steak, Logan? It was okay steak, Jake. Guys, we got extremely lucky though that we happened to come across another player or else, Logan, we would be going to sleep without any food and that wouldn't be fun at all because my stomach would grumble and it don't feel good. But luckily, even though we haven't seen any more animals, hopefully tomorrow my crops will have grown. Yeah, Jake, it was pretty lucky we got some food, but we don't have a pickaxe now. Yeah, well, Logan, that's why it's Minecraft. I just make another one, bro. Courtesy of the handy dandy crafting table. All right, well, let's make ourselves a brand new pickaxe. Boom, boom. Boom, and there we go. We got ourselves a brand new pickaxe. And that's not all, Logan. We got a few extra resources, so I thought we'd brighten this place up at night. Check this out. Check it out. Our very own light switches. 
Check out how awesome this fort looks at night. I mean, it's blue. It's comfy. I do not call that a backflip. I think that was a backflip. Outside is looking beautiful. Ow. You know what we need to do, Logan? We need to find some sheep and then shear the sheep. I think it's called shearing. And then we get their wool. And then we take their wool and we make it into carpet. And then we find some plants and we turn the plants into dye. And then we dye the wool and then we make carpet. I don't know what you just said, Jake. It's a little confusing, but okay. I think we need carpet. That would make this place even more cozy and comfy. Also, I was thinking for these light switches. I don't know why, but in Minecraft, I always love to put them right beside the door like this. So when you come in, you just flip it on and you got light. Flippy, flippy, floop. You do it as much as you want. All right, I got our flippity flute, and I made another one at the back here. So when I'm in bed at night and we're done with the day, when I go to sleep, I just go, good night. And I sleep like this. Well, you're going full Minecraft, all right. Okay, Logan's going full Minecraft. He's sleeping with, should I be sleeping with mine on? Should I sleep with my pickaxe? Yo, Logan. Logan, don't move. Whatever you do, do not scream. Oh, get up right now, bro. There's an Enderman outside. Jake, Jake, shh. Jake, I can't hear you. What? There's an Enderman outside our fort. An Enderman? Yes. Okay, okay. Now, whatever you do, Logan, do not look him in the eyes. If we just ignore him, you should just keep walking around doing whatever Endermen do. get eaten by that enderman. Jake, how can you just sleep with that guy walking around? Just ignore him, he shouldn't do anything to us. I'll just chill out. All right, I think we're gonna get to bed now, guys. We'll update you in the morning with what's going on. Logan, it is a brand new day in Minecraft, which means we need to turn on the power in the... I can't see again. Let's flip on our switches and make a plan for the day. Of course, any good Minecraft builder knows that he needs to have a plan. In today's plan, I've got a couple things that I wanna do. First things first, we need breakfast, because all I ate last night was steak. And since it is a Minecraft challenge, we can only eat Minecraft food. Now, I do have a garden that's working. We're currently waiting for that to grow. I have no idea what I'm growing back there. I ain't no farmer. But, Logan, I thought for breakfast, we could get the fort lit and have some apples. Where are we getting the apples from? Well, Logan, it's Minecraft. We're gonna pick them from a tree, brother. But guys, if you haven't checked out the Minecraft fort yet, this is what it looks like from the outside. Last night we had a fire, we slept in here, and since it is Minecraft, the world is our oyster. We might want to expand this, we might want to go other places. Logan looks like he just woke up. Hashtag squad. Squad. Down below. But Logan, let's keep the voices down, because last night we saw an Enderman. We don't know what other kind of creepers, monsters, spiders, or even skeletons are out here. All right, guys, I'm all geared up and ready to go. I got Mr. Mooshooms on my backpack here. Minecraft helmet on and our one and only pickaxe. Now all we gotta do is find some trees with apples, Logan. Jake, where are we gonna find trees with apples? Well, I'm no expert scientist, Logan, but I'm pretty sure those are trees. And I actually can already see some apples. Let's go. All right, now the key to picking apples is... Jake? It's quite, it's quite simple. You need to search for the apple. You need to smell the apple. If there's an apple right You need right to there. feel the apple, Logan. Don't interrupt me while I'm searching for apples. Now, I don't know where the apples are, but I do know they're close because I can feel it in my body. Jake, right there. There's an apple right there, Logan. You would have never found it. The very first apple, dude. Just like in Minecraft. Hmm. There's one right here. <sighs> nice. You know what they say, guys? An apple a day keeps the creeper away. Well, not too bad for breakfast. Of course, we still have my farm, which is going to make us some food. But, Logan, if we are going to be surviving out here for potentially an entire week, we definitely need to find more food. We also need to find more resources because all we have right now is this pickaxe. We need armor. We need weapons. We also want to expand the base, and we need to build ourselves a chest. I think the first thing we need to do is go out on a little mission and find some more resources. I am fighting we need to eat our apples. I think it's time for us to build our very first storage chest. We're starting to get a lot of resources. We got our pickaxes. We got our apples out here. 
We even got some wood, so we need a storage chest to start storing the stuff. We definitely need to start cleaning up in here. This place is already starting to get a little bit messy. I think we need some more storage. But guys, if you have any crazy ideas on what you want us to do and expand the base, be sure to comment down below. I'm already thinking we definitely need to get carpet in here, and I really want to find some redstone so I can start making some redstone items. Jake, I want to go explore. Like, There's so much to explore out there. Why don't we go explore? Well, Logan, we're going to need one of these bad boys if we're exploring. We got our very first storage chest. Check it out. Uh, place it right here in the Minecraft fort. It's coming together pretty well. We got our chest over here, crafting table over there, holders over there. We got our sleeping quarters over there. I think one of the next things we could do, Logan, is we could expand this place going backwards and maybe make ourselves our own bedroom. Jake, I want to explore. Hey, we're going to go explore, all right? One thing though is if we're going to go explore, we probably need to get some resources like mining. So we're going to need to mine a cave. We already have our pickaxe. But we need some defense because as we saw last night, there are already mobs of creatures outside. So I think I'm gonna also try and craft ourselves a bow and arrow. Logan, what are you doing? Logan, it's not sleep time in Minecraft, all right, bud? This is exploring time. We're going on an adventure today. An adventure! I'm gonna be making a bow and arrow, guys. So let's head up to the crafting table and grab our bow. One, two, three! And there we go, we got our arrow. Looking pretty good. Now we just need a bow to fire this with. All right, now for our bow. One, two, three! And there we go, we got our bow and arrow, Jake, bro. that's sweet, I want a weapon. All right, well, we're definitely gonna need some resources because I just spent all our last resources using this. Let's check it out, we've got our very own Minecraft bow and arrow. I do wanna get some armor though, because if we're gonna be going deep into these caves and maybe even the nether, we're gonna need as much armor and weapons as we can. Jake, I've never been to the nether. I know, and if we fight the nether dragon, that's a battle that we are not ready for. So I say we head outside and do some exploring because we need some resources. Maybe we can find some diamonds and build ourselves some diamond armor. Got my axe. All right, let's head outside. We out here ready to go on our first Minecraft adventure. I got my bow and arrow. I got my backpack on and we're ready to go. Okay, we need to be serious though because we need resources. I say we head down this way and look for a cave. Okay, Jake, sounds look, uh, good. All right, Mr. Mooshooms, you gotta lead us to a little cave, okay? That means that means he's happy. All right, I said we head down here to find ourselves a cave. Jake, I got a quicker way to cross the ocean. Oh, oh, no! That's not even close to how you drive a boat. I'm no boat expert, but that was far from how you do it. Happy now, Logan? I'm just kidding. Like, I know the boat won't work. I just kind of want to swim. Okay, well, man, we got to find resources. We out here for as long as possibly years. What if everyone keeps liking this video and we have to spend our next eight years here? All right, well, now that Logan's all cooled off, we got to keep moving. We got some serious exploring to do. Wait, Logan, 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 hold up. What is that thing? That's a creeper, Logan. If they mess up your house, then they mess up your day. As long as we take it out before it gets too close to us, it won't explode. Mr. Creeper, get it with the bow. Jake, you missed! Jake, can I hit him? Yeah, hit him once, hit him once. One more shot should do it. We got him! We gotta be careful out here. We barely have any armor on and we don't have a lot of food. I think I found an entrance to a cave, guys. Why don't we head down this way? It's a dark cave, Logan. We might need a flashlight. Whoa! Dude, it's redstone! Oh, this is gonna be perfect for making stuff. Hold on, let me get my torch on. I can really see it here. There, that's a little better. Uh, Yo, Logan, we found diamonds! Diamonds! We actually got diamonds! Get your pickaxe out right now. We need to get this stuff. Mine, 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 bro, mine! Get the diamonds! Oh, Logan, I'm seeing more diamonds over there. Check it out! Nice, dude! Oh, torch ran out, hold on. Oh, this is gonna be enough to make ourselves some diamond armor, maybe even a diamond shovel. All the crops I could build with diamond shovels. Yeah, well, it looks like there's cobblestone here. Why don't you try mining across here on this wall? One, two, nice. It's no wall. Oh, look, it's a slime. What is that? One, two, press around. Get it, get it, get it. Take it out, take it out. Hit it. Hold on, I got I am hitting it, Jake. Uh, ah, yeah. You got it. Dude, you got it. Nice. Oh, dude, check it out. It dropped some slime. Yeah. That's kind of gross. I don't really want to put this in my backpack. Maybe we could bring it back and put it in our chest. Oh yeah, it was definitely something we should keep. We gotta keep all the resources we find. It's just... Okay, I'll put it in my pocket. You gotta come in here, bro! Check it out! It's another part of the cave! Oh, Jake, what is this? Looks like it's a gold ingot. Definitely gonna want to grab that. Dude, check it out! These are like mystery blocks! 
Now it says diamond on the cover of it, but there's a chance that there isn't a diamond in here. I say we grab this and grab the gold one and head back to our base and see what kind of ore we have in here. We get another diamond, Logan. We're gonna be in Diamond City. We'll be rolling in the diamonds. We have enough cobblestone, okay? We just broke a bunch of cobblestone. Let's take the slime, let's take the diamonds and the redstone we got. I wanna build a redstone device today and let's open up these and see what we have in here. There is a chance we're gonna have a diamond in here, guys. All right, guys, we made it back to our base safe and sound. I think it's time to go inside and check out the resources we gathered. We need to make a place to hold our bow and arrow. Maybe we could put it like here. Yeah. That'd be really cool. But let's check out the backpack full of our awesome items. So we were able to get some diamond. Not bad. Let's put it in the chest. Some gold. We got ourselves a little bit of redstone here. And Logan really liked mining cobblestone. So we have a lot of cobblestone. And one of my favorite items we got the mystery box, which might have a very own diamond in it. There might be a real diamond, or it's gonna be more cobblestone. Or I'd take redstone, or iron, or gold, really. But I definitely wouldn't want dirt. All right, Jake, here's a mini pickaxe. All right, go for it. Is that what I think it is? Is it? I think this might be diamond, guys. I think we hit the jackpot. I got it. Ah, dude. A massive piece of diamond, yo! All right, well, definitely gonna add this one to the box, which means we have enough diamond to craft something I've wanted to craft my entire life ever since we started this challenge a day ago. Here, put it in the box. I think it's time for me to craft my very first piece of diamond armor. In three, two, one, dude! Check it out! Well, no creepers messing with me now because I all armored up out here. How do I look? Do I look cool? Tell me I look cool. I must look cool. Yeah, Jake, you look really cool oh dude i'm so i feel stronger too like i feel like nothing can affect me nothing can hurt me that 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 when well, then you're just taking my armor off i also still want to make diamond swords and a diamond shovel so i can you know work on my farm which speaking of logan we need to check the farm it's been a full day jake there's no way your carrots could have grown in one day something's growing i mean it's, I, it's, I don't see it dude check it out right here something's growing out of the ground so this is where i put my waterway which hydrated all the surrounding area and then i planted seeds that we had from a backpack only one way to find out what did we grow ah yo we got carrots up in here what what dude check it out i got one two three four carrots grew i mean it's not much, but it's humble work being a Minecraft farmer. And you thought I couldn't grow anything, Logan? Well, look at this. Four brand spanking new carrots. Looks like we're having a feast tonight for dinner. Well, we're definitely gonna have to utilize this farm for food. All right, well, let's bring this back to the chest and store it in our fort. I also wanna use some of that redstone we got to do some building today because I wanna make an awesome attachment for our front door. I wanna have a pressure plate that when you step on it, the front door opens. Hey, Jake, while you build the redstone pressure plate, I'm gonna go on a mission to find more materials. All right, Logan, sounds good. When you get back, we're gonna have a sweet new thing on our base. I'll see you in a bit. Hello? Who are you? Name's Billy McBillerson. Fancy seeing a new player around these parts. Uh, yeah, I've been here like less than a day. Less than a day? I've been here my whole life. Raise 40 chickens, 50 cows, even have a couple dogs. All right guys, so while Logan's off doing whatever Logan's doing, I thought it'd be really sweet to add an awesome pressure plate to our fort so that when we go up to the door like so, you put your feet down, you click the pressure plate and the door will magically open for you. Now we do have a lot of redstone and there is some other awesome stuff I wanna do with it, but I think this is a pretty easy thing that we can start off with. There we go, we've got the very first redstone creation on this fort and it is looking pretty sweet. So we got a pressure plate here. When we step on this, it'll activate the redstone. Coming along here, up the wall, and then connecting to the door and the door should open. That's some, some really fancy armor. Is that diamond? That's the best. I crafted it myself. I had to dig deep in the mines for this. Fight off skeleton, beat down creepers. I want you to know that if I want to, I could cut you down right now take you out, but I'm not gonna do that. Whoa, 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 no need to cut me down. I came here to trade with you. I'm a hunger man, making some stew for my pet turtle, Jim Bob. Okay, well, I, I have a carrot. Do you want a carrot? Carrot, whoa, whoa, I hit the jackpot. I ain't seen a carrot around here in 50 years. Tells you what, I give you this diamond sword for five of your carrots. Diamond sword for a carrot? I, I only have one carrot. All right, I'm gonna 
bargaining, man. I'll give you this sword for four carrots. Sir, sir, I only have one carrot. All right, my final offer is one carrot. Take it or leave it. Okay, well, I, I may have lied. I have three carrots. Nope, one carrot, final offer. Don't mess with my bargaining skills, son. Sir, one carrot. There you go, there's your sword. Enjoy. Wow, thank you. See you around. This is awesome. I mean, guys, we have more than one carrot. I think he lost that bargain. Oh well, go show Jake my new diamond sword. This thing is pretty awesome. Oh, no, 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 no. No, it's what Jake was saying, the Enderman. Okay, well, I have this awesome sword. Maybe I can take him out. Uh... Go away, go back. Go back where you came from. Stay back, I'm warning you. Oh, he's gone. Okay, that wasn't so bad. Whoa, whoa, stay back. Stay back! Uh, Jake said not to look it in the eyes. Why are you sleeping? Because it'll not throw us tired from building because it's not a like day in the bad I just got attacked by an Enderman, Jake. What? An Enderman? Where? But I got this diamond sword. Where'd you get a diamond sword, Logan? I don't know, I traded a guy a carrot. A carrot for a diamond sword? Who would do that? Also, wait, what do you mean there's an Enderman? Where, where is Logan? Did You didn't look him in your eyes, did you? I hit him with my sword. It's fine. I just ran away. And then with the sword, then he's gone. Oh, Logan is right here. He's in the face. Jake, what do we do? Oh, no, what do we do? Mr. Mooshoops. Oh, no, no. No, 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 no. I'm Mr. Mooshoops. No. He's gone. No. Mr. Mooshoops. Jake, where did he go? Mr. Mooshoops. I don't know. That's what they do. They disappear. He's gone. My precious Mr. Mooshoops. You let Mr. Mooshums go because you just had to fight Jake, an Enderman. I didn't know that sword. the Enderman would come and take Mr. Mooshu. You know what that means? That means we're starting a war with the Enderman. That means we are going to find him at all costs and get back Mr. Mooshums. Can't let him do that to Mr. Mooshums. Now he's gone. Now he's gone. Well, let's have to wait for him to come back. Well, Logan, on the bright side, I did install a brand new pressure plate made completely out of redstone for us. As you can see, I used a redstone to formulate a pressure plate, and if when we step on this block, the door will open. Get out, dude, try it out. How sweet is that? And the door opens. That is pretty sweet. You no sweet. longer need to use your hands, Logan. It's a hands-free operation we got going on here, thanks to my redstone plate. An Enderman came in and stole my motion. Day three. Today is day three of our Minecraft challenge. I don't know what happened to the top of the fort, guys, but uh, it definitely took a beating last night. I think maybe because of the heat, it just kind of... I went ahead and did a little bit of upgrades just to make sure the fort was more structurally stable. I added these like little poles here. We also still have the pressure plate, which I made out of redstone that opens up the door whenever you step on it. And don't forget guys, in this challenge, we are doing everything like you would in Minecraft. We need to eat Minecraft food, sleep Minecraft sleep, dream Minecraft dreams. And also if we are building, we need to gather resources like you would do in Minecraft. Jake's taking this really seriously. I want to eat real food. No, Logan, we can't eat real food. We can only eat Minecraft food, which actually is a pretty nice menu and for breakfast you're gonna be pretty happy so I think before we start gathering resources to add onto this base I'm gonna go whip us up a nice Minecraft breakfast now if you're wondering Papa Jake what are you gonna add on to your base it's already legit we had a plan today we were gonna add on a second story so that we could make it even taller first things first if we're gonna be making breakfast we need our resources and it just so happens that I looked over here check this out we got wheat on wheat. I am not eating this. Well, no, you're not gonna eat this, Logan. See, I'm gonna turn this into a beautiful breakfast. First, we gotta gather the resources, though. And a little bit more split. Oh, yeah. That's a premium wheat, Logan. It's the beautiful thing about Minecraft, guys. You're out here in nature. Everything you eat is pure and natural. You take wheat, you take water, you make bread. But in order to do that, we need to craft a furnace. So why don't we head back inside and use our crafting table to make a furnace and add it to our fort. So it's time to make ourselves a furnace. So I'm gonna head over here to our chest. Ah, grab out some cobblestone we got from the mine yesterday. Got our cobblestone. Now we're gonna head over to the handy dandy crafting table. And on the count of three, we should have ourselves a brand new furnace. One, two, three. Whoa, we got it. It's a furnace. Well, hold on, bro. We definitely need to expand the base because we are running out of room. Jake needs his own room. Just a nice king size bed. If you guys keep liking the video and we keep getting 50,000 likes like the last video got, we are going to be here for a while, which means, Logan, we need to invest first in a Papa Jake lounge. If you got a Papa Jake lounge, then I got a Logan lounge. Check it out, guys. We got the Minecraft furnace. It's, it's a little hot to have a furnace, but we got the fire down below and anything we put in here, we can cook, which is also important if we want to melt down our resources to build armor. Let's grab our 
sweet. We're gonna stick in the furnace here, give it a little bit of time, a little Chef Papa Jake love, and in a couple seconds, we should have some nice bread for breakfast. Guys, I am so sick of Minecraft food. Please comment down below if you guys have any ideas of what we can eat other than apples, bread, and steak. Fancy you mentioned bread because we got ourselves a fresh loaf of bread. I call it la bread because it's French. Give me half of that shit. Check it out, dude. This is our breakfast. Oh, this yeah. is it. This is all I get to eat, Jake. I have a lot of food we should look like a full family. Okay, well, it's really hard bread, Jake. It's tasty though. It's made by Chef Papa Jake. Well, after we finished eating our breakfast, guys, and we got a little bit of energy into us, I think it'll be time for us to head out and start planning our day. Especially, we need to go looking for some resources. Mm -mm -mm. I love that crap. Now that breakfast is done, it's time for us to head out and gather some resources. <laughs> If we're gonna be building onto this base and making it two stories and expanding it, we need a ton of resources. Mainly wood, mostly mostly wood, but we could always use some more cobblestone and diamonds. Diamonds are always fun, especially because I make stuff like this. My diamond helmet, which I got yesterday. And I like it because Logan doesn't have one, so it makes me look extra cool. Don't Maybe I'll get one today, Jake. I got us a diamond sword. That's true, you did get us a diamond sword. And I was hoping that later on we could maybe go searching for villagers because if you guys don't remember, it's kind of too hard to bring up, but yesterday I lost a friend. Jake, it was just Mushu. <laughs> it was Mushu, I'm slogan. I lost Mushu. An Enderman came in and stole my Mushu. <laughs> and I want to find him and get him back. If that means going everywhere and finding that Enderman, then I'm going to do it. Because I love Mushu. You guys should love them too. Hashtag mushrooms. Let's pack up, head to the forest, grab some resources, and then head back here and start building onto this base. We traveled a little far away from our fort, but we found some good resources here in the forest. So we're gonna be looking for wood, stone, or anything else that we can find. Even if we find food, Logan. Then there's a bunny. We might be eating rabbit tonight. No, 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 don't hurt the bunny. Okay, we can bring it home and make it our pet, and then eat rabbit. No, Jake. No, 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 you're not hurting the rabbit. Come here, bunny, bunny. You're right, I can't live on bread and steak. I need a little rabbit. No, Jake, we are not hurting the rabbit. Well, at least let's get a ton of wood. There's literally enough forest here to build us a three, four thousand story house. No, no, no. You scared it away, Logan. We could have had a bunny. That's a big log if I ever seen one. That's gonna get us some good wood, Logan. Follow me. a lot more inefficient. Logan's going to look on the other side because we think we hear someone following us. He's gonna take a look down there. I got my Minecraft bow out, so if I do see any bunnies or anyone, I'll be able to take them out. So far though, pretty good. I mean, we have traveled quite a distance away from the home base, but we've gathered a lot of resources and we're finding a lot of cool stuff out here. I'm actually really excited to add onto the base because I think it's gonna be so sweet when we add a second story. You see anyone? I can't see anything with this on. Jake? It's time to go mine some materials. I think uh, that was a pretty good, solid amount of mining we just did. So we got a lot of wood, we got a lot of resources, but I think it's time we head back home because Logan, I'm pretty sure someone's following us. I can feel it in my bones, bro. Someone out there. I heard them before. We're on our way home. We have nothing to worry about. Oh, yes, we do, because he's sitting right there. Wow, wow, wow. Look who we have here. A new victim for Griefa McGriefason. You see, I roam these parts of town looking for people just like you to grief. Well, you're not griefing anything today, Griefer McGriefason, because I'm sort of a Minecraft pro. And I've also got this bow. Try this on for size, buddy. That didn't exactly go anywhere near me. I didn't go very far Jake, at don't all. worry, I got the spread. I got him. Logan, where'd you get that bread? Why are you using bread? You had a diamond sword, could you not at least have used that? I mean, Jake, this bread was disgusting and it's very hard. It wasn't a weapon. It's it was, a good weapon. It was made with love. I don't know, man. I think you need to touch up on your baking skills. At least we stopped that griefer. I think we better get back to our base, guys. If there's more griefers out here, we don't wanna run into them. We have enough troubles. All right, guys, now that we are back and we have tons of materials, it is time. So many materials, bro, check it out. We got enough for four forts, five forts. I wanna build my own fort, like three stories tall. 
Time to repair this fort and make some additions. Well, while Logan starts preparations on expanding the fort, I need to tend to my farm, which obviously is a good source of all of our food. So first things first, let's grab some water from the ocean here. As you guys can see, I've been planting on both sides of this like waterway here, which is where I pour my water to fertilize. And I got some new seeds from the last time I picked carrots. So we're gonna put them down and see what grows. I have no idea what we're gonna be able to grow, but as long as it's edible, it should be good. I got my seeds here. If you have any idea what these could be, let me know down below, but we should be able to find out tomorrow morning. So let's start planting it along the side. What, what are you planting? I don't know, Logan, that's the beauty of planting. You never know what you're planting. Pretty sure you're supposed to know what you're planting. Nope. And tomorrow morning we'll find out. Now it's time to make my fertilizer block full of water here. And there we go, guys. We got a block full of fertilized water. Our seeds planted beside it. More, we should have some beautiful crops. As you guys can see, this roof needs a serious refurbishing. So what we're gonna be doing for this space is we're gonna be tearing down the front wall and then expanding it out this way, plus adding a second story so that we have a lookout onto all the mobs that might come at us during the night. But the sun is starting to go down. It's been a pretty long day, so we need to start building this thing fast. take any more of Jake's Minecraft food, so I had to sneak in and make myself dinner. Didn't tell Jake about this, so we'll keep it our little secret. Guys, I don't think Jake noticed where uh, where I went or what I'm doing. Well, I enjoy my nice, delicious dinner. He just builds our fort. Hey, Jake. Yeah? What's up? Uh, yeah, I don't think Jake cares what we're doing. So we're, we're good, we're just gonna eat without Jake. Jake's lost. All right guys, check it out. I have the second story complete and the full revamp of the fort. Look. Logan, where have you been, bro? I was just getting a broom. It took you 40 minutes to get a broom? I it built the whole thing. Minutes. Literally all that's left is to put windows and a door on and you come for that? I gotta br bring a broom, Jake. It's like the least important thing. All right, well, you might as well start brooming, but check it out. We got the second story here. Yeah, Jake, this is a, a good job you did. Looks yeah, real good. I mean, it's, it's a little all put together, but all in all, we added on to the old fort and made the front entrance here look nice and sleek and brand new. Plus, we have a full new room that we can go up into for lookout. Pretty sweet. Uh, Jake, uh, one question. What are we doing for dinner? I haven't thought of that yet. So I've, I've been so busy on the fort, Logan. We either can eat, well, we either gonna have to find steak, chicken, we could make more bread. Bread was pretty easy to make, or we could always look for more apples. That's a good thing I ate earlier. Well, let's get the roof on this thing and start adding the windows. So the sun is pretty much set. Our two story box fort is looking pretty sweet, and we have our new door. Check it out, guys. Um, and we cleaned it up in here so it's even bigger. Plus, we got room for all of our cool stuff. And we've got our brand new two story lookout over here. So you pull this flap up like this, and then you can come in here and check it out, guys, up onto our two story lookout. So you can look out the windows here, make sure there's no creepers or mobs coming at us. You can even see the moon outside, and we got extra room to chill. I mean, there's even enough space to lie down, look. Check it out, I'm lying down the second story. You can be down there, and I'm up here. Dude, this could be your bunk bed. Oh, dude, honestly, it could. Plus, there's space down here, too. Like, we could store stuff down here. And we could put another supply chest down here with all our stuff. Now we get to pretty much chill out in the fort, enjoy the night. We didn't get everything we wanted to get done today. There's still a lot of building we wanted to do. Plus, I really wanted to go check out that village that's close to us. So I was thinking tomorrow we could build a mine cart as well as a mine cart track so we could travel to the village, which I think would be sweet. Plus, look, I don't know if you uh, like diving underwater, but we have yet to go underwater and check out what's down there. I'm gonna also head to bed, but before we do that, I think it's time for the traditional bedtime Papa Jake dance. That's right, Logan, it's the dance party. Get, get boogieing with it. Come on, wake up. Okay, well, look, Logan's getting to bed. No, no dance party for us. All right, well, guys, I will update you in the morning when I wake up after another beautiful night under the stars in Minecraft, and we'll see you in the morning.
Welcome back to real life Minecraft. Today is day four of living using only items you can find in Minecraft. You guys have been destroying that like button and loving these videos. In today's video, we build a minecart, go swimming, eat a chicken, and have the biggest battle of our lives. Oh no, we got a creeper. Stop right now, creeper. Ah. We saved our base again, Logan. Hey yo, what's going on everyone? It's Papa Jake and we are back with a brand new Minecraft video in Minecraft week, which I have been extremely excited about. If you guys didn't know, we've been living in our Minecraft fort, in the Minecraft world for the past four days. And welcome inside the fort, guys. Check it out. It's a little messy because we have been living here, but so far we have upgraded this place and made it super sweet. We got chests, we got an oven, we got a crafting table. Logan is currently outside sweep. Logan, what are you doing, bro? I'm sweeping why, our porch. Why are you sweeping our porch, man? I, I guess we gotta. I guess we gotta keep it clean. We gotta keep it clean, Jake. But guys, check out the outside of the fort. This thing is absolutely massive. This is where we've been living, eating Minecraft, sleeping Minecraft, not. Not showering like you don't do in Minecraft, which hasn't been too great. We have a lot of chores to do, just like in Minecraft. We got upgrading the base. We got finding more resources. I already sweep the, the floor, Jake. That's that's like the least of our problems today. But I thought because we are a little low on food, we could travel to the local village and try and grab some food from those guys. Not not take it. Like, oh, Jake, you haven't even had breakfast. You haven't had any no, food. I'm starving, Logan, all right? We went through our bread. We ate our bread and we ate the steak. We've got nothing left. So in order to get to the village, we need to use some of our resources and build a minecart track to take us there. It's like a train, but in Minecraft. So we have to head to our crafting table right now so we can build our minecart. Well, first things first, Logan, if we're building the minecart, we got to go into the handy dandy chest here and grab some of our resources out of here. We're going to grab some raw gold. Now, this might just look like regular rock, but inside this, there is little pieces of gold probably asking Paul, but Jake, how are you gonna get it out of here? Well, that's why we got this bad boy. I call it Furnace McFurnacy. Pop the gold in, and the fire starts up down there, so we're smelting gold. Now we got a ton of rocks and stone that we mined in the last episode, so we're gonna use that to build our minecart track, but we're also gonna need to build an actual minecart that we can drive around all the way to the village. I think I need to jump in the ocean. Well, we can go in the ocean, dude. We can go searching down there also for resources because Minecraft has underwater now. But check it out, we're getting the premium gold coming out of the furnace. So we're gonna take some of this. I'll start working on the minecart track. I don't, if you wanna go swimming, go swimming. Time to add the resources to the good old crafting table here and build ourselves some minecart track. One, two, three, and boom, there we go. We got some minecart track. Now all we need is uh, like uh, 6,000 of these and a minecart and we should be good to go. I mean, the village isn't too far away guys, but hopefully this isn't all for nothing. I really hope they have food and resources that we can use. And I'm even hoping that today we can get some diamond armor. Oh, diamond armor. Now while Logan's building the minecart track, I also thought it'd be really cool if we made like a base for it, you know, kind of like a train station where we can get in, get ready, and then we can leave from the train station and go all the way to the villagers. There's also a... Uh, a second reason why I'm going. I don't want to tell Logan that we're wasting our resources for this. Yes, we're going to the village because I think there might be food there, but I also lost a friend. That Enderman took my friend. It's almost too hard to talk about. Got mushrooms, guys. Got mushrooms. And for those of you who are still looking for mushrooms, I am too. And I'm thinking that we... What, what are you... Look, where are you... Where are you... You're supposed to be building my... Logan, no, you're supposed to be... Building minecart track. I guess Logan's not building my car track, he's, he's swimming. Well, after Logan's done swimming and building the my car track, then we should be able to go to the village. And I'm hoping we'll get some answers as to where Mr. Mooshooms is. Check it out, I just finished our train station slash our minecart station. So here it is. It's a little ways away from our main house, but you enter into the back here through this door and inside we've got our working minecart. Now I added a window at the front here. So once you get in the minecart, you simply push it forward and then you can go out, open up the front door and start going along the track. Jake, get out of my way. What, what are you it's gonna, time to oh, install you, the track. Got the track? All right, Logan's gonna go in and start installing the track so we can get to the village. But uh, I got some bad news. What's that? We're completely out of gold ingot. Oh, uh, that, that does suck. We had to use all the gold ingot on the track, but that's okay because once we get to the village, it opens up a lot of trading opportunities for us. <sighs> okay, so now it's time to start building our track. <laughs> 
This should be enough track to get us to the village. Dude, this looks awesome. All right, well, we definitely have enough track to get us there. I think now all we need to do is get on this minecart and test it out. I'm inside our little minecart station, inside the minecart, and I'm ready to go. Hopefully the uh, the track works. I'll be able to head and make my way to the village. I'll send it back for you, Logan. Hey, right, here we go. Whoa! Guys, that was awesome. We made a real working minecart on a minecart track. Oh, oh dude. dude. <laughs> All right, guys, looks like the village is just up ahead. I put on my diamond helmet here so I can uh, make sure we're protected in case things go south. Logan, you got your sword? All right, now we don't know how these people are. They might be mean or they might be good friendly traders. Keep an eye out for anything. Hello? Anyone in there? Someone's in there. It's a villager. A real life villager. Sir, look, we, we are extremely hungry. We, we are travelers from, well, that that way. But look, we want to trade for food. If you have any sort of food you can give us. Do, do you speak English? I speak English. Okay, okay well, do, do you have any food we can trade for? I mean, we have Logan's diamond sword. We can what? give you that. Jake, not my diamond sword. Well, we gotta give him something. I grow chickens. All I can give you is chickens. But in return, I want emerald. Uh, emerald we, we don't we don't have emerald I, I mean I have a, a diamond helmet that's we don't have emerald that's kind of like an emerald right it's like brown like an emerald no 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 I only accept emerald we're starving like we're just gonna have to get some emeralds fine fine we'll we'll find emerald and we'll be right back okay don't do anything with those chickens you, you stay right there yeah, keep the chickens warm we'll be back we need to do something we need to figure out a way to get emeralds guys we have no food I mean yes we could go out and look for chickens but there probably aren't any. I haven't seen one. All I saw was a dog and a bunny. And you made me scare away the bunny yesterday. Okay, Jake, where are we gonna get emeralds? All right, well, we've already been to a cave before, and I mean, yeah, we found diamonds, but there was nothing else in there. I have an idea. In Minecraft, you can swim, and underwater, they now have chests. There is a chance that in that ocean, if we swim deep enough, we'll find a chest in it and some emeralds. We take it back to the chicken dude and buy ourselves some nice juicy chicken. Sounds a little far-fetched, Jake. Logan, if it was so far-fetched, then why did I bring my swimming goggles? Jake, I have no idea why you brought your swimming goggles. Going in the water, Logan, and we're gonna find that emerald and get back to the chicken man with enough emerald to buy us enough chickens to last the rest of our lives. Now, come on, we got some swimming to do. Let's go. As I'm ready to go swimming, I got myself some spears in case we run into some underwater creatures. And all we have to do is find ourselves a chest. Last one in the water loses, Logan. See ya. Woohoo! Come on, Logan, the water's great. Get inside. Guess we gotta go find some emeralds. Check it out, let's see what we got. Oh, we're in business. We got diamonds, cobblestone. Yeah, it's cobblestone's not that cool, but check it out. Jake, what's that? That, my friend, is an emerald. Oh, we're gonna be eating chicken tonight, brother. Jake, why do you keep calling it chicken? Because the guy said it was chicken. I don't know, That's a, she calls it chicken. Anyway, we need to get this back to the base and dry off. We gotta go get that chicken. So now that we got our little ticket to get some chicken, I think it's time to head back to the village and see if we can trade for a little bit of food. Sun's already starting to go down and I am starving for some yummy dinner. All right, well, let's head out on the minecart track and pay this villager a little visit. We've got our emerald and everything ready to go. Let's get on this minecart track. See you there, Logan. Alright, Mr. Villager, we have returned with your emerald, which I think means we get one of your chicken. Chicken, chicken, chicken. Oh, Jake, I'm so hungry. Oh, dude. Look at that. We got our own Minecraft chicken. Yo, oh. he touched that with his bare hands. But yeah, but I mean, it's Minecraft. We're surviving. Oh. Mm, I'm so hungry. Jake, where's your fork and knife? Well, Have some I'm etiquette. Out. By the way, Mr. Villager, I had a question for you. See, I lost a dear friend of mine. His name is Mr. Mooshums. Oh, Jake, not Mr. Mooshums I gotta again. ask, I gotta ask. Have you by chance seen an Enderman carrying a little Mr. Mooshums around? An Enderman, yes, I have seen. He walks around with a gang of griefers. I do not recommend you go after them, though. 
they are very bad people. Whoa, 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 whoa. You, you mean you, you've seen him? You've seen Mr. Mushrooms? No, no, we need to go after them. I don't care if they're Greepers. Chicken. I think we just take the chicken and we go the back home. Chicken, Logan, I want to get Mr. Mushrooms back, and if you know where he is, I'm going to go after him, and I'll take out those Greepers for you. I can tell you the coordinates to the way. They are not far over the mountain to the east, but be aware, they are bad people, and have struck our village many a times. Their Enderman is very dangerous. Well, I think we need to get back and gear up, man. If they have Mr. Mushrooms, we gotta go and take the fight to them. But we're gonna need to make some serious armor, Jake. We got some diamond from the chest we got in the ocean. I mean, we can we can put together a full diamond outfit, plus plus a diamond sword for the both of us. Okay, th thanks, dude. Thanks for the chicken. All right, it's yeah. Kind of gross, but I'll, I'll, thanks. I'll enjoy every last bite of this. Ch you make great. Ch you you make good chicken. All right. Goodbye. If we're gonna get back Mr. Mushrooms and take down those griefers, we're gonna need all the power we can get. Why? We're gonna use our diamond to craft some awesome diamond armor. Here you go, Mr. Crafting Table. Bring me some diamond armor. One, two, three. Ooh. Here we go. We got some diamond armor. Check it out, dude. Now all I need is a weapon. I do have my bow and arrow, but I think for this I'm gonna go with the sword. One, two, three. Ooh. And there we go. We got ourselves a diamond sword. Wait, Jake, did that just turn from a pickaxe to a sword? Yeah, it's a magical diamond sword, dude. It's like part enchanted. Boom, pickaxe or boom, sword. Check it out. Jake, look at this candle I just found. Why, why, why is that at all important right now? We're about to go know. take down If we go to a dude. cave or something, we could use this. Okay, look, you got your diamond sword. I got my diamond armor. We're going to head out and take these guys down and get Mr. Mushrooms back. Let's go. All right, guys, the villagers said that they should be somewhere around here. Now, these griefers are known to be dangerous, and they have some sort of pet enderman who stole my mushrooms. We're gonna find these guys and take them down. Jake, how do we know where they're gonna be? I have no idea, Logan. That's why we gotta look for them. There's no call for, hey, Grafer, come out and fight. Oh, there they are. Jake, I, I thought you said there were two guys. Yeah, look behind us, Logan. I got eagle vision. All right, look. I'll take this guy, you take that guy. I'll meet up in the middle. Oh no, he has an enchanted bow and arrow. You're mine now. <laughs> Got him. Oh no, Logan needs my help. I got him. Oh, I, I, thought, I, I thought you needed my help. No, that was pretty easy, Jake. Oh no, here he is. No, no, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, you put him down! You put him down right now, that's Mr. Mushrooms! No, no, that's Mr. Mushrooms, you give him back right now! Oh, where'd he go? Where'd he go? Look, he's there! You're going down. Oh, no. You almost got him! Oh, buddy, it's okay. It's okay, Papa Jake's back. Oh, you're probably out for a scare with that Enderman. All right. Oh, well, we took care of him pretty well. And we got Mr. Mushrooms back. <laughs> Let's head back to base, guys. That was quite the battle. And we are back with day 70. Before we start upgrading and doing some more crafting today, of course, we need to do some resource gathering. But I wanted to show you guys what we have so far and what we've been working on. So right here is our Minecraft fort. It's two stories of awesomeness. We've got an activated piston here, which fires out. Jake actually built this all himself. We got over here a crafting table. We've got a furnace. These are probably my two favorite parts of the fort. We got the armor stand over here and we have a secret door right here here now we don't tell anyone about it so if you guys tell anyone about my secret door I'm gonna be really mad okay now when you pull this like this the secret door opens and that's where we have our chest with all of our diamonds and all our goodies so today's mission is actually pretty intense we are going to the nether well whoa, whoa. before we go to the nether though we do need to make some additions to the base we are gonna make a bigger second story so we have a full second story that I'm gonna turn into a workshop and we do need to get some food because we've been out here for a while only eating minecraft food and I'm kind of hungry so maybe we build like a smoker so we can smoke our food and get some yum yum yums or Jake we could just a little cheat meal you know go down the nope, street nope, nope, to Logan, the restaurant doing it for real guys nice this restaurant. is for real life we sleep here we live here we eat here and if it's not in minecraft we don't get to eat it I've been living on apples and bread the past week and I feel great. Logan, you need to go gather some resources with the equipment that we have because we are kind of low on stuff. While you're gathering the resources, I think I'm gonna start working on the workshop so we can get a ton of new stuff made. Speaking of new stuff, Logan, we got a creeper coming this way. 
Jake, I'll get him with the sword. No, 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 no. Let him get the pistol. We're gonna be a-okay, right? We're not okay. Move, Jake, move, move, move. Your piston didn't work. Oh, nice. Your redstone piston machine doesn't work. Check it out, we got gunpowder. Maybe I should add the gunpowder to the piston machine and shoot out TNT. We make a TNT cannon. Jake, that might be a little dangerous. Well, I mean, it's dangerous, but it's better than a piston that shoots arrows. Okay, all right, well, that, that can come later, okay? You go gather your resources. I'm gonna start expanding the fort and making the second story. We did a little bit of upgrading inside the fort, cleaned it up a little bit, made it a little bit more livable. So now we got the bed moved over here. I also have my armor stand, which looks super sick behind the LEDs. I think that looks awesome. So any new armor I grab, I can put on the armor stand, just like you would do in Minecraft. I also had to move the uh, crafting table over here, kind of close to my secret door, but I think it makes it more secretive. Time to start mining some materials so we can build our awesome workshop. <laughs> Something just shoot me? Oh no guys, it's a skeleton. Okay, you're going down, Mr. Skeleton. You don't mess with the Loganator. I got the best sword skills in the game. And I think I'm ready for the nether. Guys, check it out, we got the dog right here. Can I tame you? Flew for the dog, you are now officially my Minecraft dog. I don't have any bones for you, but if I did, I would give you all, all the bones in the world. So you're you're mine now. You're Logan's. You're not Logan's. Floofer, we have a mission today, and that is to get some water from the ocean using my steel pail. Let's grab our water and head back to the farm. So we're back at the farm, and first things first, we need to make sure that we dig out a little section for our water so we can fertilize the crops. I'm also growing some nice flowers too, so you know, maybe we can make some dye. Guys, we should grab some flowers and make an awesome banner using the loom. I can grab dye, and then we can dye the banners and have our own individual banners. Like the Papa Jake house. All right, now time for our one watermelon seed. Place you there and fertilize. Just like in Minecraft, you need a nice block of water beside wherever you're farming. And that's how you grow food nice and fast. Probably how real farmers do it, because I'm a real farmer. Tomorrow morning, we should have a fresh watermelon. We are converting this Minecraft base into a Minecraft mansion. We got this entire section of the fort on two stories. There'll be a back entrance into this second story, and we'll have a nice handy dandy workshop up here with all the new Minecraft updates. <laughs> So check this out guys, we actually made the entrance to the second story outside. So you come out the back door here and then you open up this door here. So check it out guys, we've got the second story workshop. Ugh. So you come up like so and we are now on the second story. It has a ton of room to add all of our new stuff. I'm thinking we add the loom, we add the blast furnace. I also want to add a smoker to make some good food. I was thinking today we could go fishing and get some fish and then smoke it in the smoker and then we got some nice fish. Also, my favorite part about this is the fact that you can see outside and it's got such a sweet and nice view. Doggy, do you want to join our fort? <laughs> Don't leave me. Come back. Jake? Jake, what, what, what are you doing? It's not Jake. What do you mean it's not Jake? What? Okay, okay, fine, it's, it's Jake. This is looking absolutely right? incredible, except for that. What is that, that's Jake? Our, that's our chimney where the smoke comes out. Uh, okay, Jake. But dude, this has to be on par with some of our biggest box forts of all time. It is getting huge, and it's only day seven, Logan. This I mean, is a box fort mansion. Dude, if we get 50,000 likes and we go to day 400, the whole world is a box fort. Next, we gotta build an island. Ooh, an island, that would be sweet, guys. An island Minecraft box fort. But, Logan, I wanted to show you some of the cool inside stuff because now that we have your resources, we can finally put them inside the workshop and start building some new cool stuff. Jake, that weird guy is back. <sighs> it's Friendly Phil. Yes, Friendly Phil. What do you want? Hey, guys, it's Friendly Phil. Every time you come here, something bad happens, so it better be good. Looks like an awfully big fort you got here. I thought your guys' fort got destroyed. Well, yeah, friendly Phil, but we're Minecraft Pro, so we rebuilt the whole thing in like four hours. Yeah, it kind of took a long time. Sun's actually 
starting to set. I mean, it's a nice four, but aren't you guys sick of Minecraft? What about all the dangers? Like the creepers, the skeletons? Yeah, friendly Phil, I think we can handle some skeletons and creepers, okay? No, we're not yeah, sick I of Minecraft Jake, at all. I just took out a skeleton. The viewers are destroying that like button, getting 50,000 likes a video. Plus, we're about to go to the nether. The nether? You guys are going to the nether. The nether's dangerous. I told you, no nether, no caves. Okay, all right, friendly, friendly Phil. Be careful with friendly Phil. It's, I'm being careful, okay? If we want to go to the nether, we're going to the nether, friendly Phil, and there's nothing you can do about it. I mean, I'm just trying to be friendly Phil. You probably shouldn't go to the nether, it's dangerous. I mean, I think we spent enough time in Minecraft to go to the nether, but I mean, Jake, what if he's right? Logan, he's not right, okay? I don't know what friendly Phil's up to, but every time he sees me, he tells me to stop going there, stop doing this. I'm starting to think you might not be so friendly. Don't say I didn't warn you. Friendly Phil. I don't know, guys. What do you think? Personally, I think Friendly Phil's up to something. It gives me the creeps. No, I mean, he did warn you about that cave, and look what happened. Yeah, but arguably that was his cave that he set up for me. I think we ignore Friendly Phil for now. Let's get back to the real business at hand, and that is building my legit workshop. I say it's time we use those materials you gathered and build some awesome new items at our crafting table. So Logan, I think first things first, what's one new item I want to use? Oh, I know what it is. The blast furnace. Everyone needs a blast furnace to smelt their ore faster. Three, two, one. Oh, and there we go. We got ourselves. Oh dude, that's heavy. A blast uh, furnace. This is going in here into the workshop. Next item I want to craft is... Ooh, I know, we'll do the loom because we're going to be making our very own banners today. Three, two, one. Oh! What does this do? This is the loom. This is how we're going to be crafting our banners and giving them some sweet designs. We're actually doing a lot of work on the workshop today, which I like. But we are still going to the nether, guys. All right, next up, I think we're going to need a stone cutter for our brand new workshop. So, Mr. Crafting Table, I'm going to give you the resources here. Give me a stone cutter in three, two, one. one. Whoa! Brand new stone cutter. Ow, no, careful, dude. That's dangerous. This is going in the workshop. Jake, you're using all of our resources that we just mined. I know, I know, but it's important that we build the workshop because then we can expand the base with anything. Last item we're gonna make today is one of my favorites and something we're gonna be using for dinner. It's called the smoker. Here we go in three, two, one. one. Oh, brand new smoker that we're gonna be using for cooking some fish tonight because I thought we could build a fishing rod and try some fishing. I mean, I am working on some watermelons, but we're out of chicken and bread's been getting old and I'm kind of tired of apples, so why not fish? Jake, that's a great idea, except you're not very good at fishing. Whoa, okay there. Logan, I'm the best fisherman you've ever seen, okay? When I put my fishing rod in the water, all the fish come by because they're like, what's up, Papa Jake? Can I get an autograph? Because you're cool. Okay, Jake, the sun is going down. We need to get cooking. First, before we go catch some fish and build a fishing rod, why don't we check out the brand new workshop that is my passion project. Oh, the workshop's actually looking pretty good. Check it out. Oh, dude, this is awesome. And it's on the second story, which is sweet. We got our stone cutter, our furnace, our loom, and our smoker. It's not too shabby, not too shabby. Plus, we have another room that we can build under here. So we can keep expanding the base with unlimited possibilities. That's why I keep telling you guys, if you have anything you think we should add onto this base, be sure to comment down below. But before we get into using some of this stuff and building our banners, I think you're right, Logan. I think we need to go craft a fishing rod and do a little bit of fishing. Okay, Logan, well, in order to make a fishing rod, we need some sticks. And luckily, I have some in my secret hidden chest. So why don't we open up this bad boy here? Check it out. Oh, there she is, the hidden chest. Lots of diamonds, lots of steel, not bad. Ooh, slime. We have a lot of slime in here. Ah, sticks. Okay, now we use these to craft. Got my sticks ah, and my string, and all we need to do is use the magical powers of the crafting table to build a one, two, three, oh, fishing rod. Check this. Maybe we should take the fishing rod out outside before we check it out. My very own Minecraft fishing rod. Check it out. The sun is going down. It's the perfect time to fish because they're all sitting down for their dinner. And I'm about to serve them up some Chef Papa Jake. Oh, Jake, be careful with that. Chef, pa Chef pa Papa Jake. All right, here we go. Cast it out. And now we wait. Oh, oh, Logan, I got a big one here. Hold on. Oh, he's fighting me, brother. Oh. Ah! Where'd it go? 
Where's the fish? Jake, that's not how you do it. Oh, look, we got a fish. Time to take this fish to the smoker and make some dinner. Now I'm officially inside the workshop and it's time to cook some fish. Logan's back down th th there. L Logan? What, Jake? Uh, that, just, just saying hi. But anyway, we're gonna be using our nice little smoker here to cook our fish. So I already put it in. Close up the lid here and we're gonna let it cook for about one, two, three, and it should be ready. Get out, pull this down. Ooh, I think I see some nice fresh fish. Check it out. We've got some smoked and cooked fish. Jake, that actually looks really good. I bet, brother, why don't you grab one right now? It's dinner time in the Papa Jake Minecraft fort. That's pretty good. I think we did a really good job making a slow cooker. Jake. What happens? Uh, well, Papa Jake and Logan are still in Minecraft. Why are they still in Minecraft? I was gonna destroy their base, but they came back anyway. I did everything you said. The Grievers, everybody, they haven't left. The longer they are in Minecraft, the more likely they are to find me. Well, I mean, sir, they might not find you. You are very far away. And who in their right mind looks for a big dragon? If I haven't made myself clear, we have an agreement. You stop Papa Jake, or else. Yes, sir. Very clear. I'll, uh, I'll go back and get him out of here. I promise. We are back inside our fort after eating a nice yummy yum dinner. It is currently, uh, well, it's getting kind of, it's getting kind of dark out. Uh, we've spent a lot of the day building. We got a lot of stuff upgraded inside the fort. And this place is just looking super sweet. Guys, check out my bedroom. It's on the second story. Yeah, Logan just had to have his own bedroom. It's kind of better than Jake's bedroom, that's for sure. That's fine, man. I have this whole bedroom down here to myself. And we have my bedroom where we get to see the nice beautiful ocean and oh my gosh jake that's an enderman jake there's an enderman outside our fort just don't look at him man if you don't look at the end you guys didn't look at the enderman right jake, don't look him in the eyes i don't know what do you mean you don't know looking this is all over again where's mushrooms i want to make sure he's okay mushrooms get over here come here boy no enderman's getting you this time all right logan what you need to do is i'm gonna go to sleep while i sleep you fight off the enderman jake come on now's our chance we can get him all right, but I'm doing it for Mr. Mushrooms. Uh, armor stand comes in handy. I'm doing this for you. You stay here. All right, guys, I'll grab my sword. Uh, he's gone. The, the Enderman's gone. Where did he go? I don't know, Jake. He was right here. Well, maybe he got scared away from my kung fu powers. Crisis averted. Papa Jake saved the day once again, guys. We are safe to head back in the fall. Logan, we got a skeleton. It's approaching. Watch out! Oh. I mean, at least it wasn't an Enderman. All right, well, that's, that's fine. I mean, it is a nighttime. Mobs are spawning. There's probably skeletons, creepers all around, but that's okay. That's why we got Maybe we just lock our doors tonight exactly. and go to bed. We lock the doors, we go to bed. Logan, another skeleton. Careful. Dude, where are all these skeletons coming from? Look, we can go inside our base and chill all we want, but if there's a ton if of skeletons- another one. Oh no, come on. Wait, Jake, there's a spawner. How did a spawner get so close to our base? We've been all around this place, we've never seen a spawner. We gotta get this thing out of here. Oh no, we'll another one. All right, let's get rid of this and fast. We got lucky we found the spawner. We could overrun the entire house. As far as I can tell, Logan, we've been around this entire place. I mean, we've scavenged the entire area for resources. We would have seen a skeleton spawner there. That means somebody placed it. Yeah, I guess that is kind of suspicious, but who would have done that? Telling you, man, it's that helpful Pete or whatever his name was. You mean friendly Phil? Yes, friendly Phil, okay? The not so friendly dude. Someone put it there. Look, I think first thing in the morning, we need to set up our nether portal and get into the nether. Maybe we can find some more information in there. But tomorrow is the nether portal. So get some rest, Logan. Because we don't know what's going to be on the other side of that thing. See you in the morning. Ooh, what is going on, everyone? Good morning. It is another lit day in the box for us. And we are back and it is days. I don't even know what day it is, but I I had a great sleep last night. We need to wake up. Logan, get up. What's up, dude? How'd you sleep up there? 
I actually realized Logan has a little bit of advantage because last night I kept getting ants crawling in my bed, which is not fun. So you actually sleeping up there probably had a lot less ants than me. So that that's nice. And today is an extremely special day because it is the day we finally get to build our nether portal and go to the nether. Before we do that, Jake, I think I need to eat breakfast. Well, Logan, I'm glad you mentioned that because today's breakfast, I got something extra special. You see, last night while you were out gathering resources, I actually went ahead and planted some watermelon. We got a fully grown watermelon. I knew it was gonna work. Ah! Oh, now that, that's breakfast. That is breakfast. Look at this, it's fresh. It's grown straight from the farm. What more can you ask for when you're living in real life Minecraft? Guys, I am looking forward to this sweet watermelon. Now the key to a good watermelon cut is you get your ax, you put it right in the middle, and you just give her a good swing like that. And we got watermelon! Okay, I don't think that's how you eat a watermelon. That's how you eat a watermelon. Mm. They keep dripping everywhere. The man. We got a watermelon. Mmm. Alright guys, now that we're all filled up on our watermelon, I think it's time we head back inside because we got a lot of planning to do before we head to the nether. And we actually had a really awesome idea suggested to us by one of you guys. Huge shout out to Short Clips for suggesting that we use our brand new loom to make some awesome banners. We're back inside the workshop and time to use the brand new loom. I think it's time we put this bad boy to the test, Logan. Jake, I'm going first. Here we go. Alright, stick it in. And here we go. Oh, dude, that's actually pretty sick. All right, dude, time to put my banner inside. And here we go. Oh, that is sick. Check it out. My we got Papa our Jake custom banner. banners. All right, let's go put these on the front of the fort. Oh, yeah. Don't mess with the L squad. Okay, all right, that looks pretty cool, but I think I'm gonna put mine here hanging off the roof. The nice Papa J banner. It can flap in the wind. It looks cool. I think our base is starting to look pretty awesome. Well, in order to build our nether portal, we're gonna need a bunch of obsidian and my flint and steel. Then once we're done, we just strike it with the flint and steel and boom, we have a nether portal. I got my diamond armor, my diamond helmet, my diamond sword. Jake, I don't have any armor. Well, you got a diamond sword. Oh, okay, I have an idea, I have an idea. Why don't you build the new shield? Let's build our shield in three, two, one. Oh, guys, check out this shield. All right, Logan, while, while you were making your shield, I set up the nether portal. Nice shield, by the way. I think it is time to activate this nether portal. Good thing I have my flint and steel. Are you ready for this, Logan? My first nether portal. Never been so ready in my life, Jake. Here we go. In three, two, one. A little scared? Let's do this together, come on. Logan, is that you? What's going on? Jake, I don't know what this thing is. Get it off of me, get it off. I don't know what that is, I've never seen it before. Oh, dude, you got it, nice. Cheek, where were you? I uh, I was just take, taking my time to get into the nether. I, I was making sure everything was safe in the base at home. You know, I make sure you were clean. delaying, Jake. I was delaying a little bit, but man, I told you not to run in here alone. Look, you ran into some sort of cube monster thing. It could have been worse. It could have been an evil skeleton. It's like we fall into some sort of red world. Why is it really hot? I don't like it in here. Oh, Jake, the nether is scary. Okay, well we're here. We we should go somewhere, right? Well, uh, yeah, I mean, I I've, I've only know a little bit about the nether, but what, from what I've heard, it opens up past this cave system. We should be able to mine our way out of here. Only problem is we gotta be very careful. We don't wanna mine into the wrong cave and run into the wrong people. It could be one of these walls. Maybe we should mine. Well, Logan, what are you doing? You can't just start mining without even telling me what if you run into lava? I don't know, aren't we surrounded by lava? I mean, technically yes, but you could be mining into someone's house for all we know. What do you see? Oh, Jake, it doesn't look very nice in there. Well, it looks like it definitely opens up into some other room. Let's just hope it's a safe place. I don't see any evil bad guys. Should I go first? Oh, sir, are you in there? I got some bad news. Yeah, so sir, they're in the nether. What do you mean, they're in the nether? I did everything I could, I swear, but yeah, they're in the nether. I told you to stop them. You failed me too many times. I don't want to see you ever again. Oh, sir, I'm, I'm so sorry, I messed up. One more chance, one more chance. Now I will have to send my zombie pigmen after them and get them destroyed in the nether. No more second chances for you. I never want to see your face again. Oh, 
Ah, could have made this hole a little bit bigger, Logan. Ah. Oh, Logan. I have never seen a place like this in Minecraft before, guys. Hey, come on, Logan, come on out here. Dude, check this place out. This is one of the weirdest places I've ever been in Minecraft. Yeah, this place looks really weird. Guys, this has to be one of the weirdest places we've ever been in Minecraft. I mean, just look at this place. Jake, what's that? Dude, I know exactly what that is. <gasps> That's a zombie pigman. They're one of the bad guys in the nether. See, the cool thing about these guys, Logan, is they actually won't hurt you unless you touch them. See? Hey, zombie pigman, what's up? You won't even attack me. He's completely- Ow! Ow! What's going on? Why is he attacking me? Never attack me! Uh, we'll just stand there, Logan. He's gone rogue or something. Uh, 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 uh. Guys, I do not know why that thing just attacked me. They're not supposed to do that. They're, they're only supposed to do that if you hit them. I don't know, you look pretty aggressive, Jake. I, I don't know what's going on. That, that's not how it's supposed to work in the nether. I, mean, I don't know everything about here. Logan, watch out! Ah! Use your shield! Ah, 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 ah. Guys, what's going on? Why are these things attacking us? I have a bad feeling about this place, Logan. Something's going on here. Yeah, man, it's the nether. People talk about this place being the scariest place. Exactly why I said we shouldn't have just gone through the portal. We weren't ready. I mean, all you have is a shield, and yeah, at least I have diamond armor. It's true. A lot of people in the comments were saying we need to enchant our armor. There are a lot of treasures in here that we can find, and a lot of resources we can get, but guys, it might not be worth the risk. Oh, Logan, Look what are you doing? No, don't what touch. What is this? We just discovered. Don't touch anything. This is it. That's glowstone, Logan. Jake, this is it for me. What do you mean it's it for you? I like this. That's great, but I, like I said, let's not touch it. You're gonna break that thing, and all, for all you know, there's gonna be a spider. Logan, do not break that thing. Logan, I told you not to break it. Why not? Because we don't know what's behind there. There's nothing. Something's going on in this nether, Logan. I think we need to get out of here and fast. Oh, no. Jake, there's another one. Logan, Logan, we got another problem. There's a gas, Logan. We got a gas right in front of us. Glowstone. Logan, Logan, turn around, we got bigger problems, it's a gas! Ah! What is that thing? It flies and shoots fireballs, try to fight them! Ah! Ah! Got it! Nice! Logan, we almost got taken out by a gas, this is no time for glowstone! Something's going on here, man. Everything in the nether is trying to attack us, and we are very underprepared. I mean, just look at that. You almost got hit by a fireball if I wasn't here to save you. This is really, really cool. It's a glowstone. Look, and I don't care what it is. I don't care if it's a glowing diamond block. We need to figure out a way to get out of here. Guys, this is not a safe place. Look. I'll see you later, Jake. Wait, what? No, no, Logan, where are you, where are you going? No, Lo Logan, Logan! Come on. We need to go back to the nether portal. Okay, fine. Guys, I think we went through another portal. We're back in Minecraft. Logic, I don't think this is the nether. No, it's not. Looks like we've traveled back into the Minecraft. Logan, I told you we shouldn't have gone through there. We need to get home and fast. These nether portals lead to anywhere in Minecraft. We could be millions of miles away from our house. I don't even know where we are. I don't see anything. Jake, how do we go back to the nether? Oh no. I want to go back to the nether. We got bigger problems right now, Logan. We got a skeleton fast approaching. All right, watch out, don't get too close. Oh, that was close. See, Logan, I told you this place is dangerous. We need to get out of here and back to home base. I don't even know where the nether portal is now. I think we have bigger problems. There's an enderman. Oh no. All right, don't take him out. Oh Jake, no. He disappeared. He's right here. I got him. Oh, got him. Jake, what is this? What's what? I don't know, what is this? He must have dropped an ender pearl. It's an ender pearl. Okay, Logan, that's something we gotta learn about later, all right? We need to get back home. Whatever you do, just do not throw that thing. Okay, let's, no, Logan, no! No, Logan, he's gone. Oh, no, 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 Logan! Over here! What? How'd you get up? Okay. I found the portal, it's just over here. Whoa, 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 whoa. You need to get out of here. Guys, it's just friendly Phil. Guys, yeah, he's crossed us too many times. I need to confess. Confess what? I need to let you guys know I've been working with the dragon. Working with the dragon? Why are you working with the dragon? He was holding me prisoner. He wants you guys out of Minecraft. So I destroyed your bases. He locked you up in that prison. I knew it. I knew it was you, friendly Phil. I knew it was all you. It he... wasn't me. It was the dragon. Well, clearly you were working for him. I, I, I believe friendly Phil. I feel like he's friendly deep down. So now you're not working for the dragon anymore? No, I came to tell you guys. It's dangerous. We need to leave. I want to join you guys. 
All right, fine. You know what? If you truly are not working with them anymore, then you can join us. Look, meet us back at our base. We're gonna go back into the nether and head back there now. We'll talk when we get there. Friendly Phil, I forgive you. Thank you. All right, guys, we need to figure out a way to get back home and fast. If what Friendly Phil said is true, that means we have the end dragon coming after us. We need to get home, reinforce the base, gather as much gear as we can. This is not looking too good for us, Logan. Oh, I spoke too soon. We got another zombie pigment. Take him out, Logan. Nice. All right, dude, let's get back to our nether portal and get out of here. I don't want to stay in this place one second longer. Jake, what is that? No, no more glowstone. We need to get out of here now. Jake, just one more glowstone. No, no, no more glowstone, Logan. We need to get back. Did you not hear what I he said? I just want one more glowstone. And the end dragon's after us. Logan, Logan. What? What? With the glowstone? No, not the glowstone. Look in front of you. I think this is a nether fortress. This actually might work, guys. If we can get inside this nether fortress, there's been known to be extremely good loot in here. Oh, Jake, I think you were right with the whole portal thing. Let's just go home. For once, Logan, I think we do need to stay here. We need to go inside this nether fortress and gather what loot we can. It could have, it could have enchanted diamond armor for all we know. We're gonna need everything if we're gonna take on this dragon. Here, pass me your pickaxe. We're going through the wall. Okay. Now you go first. Uh, Jake, I'm not going first. Well, I broke the wall. I'm almost tired. You have diamond armor. I'm tired from breaking the wall. It's just a little thing I got to mine it. Okay, fine, fine. Whoa, dude, check it out. Look at this place. This another fortress is huge. I'm going in. I mean, it's scary, but not too scary. All we need to do is find out where they're keeping their treasure. We'll take whatever we can find and get out of here and back to our base. Looks like there's a door up ahead. Oh no, we got a skeleton! Ah. He hit me! Ah. Ah. Gone, Logan, come on, get in here. Looks like there's a door at the other end. We get through there, and maybe find the chest. Careful, we don't know what's behind this door. Hello? Logan, don't knock on the door, we don't want to alert anyone! What? What's that sound? Something in here. Oh no, Logan, it's a blaze! Watch out! Gee, what's a blaze? These creatures in the nether, we don't want to go near that thing. Arguably, we just go back home right now. No, no, no. All right, we're out, we're out. We're going home, Jake, we're going home. I saw a chest. Yeah, I don't care if you saw a chest. Logan, there's a blaze Jake, in there. We we get the blaze and then we get the chest and, and there's probably some armor for me. Okay, fine, I'll try and take out the blaze. All right, so I'm doing this for you guys. For Minecraft! Ah! Oh, ah, Logan, oh! I don't know, I'm not going in there. Jake? What's going on? Guys, that does not sound good. Jake, how's it going? Jake? Logan, do something! He's hitting me a lot! Back up with the Oh, dude, good job. Thanks for saving me there. Check it out. I think I see something. It's the nether chest. Oh, dude, we are in business. Yo, enchanted axe, gold ingots, diamond, horse armor. Logan, we hit the jackpot with this nether castle. This is everything we need to fortify our fort. This ender dragon is not gonna know what hit him. All right, let's grab this gear and get out of here. We need to get back to our fort and start improving it so we can take on this dragon. Come on. Oh, oh, oh. okay. Oh, we're back in Minecraft. Logan? Jake, I'm never going back there. Yeah, that was a really scary place. I do not want to go back to the nether anytime soon. All right, let's get back to our fort and, oh no, is that Friendly Phil? No, 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 Friendly Phil! You're destroying our fort! Where did our fort go? Who talked about this? You're on our team now, what's going on? Oh, hey guys. What are you doing back from the nether? What do you mean what we're doing back from the nether? We told you we'd meet you back here where you were gonna join our team. You've destroyed our entire fort. I didn't know you guys were actually gonna make it back. I'm just doing what the dragon said. Oh no, I messed up, didn't I? Yeah, you did. You completely destroyed the fort. We had an agreement. I'm just, I'm terrified of the dragon, Jake. How are you not terrified? Friendly Phil, I told you, it's because I'm Papa Jake. I can take on the dragon, okay? I got diamond armor, I got my sword. I, I thought you were our friend. I want to be your friend, but the dragon, guys, the dragon. I don't care about the dragon, Friendly Phil, okay? I can take on the dragon, and we needed the fort to do that. Oh, jeez. Oh, I'm sorry. 
I'm really sorry. I'm just scared of him. Today is a brand new day. It is currently uh, the day day eight, day day nine. Logan, what day is it? Well, Logan's inside the fort. What day is it today? Oh, I think it's day nine. It, it, it might in fact be day nine, guys. If you did not know, this is the series where we survive in real life using only Minecraft items. Now behind me, you might remember in the last video, friendly Phil, not so friendly Phil, completely destroyed our entire fort. So we've been working hard on rebuilding it as best as we can. And in today's video, I thought it would be really sweet to turn this into a three-story Minecraft fort. Okay guys, so first things first, we're gonna start working on this fort and getting the third story ready because we wanna have an awesome fort to survive in today because we're gonna be surviving in here for 24 ow, ow, hours, 20, 24 hours. A nice little hour's work of mining, and I've got us some sweet resources in the form of wood blocks. So check this thing out. This is insane. We have been working on the three-story fort for a little over an hour now, and this thing has to be one of the biggest forts we have ever built outside. You got the first floor, the second floor, the third floor. I don't even see Lo Logan. Oh, dude, look at him. Look how high up you are! Oh, Jake, I'm really high! <laughs> That's so crazy! You're like oh. twice the height of me! This is a little scary up here. <laughs> I mean, at least it'll give us a really big lookout in case any bad guys are coming during the night, but we still have a ton of stuff to do. We still gotta finish up the second story, obviously add a bunch of windows, and check it out. The fort is finally complete! This thing is absolutely massive! Our three-story Minecraft fort! We got the one, we got the two, we got the three, all of it! in one little Minecraft area. Absolutely massive. This actually might be the tallest fort we've ever built outside before. I mean, we've done three stories before, but never this tall and outside. I mean, you can almost touch the stars, Logan. There were stars out, there's, there's not stars out. But why don't we go inside and check out the interior because we've done a lot with this Minecraft fort. As you can see over here, we have our workshop. We got everything we need for our crafting, cooking, smelting. We got the blast furnace, we've got a stone cutter. We even have a loom for creating awesome banners. Behind me though, is where things get more interesting. This is our chill area. This is where we got our beds as well as storage for a bunch of our equipment. We got our backpacks, shield over here. We even have our crafting table in case we need to craft anything. And behind me, I've got my armor stand. So I can place my armor over there and leave it looking nice and tidy while I sleep during the night. Under here, we have some extra storage area. It's actually a lot of storage area. So that's underneath the second and third story. So it's a little scary. I mean, I wouldn't want to sleep under there, but it's definitely a cool place. We haven't really filled it in yet. So if you guys have any ideas, maybe we could do like an enchanting room in there. All right, let's head upstairs. We got the two story and the three story. We've got our chest behind us with all of our awesome goodies. We're keeping it up here on the second story. And on the third story, we have our smoker and some awesome glowstone, which you guys know I love my glowstone. I got it from the nether yesterday. We also got our bow and arrow up here. So if we're looking out the top third story, we get a great vantage point on anyone coming towards the base. We can take them out with the bow in case they get too close. And guys, check out how awesome the third story view is. Okay, so we come up to the third story. So oh, we are standing on the third story of our fort and it is the perfect lookout for any enemies approaching. Like who's that? Phil. What's Friendly Phil doing here? I guess we should go say hi. He's just kind of standing there. Well, Friendly Phil, what's going on here? You're not coming back to ruin our fort again, are you? No, Jay. I've come to join the team. Well, you guys did all vote in the comments, and it looks like everyone wants Friendly Phil to join our team, even though he's been working with the dragon, and he destroyed our fort twice, not to mention locked me up in prison. I, I guess... don't think he's that bad, Jake. Fine. You know what? Fine. I guess Friendly Phil gets to join the team. Don't high-five him. All right, friendly Phil, you're on the team, but you gotta pull your weight around here. I found this treasure map. I thought you could use it. Whoa, 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 whoa. This might just be another trap, friendly Phil. What do you mean treasure map? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, so you're telling me that this is some sort of treasure map and not a trap. It says treasure right there. I traded a villager for it. You got your house on here, Phil. And the dragon. Yeah, that's where he lives. He's a bad man. We don't need to go there. The only problem is, Phil, where are we on this map? Well, we're somewhere. So we have half a treasure map, and maybe a treasure that isn't even a treasure, just another trap. Oh, I swear it is. The villager gave it to me. Jake, I think we should go after this. I mean, it says treasure right there. Why don't we just try? 
I mean, yeah, if it is a real treasure, then it definitely has resources we could use to take on the dragon. The only problem is we're gonna need to complete the map, which means I need to get farming and I need paper. Also, what kind of treasure is this, Phil? Is it buried? Of course it's buried, it's treasure. All right, if it's buried treasure, we don't wanna be out there for too long, which means we're gonna need a way to excavate the ground. I got it. We use TNT. You got Jake, a gunpowder? We could just use a shovel. No, 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 Logan. If we're gonna do this, we do this right. We don't want to sit there digging for hours and hours on end. What we need to do is gather TNT. But Jake, what if you blow up the treasure? That's a risk we're going to have to take. Here, how about this? I'll start working on gathering paper. It's a very hard and meticulous job. While you go fight a bunch of creepers. Well, what's Phil going to do? Here, Phil. Use a stick and some wood. Make a fire. OK, perfect. I can do that. All right, we all have our jobs. Well, let's get to them. All right guys, so while Logan's off battling creepers, getting us some gunpowder, I've got the extremely dangerous and hard task of creating paper. So I went ahead and gathered some of our sugar cane here, and right now it's not that big, so I'm gonna go ahead and plant it and grow it a little bit so that we can get some nice paper. So I'm gonna plant this one here. There we go. That should grow nice and big beside our water here. And I've got another one so we can get even more paper. Plant you right next to it, and there we go. The water should be able to fertilize the sugar cane. It should grow nice and tall. And then we'll harvest it for some paper. We also need to build another map so we can expand onto the map we already have and figure out exactly where this treasure is. I wish I had Logan's job. It's probably so easy right now. And we got some gunpowder. One down and two to go. Come on, fire! I got one right there. All your mind, creeper. Some gunpowder. All we need is one more. All right, I don't see any creepers up there. None over here. Okay, where are you creepers? Fire! We got another one. And we have the last bit of gunpowder. Oh, Phil, you need to make this fire. You need to impress Papa Jake. Come on, Phil, come on! Alright, well I think enough time's passed for our sugar cane to grow. Why don't we go ahead and check on it and see how it's done. Oh guys, look at this. It has grown super big! Alright, now all I need to do is harvest this and bring it to the crafting table to make paper. There we go. Now time to make some paper. Now we're at our crafting table here. It's time to convert our bamboo into some paper. So all we need to do is one, two, three. Ooh, and there we go, guys. We got ourselves some paper. I'm gonna go ahead and craft a new map right now, and hopefully we'll be able to use that map to expand on the treasure map and figure out where this treasure is. Once we have Logan's gunpowder, we can build our very first TNT block. And there we go, guys. The map is officially complete. Now that's what I call hard work. Oh, Logan, you're back. That was crazy, Jake. I had to take on three creepers. I mean, yeah, that, that, oh, you got the gunpowder, nice. I mean, yeah, I was, I was doing a lot of hard work too. I had to build this map and, and farm for the paper to get to build the map. But look, Logan, I figured out where we are. See, that's where the treasure is, where Friendly Phil's saying the treasure is. And we are all the way over here, off the map, through the forest, and that's where our house is. So all we need to do is, Jake. It looks like you just drew this. No, no, that's a uh, Minecraft map. So all we need to do is head east, through here, pass through the forest, and then take a sharp turn north, and X marks the spot. Okay, well then, what are we waiting for, Jake? Well, all we need to do is take your gunpowder you got us, and build ourselves a little bit of TNT. I'll grab the sand we have from the chest, and go over to our crafting table, and make our very first TNT block. Had our gunpowder, there we go. And with the magic tap, we should have some TNT in three, two, one, whoa! And we got ourselves some TNT! Careful with that. Oh, dude, this thing's heavy. Uh, Okay, probably the most dangerous thing we could possibly have inside of our fort, but we've got it. Now all we need to do is follow the treasure map into the scary forest, find where the X marks the spot, place this... Maybe we don't slap the TNT. Place this down, activate it, and watch our treasure come to life. It's officially time to go find ourselves a treasure. I've geared up completely with my diamond armor, got a shield, got a sword. Shield. Well, I'm going to be using it for today in case we get into some epic action. And we've got our map, which is a little big and massive, but all we need to do is travel from here all the way down here. So we got a lot of ground to cover and a lot of forest to get through, so I think we should head out now and try and find this treasure. All right guys, enjoy! Well, if my map's correct, and I'm pretty sure it is, 
we are heading in the right direction. We're back in the forest of Minecraft. Now, I don't know if exactly this is gonna be marked with an X, so we might just have to start digging around, but we do have to be careful. Last time we were in these woods, we ran into some bad people. It should be right around here, which means the treasure should be just up ahead and to our right, probably somewhere in this forest here. Oh no, we got company. Jake, he looks really mad. Yeah. Wait, wait, it's my area. Whoa, 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 whoa. Ah, you guys here for the treasure? It's my treasure. No, it, it's our <laughs> treasure. Oh, that was a close one. Looks like we're not the only ones who know about this treasure. All right, Jake, let's be fast. I don't want other people coming. The treasure should just be in here. Come on, guys. All right. Now, if my treasure finding skills are correct, and they normally are, treasure should be just under here. Yeah, this looks suspicious. All right, let's set the TNT up and blow this thing. All right, guys, we got the TNT. Time to place this very carefully. Okay. Now, once I ignite this thing, Logan, we need to run and get back. All right, here we go. In three, two, one, run! Oh. Oh, that was a big bang. What's that? Dude, check it out. It must be the treasure. It completely blew the top layer off. I guess Friendly Phil was right. There really was a treasure here. Oh, Logan, we're in business. Oh, we got diamonds, enchanting books, eggs, milk. Okay, that comes in handy. Not to mention some potions. All right, we need to get this back to our base and fast. I wonder what we can make with those eggs. Logan, Logan, you got something behind you. It's a skeleton. Oh, you're mine. Careful, Logan. Okay. Took down that guy pretty easily. Let's grab the supplies and get back to base. We need to start using this stuff if we're gonna take on the Ender Dragon. Jake, we have one more skeleton. Oh, I got this one, Logan. No, Jake, I got this one. Ah, this bread is so hard. Ow, ow, it really, really hurts. I don't know bread had so many uses in Minecraft. Well, I got your sword. Maybe I can have a dual-wielding sword with a shield. Something pretty cool. Ow. All right, well, let's get back to base. We got a long way to go. All right, guys, we just made it back to home base after us securing, I think, one of the greatest chests we have ever found in real life Minecraft. That was also a crazy battle. That was. We, we did have a massive battle, but it's only to prepare us, Logan, for taking on the Ender Dragon. Everybody we fight now is just more XP to use against the Ender Dragon. Uh, friendly Phil? Phil, what's going on, man? Hey, Phil, you don't have our fire made yet? You've been working on this all day. Oh, hey, guys. Yeah, I'm almost there. I'm almost there. What do you mean you're almost there? It's been like three hours. Phil, you're just still using the stick? Yeah, guys, making fire's not as easy as it looks. I, I don't think you're doing it right. All right, you know what, fine. I'll just use my flint and steel make us a fire. Thanks for trying, though, Phil. I mean, you at least you did something. I'm sorry, guys. Did I mess up again? No, you, you didn't mess up, Phil. It's fine, okay? I'll just use the flint and steel on the fire over here. And there you go. You got yourself a fire. Is it just me or is anybody else hungry? Yeah, as much as I'd love to sit by this fire and warm up, we haven't eaten all day. Maybe we should go inside and use some of the stuff we gathered from that chest, make some dinner. <sighs> Alright guys, home sweet home. Got my armor all nice and put up on my armor stand here. Logan's got his bed over there. Oh wow guys! This place is huge! Yeah. I've never been in a fort this size! Yeah, it, uh, it is definitely huge. We worked a lot on it. Uh, one question. Yeah? Where's my bed? Ah, uh, you are going to sleep under there. Right now we only have two beds. I mean, I'm good anyway. I'm not used to a fort this big. All right, friendly Phil, we'll put you under the second story there. I like to call it the basement. It is the luxurious part of the fort, okay? So you're gonna be very nice and happy down there. Sounds good to me. So where do we eat? Well guys, considering I found some milk as well as eggs inside the chest that we got, I think it's time that I go Papa Jake Chef Aboyardee. Now we've had chicken, we've had apples, we've had watermelon, we've even had bread. But today, I'm gonna be using those milk and eggs to make us a little surprise. All right, so over here, guys, in the workshop, we've got all of our nice Minecraft stuff. As you've seen, we got the furnace, we got the loom, and what we're gonna be doing today is making a Papa Jake specialty. So we're gonna grab our eggs that we got from our chest, plop them here in the furnace like so, 
Once we've got the eggs inside the furnace, we add some fresh milk straight from the cow. Now with a little bit of magic, setting this furnace up here to a good 360 degrees Fahrenheit, we should be good to make my specialty. And after a couple of minutes, my Papa Jake specialty is complete. I present to you Le Cake de la Fasse. Made fresh from those two eggs and a little bit of milk, super easy to do at home. And now we have, oh, an also oh good cake to fill up our hearts and our stomach. Wait, Jake, you made that? Oh yeah, Logan, check it out. It's got cherries and everything. Don't mind if I do. Whoa, 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 Logan, Logan, Logan. We're civilized people in Minecraft, okay? You can't just eat it like that. We've got knives and forks. Um, that's a great cake! Dig in, bro! I mean, I like these rules! See, Phil's got the hang of it! Everyone, grab a piece of cake! Mmm, okay, where well, go? Jake, that is not how cake is supposed to be eaten. That's how we eat and pop it up for. Oh, I ate too much cake, Logan. My stomach's kind of hurting a little bit. Definitely ate too much cake. You ate, you ate a good amount though, right? Like I ate maybe like one slice and you ate the rest? I didn't have any cake. Oh yeah, that might explain why I have so much cake in my tummy. All right guys, well, thanks for the cake. I guess I'll be going to bed now. See you in the morning. Good, good night, friendly fell. Good night. I guess now that we're done dinner, it's time to hit the hay. Wake up tomorrow and get back to working on the fort, gathering resources, you know, all the Minecraft stuff. Maybe I'll make another cake for breakfast. Close the door so we don't get any creepers or an enderman coming. Oh, oh no. Logan, get down quickly! Jake, the dragon! It's Frank Fire! Get away from the windows! Let's hope this castle holds! Looks like he's flying away. He knows where we are. That might have just been a preliminary attack. He's probably testing our fortress. I've got no armor on. We need armor, enchanted swords, all the resources we can get. And to do that, we need materials. Yeah, and he'll be back sooner than later. Okay, I think right now what we need to do is gear up, gather all the resources we can, build our armor, build our weapons, so when he comes back for the final battle, we can take him out. Let's start by mining some stone. Check it out, I've got this sweet brand new Minecraft armor custom made for this battle. It might not be diamond, it might not be steel, but it's better than all of that. It's cardboard. Okay, Jake, that's pretty cool, but maybe it's time to make me some armor. All right, let's get Logan some armor. Three, two, one, boom. Well, we got you some brand new custom Ooh, Minecraft armor. That's looking pretty sweet, Jake. Oh yeah, it's box armor, dude. All right, my own. Are you kidding me, Jake? Uh, Logan doesn't look like that armor fits it very well. Maybe, you maybe, maybe he's gotta, you gotta push, you gotta, you gotta push, you gotta push through. Jake, my head doesn't fit you through the armor. You gotta head, dude. You gotta, you gotta push your head through. My head's not gonna fit. All right, well, Logan's gonna try and get his armor on. I'm gonna start crafting some more for me. Three, two, one, boom! We got ourselves a diamond sword. Come on, Jake, not fair. Okay, uh, craft me a helmet at least. All right, here we go. Three, two, one. All right. There you go. Really, Jake, this is my armor? Diamond-infused styrofoam helmet. It's one of a kind. Capable of withstanding greater forces than you've ever seen. So I have a chest plate that doesn't fit and a goofy-looking helmet. Logan, that helmet is gonna save you in this battle. Now it's time for my helmet. In three, two, one! Hoo -hoo -hoo. Here we go. Jake, why do you get such a cool-looking helmet? So I'm gonna be taking the dragon head on. <sighs> now, I should be protected against the dragon's fire, as well as against any mobs that come after us. I think we're looking more and more ready to take on this battle. All right, guys, we're all geared up and ready to go. We got our armor on, we got our helmets, we got our swords, and we're ready to take on the dragon. Once he's here, I've got a plan to take him out. Oh no, we got skeletons. The dragon shows himself, then we'll make our attack. Come on, let's take the skeletons out. Let's go, let's take him out. Jake, we gotta be on the lookout. There could be more. Yeah, we got another one coming. Take him out. Ah. Woo! Another one down. Oh no, Jake, we got creepers. Here, Close. take my bow. Pass it. All right, creeper. Ah. Where's the dragon? He's not showing himself yet. He's just sending his minions to do his bidding. You guys will never beat the dragon. Oh no, we got a creeper. I got this one. Ah. 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 Ah, you broke my armor. Uh, ah, ah. He broke my armor. Jake, the dragon's gonna be coming any minute. Oh no. 
I think you spoke too soon, Logan. And do you hear the dragon's battle cry? It sounds awful. Oh, it's friendly Phil. Friendly Phil, what's going on? The dragon! The dragon's here! The dragon! I know, I know, the we're gonna stop him. Listen, friendly, friendly, friendly Phil, friendly Phil, listen to me, okay? The listen dragon! To me. We're gonna take out the dragon, but I'm gonna need your help, okay? No, no, I'm going inside. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I want you to go inside. Listen. Okay, okay, I'll do it, Jake. All right, now get inside. Jake, Close what did you tell him? Don't worry, I got a plan to take down the dragon. Jake, I'll distract the dragon. It's now or never. Ugh. Let's do this, dragon. These flames are too strong. We just need to hold them at bay. I've got friendly Phil working on something. Logan, hit him with your arrow. All right, Jake, I got him. Nice shot, Logan. Phil, I'm gonna need you now. Jake, I got the TNT. Hey, Logan, distract him. I'm going in. TNT's placed! We did it! We actually defeated the dragon, Logan! We actually beat the dragon! Dude, it's gone! We saved Minecraft! Where's Friendly Phil? He'll be so happy! Is he, is he gone? Yeah, we did it, Friendly Phil! We beat the dragon! You guys saved Minecraft! I knew you could do it! Took us a little Can while, but we did it! Up, up. Yeah. We're gonna have to build our houses so we can sleep. I was thinking, okay, we do a build off, a house build off. Ooh, Jake versus Logan. Oh, I get this, I get it, okay. The rules of Minecraft week are simple. You gotta eat Minecraft food, and to get resources, you gotta pretend you're Minecraft. So, like, if you want wood, you have to go to a tree and get the wood. Jake, yes, that is extremely creepy. I have reached my final form. I am Mega Steve now. All right, well, Logan's right. We have to do everything as we would in Minecraft. So guys, we gotta get building. We're staying out here. We will no longer be going into that house. Goodbye, house. We're in Minecraft now. Let's grab some resources and start building. All right, guys, so we have headed over into the nearest forest so we can start gathering some resources for our houses. I mean, obviously, I'm gonna have the better house. That's not true, Jake. I already have a stick. That's great, Logan. You don't have a stick. I know I don't have a stick. What are you doing? Ow. Whoa, what are these holes? Ow, stop. <laughs> I'm gonna get some wood from an actual tree. Ow, kinda hurts. All right, so we're gonna gather as many resources as possible because I'm gonna be building a massive base on this first run. All right, Logan, I'm willing to make a really good deal with you, okay? How about you go find us some stone and I will trade you some sticks and a crafting table. That way we can both get pickaxes and axes. Well, I don't really need any sticks, but I will use your crafting table. You already have sticks? How many sticks do you have? I want to have more than you. Right, you know what? I'm building a crafting table right now. One, two, three. Ooh, there we go. Crafting table time. All right, now let's build ourselves I need a wood pickaxe. All right, guys, Logan has gone all the way down there to try and get some stone. I've got my crafting table, so I need to go ahead and start making something so that we... Uh-oh. Logan? Oh, no, no, no. We got a zombie, and I've got nothing on me. All right, looks like it's fist is on. Oh, okay, okay. Okay. Logan, I really could use you. Oh, this actually isn't that bad. Ugh. Oh, we got him. And look what he drops. A brand new axe. All right, looks like things are looking up for me. Logan, I got an axe. Okay. All right, well guys, if we're gonna be making this build extra big, we need a lot of wood, so. Luckily for me, he dropped a stone ax, so I think it's time to gather a bunch of resources. Whew, all right, I got a lot of wood. Look at how you do going for getting stones. I got a couple. Can I see the stones? Ooh, all right, well, I can use these to make a pickaxe. Stay right here. All right, stones go into the crafting table. Wood goes into the crafting table, and one, two, three! Woohoo! We got ourselves a stone pickaxe. Ooh, we're one step closer to I'll getting diamond. No. Ow! Jake! Oh, it's just a pickaxe, come on. I say we use our axe and our pickaxe and mine as much as possible before going home, and then we split whatever materials we get. All right, all right, I like it. How about that? I'll go with the pickaxe, you go with the axe, you get as much wood, I'll get as much stone, building supplies that I can find, and then we'll go back home. We'll split our separate ways and start building. Before we go, there's a zombie. Okay, Logan, you got this. Take him out. Oh, did you drop anything? No, he didn't drop anything. All right, Jake, into the forest we go. Now, 
I've been looking around for a cave, but the only problem is I wore flip-flops, and flip-flops aren't good for caves, so. And I don't have any armor if we run into some bad guys. So I'm gonna, ooh, looky, looky what we got here. Already some coal. Oh, there it is. Logan. Jake, you found coal? I got coal, check it out. What? Ooh. Jake, we can cook food with this. We can smelt iron. You know what they say, Logan? Coal is the building block of life. I think someone said that. A science person once said that. Jake, there's more. Ooh, we got some more. Logan, I do not have feather falling on. If I fall down there, it's actually like end game. Okay, wait, I'm gonna mine the coal. You get ready and get it collected down there. How about that? We're working as a team here, Logan. All right, coal's coming down. Logan, collect all of it. Go get it. All right, I said we head back, Logan. We got a lot of coal. We got a lot of wood. We got a lot of stone. Logan's got the coal. I think we're ready to start building our houses. All right guys, so we're back at the house. I got a crafting table and it's time to get some wooden planks. All right, let's get our planks in three, two, one. Oh, guys, check it out. We got a lot of wooden planks and I think I'm gonna build my house right here in the sun. Ah, beautiful Minecraft sun. Hopefully Jake builds his house a little further away so we don't have any noise from him or you know, just, we don't really have to see him. And guys, if you think my base is gonna be better than Jake's, put a hashtag Logan in the comments down below and smash that thumbs up button. Let's get all the likes for Logan. All right guys, so Logan's gonna be building over there, but I'm gonna be building my amazing base right here. This is gonna be Jake, the most- Jake. Whoa, you're building here? Well, yes, Logan, I'm building here. No. This is my land. No, this I'm building Jake's right land. there. Logan, I am king of this land. I am king Papa no, no, Jake. No, no. Jake, Jake, this is Logan's land. Subject. No, no. Yes, you are a peasant that gets to build over there. Jake, and I am not a peasant. This is gonna be Papa Jake's kingdom, Logan. I am the king. I should wear a crown when I walk around. Well, guys, we're just gonna have to see I'll, whose I'll house is you, better. I think I think they know that Logan's land it's gonna you be look, better. You look like a llama farmer. I look amazing. I don't know about that, but guys, my house is gonna have so much cool stuff. We're gonna have secret entrances. We're gonna have secret hideout places. I'm gonna be building with redstone. I'm also gonna have a mine and maybe even a well. But don't tell Logan. I'm gonna dig underground under his base. I'm gonna plant TNT under there. I, I was also able to make a stone shovel so we can use this to grab some grass blocks because I wanna make my exterior good too. So I'm gonna go over here to where Logan's building. Yeah, there we go. What, what, what? Jake, what are I'm you? just taking some grass. Jake. <laughs> Leave me alone. All right, it turns out Jake is building right next to us. So that is totally not cool, but we're just gonna have to outbuild him. Let's do this. Ah, how are ya? It's Papa Jake here. And I just wanted to take a couple seconds to remind y'all about something I like to call integrity. See, I know a lot of you kids like to build your farms automated with redstone, water, pistons, heck, even auto breeding farms. But here, Papa Jake, well, he believes in something called integrity. That's why I build all my farms the proper way, the old fashioned way. You see, when I get my hands dirty, I get them dirty. I plant each and every crop with love, and I harvest every single crop, put them on my Minecraft table, and then I truly know that every single piece of food I eat in Minecraft is made with integrity. Integrity? Logan, I'm trying to give a spiel here about integrity and you're ruining it. Having a villager build your house isn't integrity. What? That has nothing to do with farming. I'm talking about farming integrity, Logan. Too many people are making auto farms. I do it the old fashioned way. I'm just saying, if you're gonna say you're, you have integrity, it doesn't really make sense to hire a villager when we're having a competition of who can build the better base. You're not building a better base. Whoa, 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 we're, we're playing Minecraft and, and I hired this villager with emeralds that I found. Huh? Jake, you don't, you don't have any emeralds. <laughs> I'm gonna have emeralds. No, 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 wait, where are you going? No, no, wait, wait, no, I'll get, I'll have emeralds. See what you did? No, that, that, that's, that's called not having integrity, Jake. All right, get back to building your own base. So far, the base is going pretty well. We got a cool shape going to our fort. But I don't really know what Jake's doing. He kind of disappeared. I think he's up to something. So I decided to take a little break from building my epic Minecraft house to come over here and work on what is going to be my secret mine shaft. I don't know how Logan's going to be getting his resources, but I don't want him knowing where I'm building mine. So I'm going to be building it over here. We're also going to be needing redstone because I have a lot of really cool ideas on how to add to my base and make it top secret because I don't want Logan coming over and stealing my diamonds or anything like that. And of course, guys, there is so much to do in Minecraft. If you have any ideas on what we should do, make sure to comment down below what you'd like to see, whether it be adding on to our base or an adventure 
we should go on? Should we go to the nether? Should we go explore underwater? You guys comment down below and you get to decide how long this series goes on if every one of these videos gets 20,000 likes. So smash that like button, but let's start building our mine. I don't know if you guys can see this, but we've been trying to get in here. I've been trying to find anything like more coal or especially any iron that we can smelt. I think I saw something here, but it kind of got covered in dirt. Although what I did get was a grass block that I can give to Logan. Because technically I stole his grass block, so I'll put this over here. That's going to go back to Logan. And we're going to keep going until I find some iron. All right, guys, I have been mining for a while now. I've actually been able to gather a pretty decent amount of resources. I've got a bunch of stone. I've also got some iron that I can smelt. Luckily, we have some coal, so that's pretty good. I mean, right now, this doesn't look like a lot. I mean, it's, it's kind of small. Like, my foot can barely even really go in this mine shaft. But trust me, guys, this is the start of something big, okay? Eventually, this mine shaft will go all the way from this little hill over into my base, under Logan's base, to plant TNT. Maybe we'll even find the end fortress inside my mine shaft so i'm gonna uh, go back to building working on my house because logan's been working on it the whole time but at least we gathered some extra resources and logan doesn't know about the secret mine shaft here and just like that guys we have the floor plan to my awesome minecraft house so now we gotta put on a roof we gotta add a bed a kitchen all right guys the house is starting to look pretty good we're working on the second story now i still have a ton of stuff to do like putting the windows on and everything like that but i thought we would give logan his present you know we got from our secret mine shaft so hey logan Remember how I stole your grass? No, 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 All right, no, 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 no. Jake. Well, I, re I returned your grass. I demand you get a broom. It's just a little messy. No. But the, no, it's, it's good. It's, it's dirt. It, ow, ow. No, 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 Logan. Do not throw dirt Jake. blocks at people. That is, no, no. I will throw this There's at you. in that. All right. I'd say, uh, makes us even. the finishing touches on my roof and then we are officially ready to start building the insides of our house and we are done our roof and I think I'm gonna leave this as like a little skylight because I'm thinking we put our bed here then we have a skylight and in the morning the Sun comes up shines right through here we get woken up plus guys we can see the stars Oh, Jake, yeah. fancy house. Thank you. Still working on it. Just you working on my little path here. All by yourself? I did indeed. King Papa Jake needs a nice house. So far, guys, we haven't had any trouble. No zombies, no creepers. It's not nighttime, so nothing too scary's happened. But guys, remember, we are sleeping here, so we do got to be ready for an attack. Yeah, guys, we are surviving out here for as long as every video gets 20,000 likes. So, I mean, if you guys keep liking these videos, we could be out here. You have something on your shirt. Uh, that's probably from killing the zombie. We could be out here, Logan, for, for seven months. Maybe nine, maybe 12, maybe four year, 14 years we might be here still, Logan. So you better make your house good. All right, guys, my house is pretty much done. We have our Minecraft bed, Minecraft sheets, pillow. We got a chest. It's pretty simple, pretty basic house, but you know, we just got the necessities because it is day one. And trust me, guys, we're gonna be doing a lot more. Getting resources, building bases. So far, our village is looking pretty sweet. We got Jake's house, got my front porch here. And uh, I do have one thing I wanna craft. Go into our chest, we got some sticks, and we got a piece of coal. Because it's getting dark, I wanna make a torch. So, put our stick, put our coal, and we should have a torch. And just like that, we have ourselves a torch. Guys, check it out. So when it gets night, we can turn it on and we can have light. All right, I'm gonna leave that right here. The only problem with using coal, guys, is your hands get really dirty. Let's go see what Jake's up to. Jake? Yes? What's going on? I, I wanna see your house. Nothing. What do you mean nothing's going on? I'm asleep. You're waking me up. I'm sleeping in my bed. Quite the space you got here, Jake. Well, yeah, I, I spent most of my time working on it. Uh, you know, this is my casa, my house, my castle. It's everything that you could possibly want in a Minecraft house. Now, Logan, you need to leave because I can't show you some of the stuff in the house. What, what do you mean you can't show There's me? There's some secret stuff in here, dude. This is my Minecraft. Are you get out there? All right, guys, check it out. So we got our... 
We got our house here, and basically it is not complete. Because as you guys know, this is the first day of Minecraft week. I want to do everything proper, and getting a lot of the resources, I mean, we still need redstone, we still need gold, we still need diamond, there's a lot to do, and even though I didn't focus a ton on the building of the house, I think I did pretty well. I mean, I got a mine going, I got the house going pretty well, and over here... This is super secret, that's why I couldn't have Logan see it. This is the secret room where I'm gonna store all of my items. I'm gonna have a bunch more secret rooms in this house. I don't know how I'm gonna cover it yet. It might be like a redstone piston setup where it like moves a bookshelf or something like that, but that's gonna be coming very soon once we get some redstone. But another thing I worked on, check this out. Okay, get out of here, this is top secret stuff. I'm not looking at your Minecraft base. Go back to your home, go sleep in there. All right, guys, check this out. Another thing that I worked on was I actually went ahead and I made the well. So over here, we've got our well full of water, which if we start growing our crops, which I want to do, we can just come on over here, grab a bucket of water, and then we can start laying down crops. I've also got the robe that I'm working on here. It's looking pretty good so far. And I think exterior wise, the house is looking pretty sweet. We're almost here, Rando. We almost found the dragon's lair. I can smell it, little buddy. We are going to get him back. There it is, Randall. The dragons respawn there. Now we can respawn the dragon. If he can help us, they will no longer make fun of me for my upside down face. Let's place the crystals. And now for the dragon egg. You are going to save Minecraft for us. Respawn! <laughs> It's working, Randa! The dragon is coming back to life! My son, I thank you. You have chosen to respawn me from my slumber. I, the Ender Dragon, will destroy all of Minecraft. And we get to help, right, Mr. Dragon? I guess you, you, you could help as well because you're respawning me. You hear that, Randa? Anyway, let me finish. They will see my terror as I grow into the beast I once was. And no one will make fun of me anymore, right, Mr. Dragon? Why, why, why was everyone making fun of you? Because I make all my Minecraft forts out of dirt, not wood. You, you make your forts out of dirt? That's just... Okay, never mind. Let's just keep the ritual going. I have come back to life and I live. Yes, yes. Grow, dragon, grow! We will be unstoppable! So far, today's been a little bit uneventful. We've just been doing some house chores and some stuff. Oh, guys, check it out. There's a spider. That's kind of cool. You know what? I think I'm going to call him Ted. He's going to be my new pet spider. He's going to live on my house. Ted the spider. Hey, Jake. Jake. Jake, you got to see this. There's a spider. Did someone say spider? Where is he, Logan? I got him. Jake, no. Ah. Whew. Hey, that was my pet spider. You can't have a pet spider. I was gonna name him Ted the Spider. They try to eat you, Logan. They're bad enemies in Minecraft. Have you not learned that yet? Well, now we got some string, so I mean, at least we can use this to build something. There's lots of stuff you can build with string, like paintings. And as you can see, we've already done some building. Uh, the only thing we don't have is a Minecraft shower. I can tell Logan has definitely not used the Minecraft shower. But I do have a well. See, Logan? You can take a bath in our well. We have a big day planned. We've done a lot of upgrades, but we still are so small in comparison to Minecraft. I mean, they're still going to the nether. There's... What? I caught a fish. I, I literally just caught a fish. So good for you, Logan. That's what you could also build with the string is a fishing rod. Ow! Don't hit me with the fish. It's not a weapon. We have to eat it. Okay, well, we found some food for tonight, I guess. Okay guys, but we still have a lot to do. So I'm thinking today we expand our bases a little bit. We gotta get back to mining. We gotta get collecting resources. Logan just left. This is a perfect opportunity to show you guys my super secret mine, which I've been working on. I guess so Logan doesn't know about this mine, but this is where we're gonna be finding all of our diamonds. You see, Logan thinks he's gonna be getting diamonds from, I don't know, a cave or maybe trading it or something like that. No, no, no. This is where we get diamonds. All last night I've been digging. You guys probably saw this in the last episode. It was really small. Well, now we have gotten even bigger. I found more iron. I found more- Jake! 
This is our backyard. This I know we're taking Minecraft week seriously, but you can't just dig a mine shaft in our backyard. That is a secret mine shaft that you were not supposed to know about. I am going to be using it to find resources like gold and diamonds. Sometimes I just don't know where Jake comes up with these ideas. As you guys know, we're trying to build a city and I think Jake, it might be smart to combine our houses. Buy our houses below, and that means you're gonna be using all my resources up. Yeah, but dude, if we work together, we can get so much further ahead. We can build bigger stuff. Yeah, well, I guess we are trying to build a city, guys. And I mean, you know, there are a lot of mobs in Minecraft now. It's not just creepers and skeletons you gotta worry about. There's zombie villagers. There's those weird little things that fly around. They look like manta rays. I mean, even pandas are kind of scary if you think about it. They're basically bears. Jake, you just found a potato? Genuinely, guys, like, Jake just found this potato in that hole. I told you. This time, I'm Papa Jake the farmer, and I'm doing everything with integrity. Stop cutting my potato! We need this to start our potato farm. How did we find a potato? We're gonna have a potato farm, a watermelon farm, sugarcane farm, bamboo farm. Not, not beetroot farm, because no one likes, no one likes beets. Okay, guys, so I think it would be super awesome to have a second story here that you come out here, you have the second story, and it takes you inside the ocean. We gotta start this expansion now. I think we gotta move the house over here, build the second story, have the balcony that goes out into the Ooh, pool. Can we have a fishing area? Of course. All right, and we should have a tunnel between my house and your house, so it's like Ooh, one big super house. Mine shaft. I like this. Okay, well, I just got a lot of resources, so we uh, can- could... Jake, who's that? Uh, I actually have Jake, absolutely why, why no idea. Why is he idea. walking like that? I, I don't know, Logan, and all I have on me is this hoe. Excuse me, sir. What do you want? Uh, Jake, what's he saying? Speaking villager, Logan. A language I'm quite familiar with. And by quite, I mean not very much, but I'll try to reply to him. Uh... Uh, Jake, what did you just say? He I, uh, sounds kind of mad. To be What's quite honest with you, I, I couldn't tell you. Maybe he's bending over Whoa, here. Whoa! No! Ow! Oh, stop shooting with your arrows! Ow! All right, all I have is this stick, so I'm gonna have to use this to take you out. Maybe you can just reason with what him. What do you mean, reason with reason? him? Oh, no! Uh, 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 oh. See, Logan, not that bad. Jake, that was bad. Okay, I guess it was kind of bad. I don't know what that guy's problem was, but look, he left a banner. Oh, look at that. I'm blue guy. Look, I'm all mad uh, and angry. Jake, what's this? Thing floating in the air? Huh, I don't know. Jake, I think that's a raid. You just started a raid. I did not just start a raid, okay? Yeah, I might have taken that guy out, but he had a problem with me. His people are gonna come for us now. Well, you know what? Then let them come for us, because they can come pick up their banner. Ooh, we should put it here. That looks sick. You just started a war. No, Logan, just keep building. It's Minecraft. There's no wars in Minecraft. Now, come on, let me hang this banger here. All right, Jake, whatever you say. I mean, I think this starts a war. No, I mean, look, they're going to look at that and be like, oh, you're on our side. Unless we get the red angry face guys, then they might not like the blue angry face guys, but that's a problem we'll deal with later. Logan, come on, we need to get the second story built. Jake is working on the second story right now, and I'm thinking we add a tunnel system that connects our houses. I've always dreamed of having a tunnel that goes from one house to the other. So today, we might have to cut a hole right there and make the secret tunnel all the way to Jake's place. Let's do it. All right, guys, so check it out. We've been working on the fort for a while now, and Logan is currently working on a secret tunnel, which is gonna be going from my kind of utility slash crafting room. Uh, I've also got my bench set up here, and I've got some of the ore that I found. I also found some andersite, so that's kind of cool. Although, no one really uses andersite. It's kind of the lamest ore in Minecraft. But guys, check this out. I've been working on the second story, and look how cool this thing is. So you open this door here, and you head on outside, to the second story, AKA the patio, looking out onto the ocean. How sweet is this, guys? Over here, we've got a nice window looking outside. You know, you can see the ocean. We got a plant here, you know, my little book for reading. We got some glass panes. And this then- This place is sick. Right? And then over here, you can actually look down into the ocean so we could jump in here. We could also use this as a nice little fishing area. So, you know, I could sit back here, cast my fishing rod, catch some fish, or maybe just jump in there and look for some ocean monuments. But guys, it is 
starting to get kind of late and we have no food. And since we are only doing this Minecraft style, I thought now would be the perfect time to get started on my farm. I'm not really gonna be doing too much in terms of the farm today, but I thought I could probably grow us some wheat and make us some bread since that's probably the easiest thing to make in Minecraft. So I'm gonna go get my shovel, get my hoe, and then uh, grab a bucket and start working on the farm. All right guys, so I'm thinking for our farm, we build it here. So I'm gonna start hoeing the ground and then I'll be planting my seeds. So I've got the farm ready to be seeded. I've gone ahead here and used the hoe on all of the grass. So I'm gonna put the seeds in. But before I do that, we need to make a bucket because I need to put some water down the sides. You guys know how it is with Minecraft farming. So I'm gonna go take some iron ore and some of our coal and convert that into some iron ingots. Finally in the crafting room. And like I said, we do everything as you would do in Minecraft. So in order to craft this, we are going to need a block of coal, which I will handy dandy put in here. And then we'll just fill her up with a bunch of iron, like so. Ooh, and there it goes. It is on and cooking some iron for us. I think the first thing I'm gonna build is of course a sword, but then after that, I'm gonna build the bucket so I can get back to farming. But I'm gonna let this go for a little bit and I'll catch you guys in a second. Okay guys, so the furnace is done and we have a ton of iron ingots. We have about 16 of them. So we're gonna use these to craft our stuff. Let's uh, use three of these to make ourselves a nice little bucket. Like so. One, two, three. Ooh, and there we go. We got a bucket. Bucket. All right, next up, we'll get some more. We're only gonna need two this time, so we will place them like this. Here's our stick. In three, two, one. Ooh, and there we go. We got a nice iron sword. Now that is an upgrade that we have been needing. I'm gonna take my bucket, keep this iron sword on me, and I'm gonna go work on the uh, the crops, because as of right now, we have zero food. All right, guys, so I've got some wheat seeds here, so let's go ahead and start planting these. Plant some here. Ah. Some here, get some in the middle, cause I'll run the water down the two sides. And we got one left, so I'll plant it there. Now we just gotta grab some water. Luckily we have a massive ocean right here. All right, and there we go, guys. We've got our farm all nice and watered. We got the seeds in here. Now, if we can find some bone meal, which it is getting dark out, so the skeletons should be coming out, we should be able to grab some, and hopefully we can make some wheat very quickly. That way we can turn the wheat into bread, and then the bread goes in our tummies, and then we eat. I'm almost on the tunnel system, and let me tell you, it's gonna be sweet. Check it out, guys. We got a tunnel. We're almost finished it, connecting my house to Jake's. As you guys can see, we're at my bed, and you're probably thinking, it's just a bed but no open this hatch and we go inside the secret tunnel and all the way over there guys is Jake's house check it out we are in the mine shaft we're gonna test this out for the first time guys it's a little cramped but gets the job done you know at night creepers and skeletons and scary things come out so I don't really want to go outside I'd rather just use my tunnel and just like that we're inside Jake's house. Oh, that was really- Oh, oh my God. <laughs> I've never been so scared in my life. So it is officially dark out. And since we are surviving the night here, we decided that we would make a fire. Luckily, we still have our ax. So we are cutting up some wood that we are gonna use as firewood. And then hopefully if we get some food, we can cook it on the fire, which we still haven't gotten yet. All right, guys, we got the fire going. It's nice and warm. It lights up the backyard. Jake, I feel like I kind of hear something. Someone's, ow. An arrow just hit me. Uh, Logan, we got a skeleton moving fast. What do Wait. you mean, ah! Jake, I got a sword. All right, try to take him out. Jump, Logan. I think I got him. One more. Nice, dude. Took out that skeleton. Jake, I didn't like that guy. Oh, look what he dropped. We got some bones. Oh. What are we gonna do with bones, Jake? Oh, Logan, do you not know what we're gonna do with bones? We are gonna turn these bones into bone meal, and I am gonna be preparing us a nice dinner. See, we had to wait for my crops, but not with bone meal. We'll have some wheat in the next five seconds. Does wheat mean bread for dinner? It does indeed, Logan. Some homemade Papa Jake bread made with integrity. All right, guys, check it out. I used the bone meal, and we have some wheat grown instantly. Now all we gotta do is harvest it, and we'll have some bread in no time. Oh, check out all this wheat, guys. Homegrown. Now we just gotta put this in the oven and I'll make ourselves a baguette. And we're eating baguettes tonight, which honestly, out of all the Minecraft food, isn't that bad until we find some chicken or pigs or well, actually apples would be pretty good or a cake. Okay, well, that comes later. Tonight, it's bread. Guys, we're heading in to make some bread. Here, Logan, take the wheat. 
Oh, there we go. Jake, it's cooking. Oh, I can't wait for dinner. Ah. Oh, we got bread, Jake. Ooh, look at that, dude. We got some fresh oh, bread. A loaf of bread. Whoa, 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 whoa. Slow your roll there, bro. Jake, I'm starving. I can't need so We only have one bread. Give me the other side of the bread. Logan, you can't hog all the bread. Mm. Now that's bread made with integrity. All right, Jake, I think I'm gonna use my tunnel system to go back to my house, because honestly, I don't want to face any creepers, skeletons, or anything else dangerous out there. I think we're gonna get to bed though, guys, because it has been an extremely long day. All right, Jake, I'll see you in the morning, buddy. All right, in the tunnel we go. Oh, I can see my bed, and I can't wait to get inside. And we are back inside my house. Here we go. You guys can't see it, but I can see the stars. Like I said, I got my skylight. It is pretty sweet. I mean, <sighs> all right, guys, I'm going to head to bed. I will see you guys in the morning. Minecraft day three. Here we go. This is the Minecraft police. Put your hands up for friendly fail. Jake, 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 what, what? Jake, do you hear that? It sounds like there's music. Logan, why would there be music? We're in a mine shaft. Maybe it's a cave or something. We should keep mining. That's right, it's friendly Phil, I'm back again. Look at me, I'm chilling in my brand new den. Fuck the dragon, now he's gone for real. Thanks to Jake and Logan, my new life's unreal. Mining every day is what I do. Always on the lookout for you. Shining so bright and glowing so blue. I want that crispy diamond brand new. Shining so bright and glowing so blue. I want that crispy diamond brand new. Brand new. Brand new. I want that crispy diamond brand new. What are you guys doing here? What's going on in here? Friendly Phil? This is a closed recording session. Get out of here. Wait, wait, they're my friends. Who are these guys? It's Jake and Logan. They helped me save Minecraft. What, from the dragon? Yeah, from the dragon. It was awesome. What are you doing down here anyway? Guys, I'm recording my next song. I'm, I'm super famous now. Congrats, Phil. I, I know you, you did really well with your first song. I hope this one turns out. I've got so many diamonds and emeralds. I've got like four different houses. Yeah, he's super good. It's the next star of Minecraft. I mean, we're still looking for diamonds, but you know, that, that's good to know that you have so many. About that, I've heard that the dragon's actually back. I heard he burned down like two villages. No, that, that's impossible. We we took out the dragon. Yeah, no, no. We 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 took down the dragon. There is no more dragon in Minecraft. I heard it from Barry, who told me that he burned down two villages and the dragon's back. Okay, well, your friend's a liar. There's no dragons in Minecraft. Also, dude, you know you have a bad omen, right? Why are you even down here? Shouldn't you be defending your face or something? Jake, I told you you have a bad uh, omen. Oh, that's what that is. We're gonna have a raid, Jake. Okay, uh, yeah, you know what? Uh, there's probably gonna be a raid and it's probably going on in our base right now. You know what, you guys enjoy your song. We'll, uh, we'll see you later, Friendly Phil. They're probably raiding your base right now. Raiding your base? I'm out of here! See what you did? See what I have to work with here? Welcome back to another day in real life Minecraft, the series where we survive using only real life Minecraft items. Today we build the ultimate defense base using TNT, zombies, and much more to defend against an oncoming raid. Smash that like button, let's go for 25,000 likes for more awesome videos in real life Minecraft. It's the ice cream truck. Wait, no, Logan, you can't run after the ice cream truck. There's no ice cream in Minecraft. He's, he's gone. He just, he ran after the ice cream truck. There is absolutely no way we are breaking our rules. We are living, surviving, and only doing Minecraft. So we uh, we made some cuts to the whole uh, only Minecraft items only, but that's okay because we are back with a brand new episode of Minecraft Week. And if you guys don't know how this works, we are living and surviving in the world of Minecraft. You guys have absolutely been destroying that like button. We have been staying here and living in our Minecraft well, houses. You might see a big tent. That's because it rained and, and destroyed everything. Well, yeah, so originally we didn't know if you guys were gonna absolutely kill the like button, but you guys actually just, just kept hitting it. I mean, you, you all hit it a lot of times. I mean, you should keep doing 
doing that. In fact, you did it so much that we got a little scared and we're like, all right, this is gonna be a little long term. So we had to rebuild a little bit. We had to set up a tent because obviously rain is a thing in Minecraft. And Logan's house has been completely rebuilt. It pretty much has the same thing. I got a bed, I got a chest. I got some lights. The only thing we don't have now is the secret tunnel, which was pretty awesome. Yeah, guys, we are missing the secret tunnel, but that's okay. You know, we still got my massive fortress. Check this out, okay? I did change the location of my door. I still have my well going on over here, but we've got our door on the side here, which comes into a very spacious and nice room. I even got my window to look out. You know, we got a book here if I want to read that square rectangle square uh, and then the sun and over here we go through this door uh, this is my crafting room check this out guys so I've got an entire room dedicated to crafting I can add all of my new stuff I get in here like if I build an anvil or if I build a loom or if I build a smoker or if I build a furnace or if I, I there's a lot to build in Minecraft you guys get the point I also did make the little hole here for when we do make our tunnel system that goes between me and Logan's house and on top of that we have a ton of room to expand because we want to turn this into a full-fledged Minecraft craft village but like we said guys this is hardcore survival okay we can only eat food that is in minecraft we can only build items that we find materials for all right so today guys we are going to be building the jake what was that that logan is an arrow and i actually do not know where that came from that could be a friendly arrow that's jake, okay there is another is one friendly logan we got we got a problem that guy might have been right there might be a massive raid coming this way okay jake, i told you Logan, come on in here quickly jake what are we gonna do uh, about this guy okay well i have a sword and here you have a shovel a shovel well, that's all i had logan i didn't have enough time to build anything else no. he ah, hit me okay jake we logan, just gotta I have go no in armor. Here. i gotta eat something to restore my heart it's really shell. Come on, we gotta go. Okay, you know what? That's it. It's fight time. Come here. Oh no. Oh, oh, look, I got him. He's got a diamond sword. Oh. Ah. Oh. oh no, oh no, oh no, no, no. His sword's way better than mine. Logan, do something with the shovel. How's that better than my sword? I don't know. Look, that's probably not the last of them. That guy said that a big raid was coming and they are not taking, ow, ow, stop doing that. They're not taking over our village. I worked too hard on that. I told you that once you trigger a raid, they're gonna come after us. And we're gonna come after them. I think we need to build a better defense system. Oh no, look, we got another one, hold on. Jake, I think I got him. I got him with the shovel. How is that better than this? Here. All right. Okay, yeah, you, you get the shovel. All right, I okay. see how it is. Look, there's gonna be more coming. Round one over, starting round two. Wait, what, 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 what do they mean round one over, starting round two? Logan, we are not prepared for round two. We I were barely prepared you. for round one. How many rounds are there? We need to build an ultimate Minecraft defense base. There's like a million numbers in the world. Jake, we're gonna need strategies. Okay. I'm thinking like 10 different defense systems. You just need to calm down, Logan. You're the one. Calm down. You're the one freaking out. Right, okay, I have an idea. We need to build up our base Jake, and get defense. That's my idea. I just said that. Logan, everyone shares ideas, okay? If it's your idea, it's my idea, it's everyone's idea. We need to build up our base defenses and get ready for the biggest raid of all time. I'm thinking fences. I'm thinking pistons. I'm thinking TNT launchers. We need everything. And in order to do that, Logan, we need to start mining. All right, guys, we've made it to the forest and it is now time to be collecting some resources. We're gonna need a lot of stuff in order to build these defenses up. We're gonna need wood, red, stone iron i mean if we find diamond that's also amazing we're also gonna need some feathers logan we need to find a chicken all right guys so i'm thinking maybe jake and i split up i'm gonna use my shovel to collect some sand and i also have an axe to chop down some trees let's go All right, I think that's enough sand for now. I'm gonna go see what Jake's up to. So Logan's tasked me with getting the resources that I have to mine. So my big thing is redstone because I think we could make a bunch of really cool contraptions and defenses for our base. So I'm thinking we head on over here. I found a little bit of a crevasse, so hopefully we can find something in here. And that's a long way down. Well, I don't have feather falling on, so I'm definitely not gonna be jumping. Okay, looks like it's one block at a time. Okay, easy does it. Just like in real Minecraft. All right, guys, I've been following the crevasse for a little bit. Haven't found anything yet. There's a lot of stone here, so... I mean, we can always use stone, so I guess I'll mine some stone, but still on the lookout for anything good. <sighs> All right, guys, got some stone. Not bad. Now we still got to find that redstone. Check it out. I finally found some redstone. It's a little bit, but it should be enough for what we need. It's in here on the side of this kind of cave thing, so let's grab some of this. Whew. 
Ooh, and there we go. We got ourselves some redstone. Ah. Uh. Okay. okay, check it out. Check it out. I got some sand. I got okay. some wood. But okay. Jake, I saw a chicken. Oh, saw a chicken over there. Oh, dude. See Jake right over there. There's chicken. Look, and it's actually a chicken. All right, Logan, stay back, stay back, stay back. You can't just run over there and get the chicken like that. Logan, the chicken's running away. Mr. Chicken. Jake, I'm just gonna hit him with my shovel. Okay. Just ready? No, he looks so innocent. We need the chicken. We need food. Okay, oh, he's coming over here. Hey, buddy. Hi, I'm Papa Jake, and I just wanted to, uh, just, uh, gonna, and... Oh! Jake, I think you got the chicken. Oh, I feel so bad, Mr. Chicken. That's all that's left of him. I mean, at least we got some feathers. He sacrificed himself for us, Logan, so we can make bow and arrows. I mean, he's a good man. He's a good chicken. The least we can do is collect his feathers and maybe take the chicken meat and make some chicken wings tonight with barbecue sauce. That's, I think that's the best way to honor him. All right, Jake, I think we have enough materials. Let's just head home. All right. Well, you know, they say the best way to head home, Logan. Jake, there's a, a creeper. creeper. Well, let's just sit him back. Sit him back. Okay. Jake, he's running right towards us. It's like three hits. I got this. Oh, no, 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 no. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I got him. I got him. I took down the creeper. Jake, he he just, didn't blow up. He just exploded. No, he didn't blow up. I got him before you, you have explode. gunpowder on your No, face. no, no. I think I the third hit with the shovel. Ooh, really. Jake, look at this. Yeah, look at that. We got gunpowder for the, the TNT. Gunpowder for TNT. That'll help us with the fence base. Yeah. See, guys, you might have thought that creeper was going to explode. But if you hit him three times before he gets close enough to you, he doesn't explode at all. We got feathers. We got gunpowder. We got redstone. We got wood. We got sand, stone. And there's this array coming. So I think, guys, we better head back to base, start building up, and get ready for this raid. All right, guys, we're back home, and we have some materials to build our defenses. Jake, what do you think we should build first? Well, first things first, Logan, I think we should get some fences around here. That will delay them a little bit. Then we can start working on the actual stuff that's going to attack them. I'm thinking a piston to shoot out arrows that we can craft with all the feathers that we got. All right, on top of that, I got some other tricks up my sleeve I'll reveal later, but let's get working on this fence. While Jake works on the fence, I'm going to go make some arrows. We got our sticks. We got our flint. And last but not least, we got our feather. Here we go in three, two, one. Oh, all right, guys. We have our first arrow. I only have about five feathers, so we're only gonna get like five arrows from this. And we also gotta make our bow for our bow and arrows. Arrow number two, number three. All right, we got three sticks and we got our string. Back when we took out that spider, we got its string. So this will be used to make our bow. All right, three, two, one. Oh, dude, guys, check it out. We got our bow and we got our arrows. Ooh, just like that. All right, I kind of got to practice my aim, but I'm going to get good with these things. And then with the extra arrows we have, I think Jake's going to work on a dispenser. Okay, so I still got some work to do on the fence, but I thought I'd take a little bit of a break and work on some of the redstone. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to create a wiring system starting here. So I've got my pieces of redstone. So let's place one here. And there we go. We've got our one piece of redstone down. Let's put another one over here. All right, here we go. And there we go. Another piece of redstone. Ooh, an extra arrow. I'm going to keep that. And last but not least right here. And just like that, we've got a perfect line of redstone for my next build, which is a dispenser. Check this out, guys. So I actually used some of the stone that we had along with some of our other items, and I built a fully working redstone dispenser. If we place the dispenser right here, like so, we can fill it with some of the arrows Logan has, and then using our redstone, which goes all the way over here. Check this out, guys. Look what I'm going. Logan, what are you doing? I'm building TNT. You moved the crafting table to the crafting room. That was a dark room. This is bright and nice. This is my, like, room. What are you, why are you building? Oh. Jake, TNT. I got the paper. I got the sand. Okay, all right. All now right. I got the gunpowder. Yeah, okay. We don't need bread. But honestly, guys, this stale bread could be used as a defense system. It is rock solid. You could hurt someone with this. Okay, yeah, maybe don't. Ow, 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 stop. I'm losing your hearts. Stop hitting me. It's hard. Okay, build your TNT. All right. Okay, guys, we got our TNT. Let's do this in three, two, Boom! And just Whoa. like that, dude! Inside the house, be careful with the TNT. <laughs> well, just think about it. If I were to blow this up right now, our entire house would be, well, it wouldn't be here anymore. Exactly, I know. Okay, well, you know what, Logan? I was working on something, so I'm sorry. Jake, why did you get rid of the crafting because table? Because I need the room, Logan. I'm setting up a very specific redstone system. By attaching this lever, right? here, I will be able to activate a dispenser that can shoot arrows at any enemy coming at us. Well, Jake, did you make a dispenser? Yes, I made a dispenser, Logan. Check it out. My lever. 
now we've got our lever set up, so I'm going to use some of your arrows. When we pull this, it is going to shoot arrows at enemies coming during the raid. Okay, so far we have TNT, we have weapons, we have your dispenser system. Oh, you don't have my secret weapon, Logan. I haven't told you about that yet. Secret. If I were to tell you about it, it wouldn't be a secret, so I'm not going to tell you. Okay, Jake, what is it? Okay, fine, I'll tell you. All right, I'm going to get a cage and fill it with a zombie. When they come, we will open Jake, the cage. that is so dangerous. No, 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 no. When they come, we will open the cage. The zombie will see all the intruders coming, and it will go after them and attack them. How are you going to get a zombie? Leave that part to me. Hey guys, we have our TNT set up here. So if enemies come from around that corner, we have our TNT set up with some redstone that goes into my house. There's a button in here, Logan. Whatever you do, do not press this button unless it is an absolute emergency. Do not press this button. Whatever you do, do not press the button. No, do not press the button. Okay, so we press that button and boom goes the dynamite. Say bye bye to anyone raiding our base. And Jake, nice job on the fence. Thank you. I'm hoping this keeps out a lot of the raiders. I mean, I don't know about there's, you. But there's no way to get it's by. It's literally impossible to jump over a fence. It is actually physically, that, that's written in the physics books. You cannot jump over a Minecraft fence. So try. Yeah, I, I can't do it. You want to try? Nope, can't do it. Uh, Jake, what is that? Oh, that's the cage for the zombie. Check it out. That, that's a zombie? It well, looks... I, I couldn't get a real full-size zombie, so I got a baby zombie. I mean, they're just as good as a, a real zombie. They're... Uh, okay, all right. You got a baby zombie in the cage. That's great, Jake. Yeah, so if they come, we release the zombie. He goes after them. He goes, oh, yeah. and just attacks them. Easy okay. peasy. All right, easy peasy. We got a baby zombie. We got an arrow dispenser. TNT. Impossible fence to get through. Oh, no. That's the Jake. Way. That was the raid. Okay, they're coming. Battle positions. Oh, hey, Randall. Wow, look at that diamond armor. Too bad you still got that upside down face. <laughs> That's not funny, Jim. That's not funny at all. I was hoping I'd find you here. I wanted to show you something. You got nothing to show me. <laughs> That's where you're wrong. I'd like to introduce you to my friend. Wait, Randall. Randall, what is that? Is that the is that the Ender Dragon? Attack him, Mr. Ender Dragon. Goodbye, Jim. That's for making fun of me. But you're only the start. The rest is all of Minecraft. We and have today, we have a serious problem. We do. We have a very, very serious problem that I cannot see. Jake, a raid is coming. We heard the battle horns, and that means that raiders are coming and they're gonna destroy our base, I Jake. Be careful, no, not the fence. I'm going to single-handedly defend this base against anyone trying to attack it. This is our home, Logan. This is the only thing we have left other than that house. We built some defenses for our base. We have TNT. We also have a dispenser, which is going to shoot out arrows at the pull of a lever. In case anyone starts to come this way, we just start pulling the lever, shooting at them. We've also combined our bases and added a brand new fence that we built using resources we got from the forest to defend the main section. But guys, we are not done. We are not ready for this epic attack. I mean, I am, but Logan's not, because I'm really good at fighting. We need to build something bigger, Logan. We need to make sure that we 100% can survive this raid because you guys know if we survive the raid, we get lots of really cool stuff. And, and and we get to keep our house, Jake. That too. We also get to keep our house. On top of that, guys, I actually went ahead and got a baby zombie that we can unleash on any... Logan, where'd the baby zombie go? Jake, the zombie's gone. It was literally inside that cage two minutes ago. I even gave him a name. His name is Little Ted. Now he's gone. Oh, 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 it's on me. The baby zombie. 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 The baby how this is done. Master Builder Papa Jake is going to get us a defense tower in less than two minutes. I want you, on the other hand, to go inside and connect our bases and get everything ready in there so that when the raid comes, we've got all of our bow and arrow swords, everything we need, and also maybe look into getting us some armor because currently we have nothing on us. All right, all right. I'll, I'll go connect our houses and get us some armor. All right, guys, I'm going to quickly attach Jake's base with mine so we have optimal efficiency. All right. 
Now we got our door, and in case you guys haven't seen my house yet, I'll show you around. We got my bed, we got some lights in here, we got my chest full of secret items. I don't actually want Jake to know what's inside my chest because I have some secret stuff. And we got this button. You press the button and it blows up the TNT. <laughs> All right, so guys, you know I am an absolute master builder. That is why I have my friend here, Billy. Now, Billy is going to be building us a tower for uh, four emeralds. Isn't that right, Billy? <laughs> okay, fine. I'm also a master negotiator. Uh, six, six emeralds. All right, fine. Uh, 12, 12 emeralds, 12 emeralds. Okay, fine. Here, you know what? He's getting 12 emeralds. There, that's a deal. That's a good deal. All right, Billy's going to build our tower, and I'm going to go take a break and eat some bread because that's all we farmed. Maybe I should make a farm. All right, so now we're inside Jake's house. You got a furnace. He has his bed. And if you come outside of his bedroom, you have his crafting table. And we have our bow and arrows. But guys, we need to get some armor. We ran out of iron. We don't have any diamonds or gold. I don't know, guys. It's not like armor is just going to walk right in front of me. Wait, is that a cow? Wait, guys, we could use the cow's leather for armor. All right, guys, I'm going to take out the cow with my bow and arrow. Here we go. In three, two, one. Guys, I got it! We got the leather! Woo! This is gonna be perfect! Hey, we got the... Jake! What are you doing? It doesn't look like Logan, I'm reading a book. What do you mean you're reading a book, Jake? Well, I'm reading a book on uh, going underwater, you see? Because I want to do an underwater mission, but if Jake, we're not going Jake, underwater, Jake, then... We're supposed to be building that. Who's, who's building that? I hired a villager. Jake hired him with what? We don't have anything. Dang, you didn't even ask for it up front. I told him 12 emeralds. I could have told him 20. He's building us a whole tower. I'm learning about underwater, the ocean floor. Jake, we have a raid coming because you have a bad omen. Whoa, they got turtles. Dude, turtles. We should have a turtle farm. <gasps> you're, turtle. you're making enemies. You're making enemies left, right, and center. We're gonna have so many people. Build this, And then when we take out the raid, we're gonna get so many emeralds from it. I'll be able to pay him off everything. Don't you worry. Plus we're still a friendly Phil. I mean, he said he's rich. Worst case, we could just borrow some emeralds from him. I got the leather. I think we could use this for some leather armor. All right, guys, we have our crafting table and we have our leather. Let's make some leather armor. In three, two, boom! And we got ourselves some leather armor. Leather armor, Logan, we should be wearing diamond gold. Jake, we don't Netherite. have Netherite. Oh, but at least put it on and see how it looks. All right, three, two, one. Boom! Okay, all right. Oh, I like it. Not too bad looking. I mean, probably can't stop a diamond sword, but you know. All right, let's get my leather armor going. I saw this cow. I was going to take him out, but I didn't take him out because I was like, I'm going to name you Bessie. He was walking around our house. I haven't seen him in a bit, but yeah, that's our armor. One, two, three. Oh, okay. We got some more leather armor. And I even made myself some pants. Let's try these on. Oh, all right. Yeah, it looks pretty good. I think that could defend Ow. yourself, I think. You look like a peasant, Logan. Don't look like a fearless warrior that I am. Jake, Minecraft is all about working your way up. All right, well, soon enough, I'm gonna have netherite armor, so I guess this is okay for now. All right, well, the tower's in the works. We've got bow and arrows made. We also have a pretty decent amount of swords and supplies, and this base is looking pretty good. I think we're almost about ready for this raid. And guys, you gotta check out the tower that I put together 100% Bot. Jake, you did not put this tower together. With the help of another person building it, Logan. Come on. Ooh, Look at this. This cobblestone. is our defense tower. Now you can get up. Check this out. Stay right there. See? Look at how high it goes, dude. We can shoot down like this. You know, use bow and arrows. Take out anyone coming at us. I can even throw my pick at. Ow! Just hit me in the face. Oh, Logan, you can't see because you're down there and you're really short, but I'm up here and I'm really tall and uh, we got guys coming this way, like right now. Jake, we need to get our battle supplies right now. In positions, let's go. All right, Jake, I'll get my bow and arrows and I'll head up to the tower. All right, I just need my sword and I will attack everyone on the ground. If they start getting too close, I'll run back in here and I'll use this to take them out with the arrows. If they get even closer than that, there's a button inside your house that activates the TNT block. We'll blow them up. All right, guys, up the tower. Oh no, I see one right there. Jake, I got him. Logan, take him out. Oh, nice shot, dude. Here's your arrow. Oh no, we got another one. I got this one. All right, guys, they're coming from everywhere. We need to defend the base. Logan, where are you at? Jake, I got this. We got a shovel for. He's shovel. got a bow and arrow. Oh. Hold on. Ugh. Good job, dude. Dude, what'd I tell you? 
You again with the shovel. You get all the, the shovel is the best. It is you. You you broke your shovel. That, that was the end of my shovel. All right, well grab your bow and arrow, okay? We're gonna need everything we got. Oh no, Logan. We've got an invoker. What is that dude doing? Oh no, 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 this can't be good. I think he's spawning zombies. Logan, get ready. Oh no, we got zombies coming from all around us. Logan, this might be the time we use the TNT. Get in the house. Quick, Jake. Close the door, close the door. Oh no, 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 they're coming. Jake, there's one right there. Oh no, Jake. Okay, look, when they get close enough, we're gonna activate the TNT, take them all out at the same time. Just wait for them to get around the TNT. Jake, I don't like this. We got another one. There's zombies everywhere. Jake, just wait, just wait, we can hold out. We need all of them to get here. All right, now Logan, press the button. Ah. Ah. Ow! That was, loud. that was really loud. I can't see my ears. Jake, that doesn't make sense. I can't hear my eyes. I don't hear any zombies. I think it worked. But Jake, I still see the evoker. All right, I have an idea for him. Here, I need you to get into the other room and get by the lever. When I tell you to pull it, pull it. I right, am in the room, Jake. Oh no, looks like he's doing another spell. Okay, hold on, Logan. Uh, uh, uh. Okay, in three, two, one, fire. Ah. Oh, dude, it worked! We got the evoker! Oh, and check it out! What is that? I don't know, it's some sort of potion. I don't know what it does, and I mean, probably should never drink something that fell off a guy that's trying to attack your village, but hey. Logan, this might be the best potion I've ever had. Oh, Jake, what? What did you drink? Oh, I don't know what I drank, but Logan, I have so many ideas right now. We gotta, we gotta take down everyone. We, 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 we can get. Okay, oh. Jake, it sounds like you had a speed anymore, potion. Maybe you just potion. chill What's out. It's a speed potion. I need to run. I need to move. I need to move fast. Hold on. I'll be right back. I think Jake may have just taken a speed potion. That's about the best I've ever ran in my entire life. Logan, what do we do now? What do we do now? We just gotta prepare. There's probably more villagers coming to raid our base. <sighs> I'm tired. That did not last that long. Jake. Those are cool. We should make more of those. Oh no. I think we got one more guy. He's coming this way. Oh, there he is, Jake. <laughs> oh! Look, there's an arrow in me! Ah, Jake, what, what do, do I do? I don't know what we do. What That's do I right, do? Jake. I've never had an arrow stuck I'm in me. I'm gonna grab it. Jake, grab I'm gonna grab it. Ow! Why would you do that? Ow! Oh, he's behind you. Ow. Get him, Logan. Oh. Oh no. This one's kind of good. Look at me. I'm a distraction. I'm a distraction. I got his sword, Logan. What are you going to do with it with a shield? Yeah. You don't have a sword anymore. Ow. Why are you doing that with your shield? I didn't even know you could do it. Ow. Okay, you know what? That's it. And he dropped his diamond sword. Oh, I call dibs on this. Oh, Jake, Jake. What is this? I'll trade you. You'll trade me a diamond sword for this? That's a respawn token, Logan. That means if you were ever to get eliminated, you can instantly respawn. You don't have to spawn in your bed. Dude, look at it. It looks so happy. I'm actually not going to trade this. I'm going to keep this finders, keepers, losers, weepers. See ya. Well, at least we got everyone eliminating the raid. We have successfully defended the kingdom of Papa Jake. Oh, Phil, what are you doing? Whoa, 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 Phil. Phil. Oh, hey, guys, I felt bad. I wanted to come help out. Uh, the, the raid's over. Oh, thank goodness! Uh, I mean, I mean, that's too bad, guys. Yeah, you sort of, you sort of missed the whole thing, Phil. But uh, we really appreciate you coming out. Oh, thanks. Yeah, thanks for for coming. I guess. What you guys got planned for the rest of the day? Well, we're gonna take the stuff that we got from the raid, and we're gonna keep working on the base. I mean, it's looking pretty sweet. We've got defense we can... tower, defense measures. We've got the fence. Uh, yeah, dude. I'm even thinking we could add a water segment to it. I mean, we I want to go farm. find an ender guardian. We do need a farm because we are out of food. We need potatoes. Potatoes. I only eat steak. M must be nice. Well, yeah, we don't have any steak, so for us, it's potatoes and bread tonight. But, uh, Jake. Yeah, yes, Phil. We talked about personal space. Oh, sorry. But things are getting kind of scary. Uh, are you believing this nonsense about the dragon? No, Phil. There is no ender dragon. We took him out. We literally destroyed the ender dragon. He's not yeah. back. I mean, Logan turned my cow into leather. You think we're just going to take this leather armor and put him back into a cow? It's not how things work. The ender dragon is not back in Minecraft, okay? Okay, that's good to know. All right, I'm going to go back to the recording studio. Okay, go for it. But you guys enjoy your potatoes in this uh, house of yours. You know, ever since he got famous, he has a really big head. Yeah, he does. All right, guys, well, I'm going to take this and put it in my chest. There's no way I'm going to lose this. 
that goes in my chest. I think Jake's working on a farm right now. Probably gonna chill out and then we're gonna have dinner. All right guys, well, while Logan's doing whatever he's doing, I need to get working on the farm because as of right now, we've only had a few, well, we've only had bread. That's all we've been eating. So I thought one of the first things we could do because we got a body of water next to us and we're eventually gonna be wanting to make an enchanting room, we need some books. And in order to get books, you need paper. And in order for paper, you need sugar cane. And in order for sugar cane, you need to plant the sugar cane. So I've got some sugar cane and I'm gonna be planting it here beside our nice water in the sand. There we go, our first ever sugar cane. Look at that guys, soon enough it'll be as tall as the sun. All right, let's keep planting. All right, so far looking pretty good, guys. We've got a bunch of sugar cane in the ground. I'm gonna keep planting them and I'll update you when I'm done. And there we go. We have all of our sugar cane all nicely planted by the water. So these will be grown so we can make some paper. They're looking pretty good right now. Hello, what are you up to? Nothing, Jake. I just, uh, I brought us dinner. What do you mean you brought us dinner? Well, I'm, I'm kind of- start our farm, make some more wheat, make some more bread. I'm kind of sick of bread. Why are you sick of bread? Bread's the building block of life. Well, Jake, I got a little something special potatoes you got potatoes not one potato oh not two not three. Oh. Four potatoes i got potatoes everywhere jake okay all right guys looks like we're moving up in the world of minecraft cooking we're gonna be eating potatoes well actually what we should do logan is we don't do that with the potatoes stop doing that we do not have the potatoes they're not well, what we should be doing, Logan, is we should eat some of these by turning them into baked potatoes. But the other ones we should plant so we can grow more potatoes. How about you go inside, start cooking us some potatoes, and I'll be out here planting the potatoes. And just like that, I've got our potatoes planted in the ground. So now all we got to do is cover them up with a little bit of soil. And then I'm going to use my bucket to fill in the holes beside it. Just like in Minecraft, these things will grow from one potato into a million. And there we go. We'll have some potatoes. I wonder where Logan is. Today has been a very eventful day. The sun is going down. I'm getting pretty tired, but I was thinking before we go inside and eat dinner, I was thinking that I'd go check out Jake's mine shaft and see if we could find any cool ores or anything special. <gasps> Guys, is that what I think it is? I think we just found gold. Oh, guys, check it out. It's gold ore. Let's go take this to the furnace and turn it into some gold and get it. Jake, Logan, check this out. I took the extra potatoes you had, I planted the rest, and I made us baked potatoes. No more bread for us tonight. Look how big these things are. It's like a whole meal. Try it out, dude. Oh, dude, they're actually hot. Right? Isn't that good? Plus, we can start expanding the farm. We could grow carrots, watermelons. I mean, eventually, Logan, we could even grow steak. I was going to keep this a secret, Jake, but check it out. I found some gold ore. You got gold ore? Well, dude, pop it in the oven. Let's get a gold bar going. All right, guys, the furnace is cooking up that ore into a gold bar. Dude, we could be making... <gasps> we should get a bunch of gold and make powered rails and have a roller coaster. Oh, that or, would be sweet. Wait, or we make a floating house in the middle of the ocean and we go down and we fight an Ooh, ender Jake, guardian. It, Jake, it's ready. Oh, take it out. Let's see. Oh, we got our first gold bar, dude. That looks insane. Oh, that is awesome. We got to go wake up, Logan, because it is a brand new day. And oh, 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 Logan's what already awake. Mean? I'm awake. I'm ready for today. I'm actually Today's surprised. Be Logan's awesome. already awake. Today, we are going in the ocean. That's right. We are going traveling underwater. Ah! Logan. Wait, Logan. Logan. Oh, no, guys. Oh, no. He must have had half a heart. He doesn't have feather falling on. Logan. Oh, no. Yeah. Oh, now, 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 it's over. I just want to take a moment to uh, get an RIP Logan in the comments. We're going to have to continue this without Logan. I just, you know, he went so fast. I thought, if anything, if he was going to die, he'd go fighting a dragon or a monster or... Oh, my God, it's a zombie! Jake, I'm right here. <laughs> you, just re <laughs> you just respawn. Yeah. But... No, you're a zombie. No, you just... Zombie Logan, Jake. get back. You're not the real Logan. It's fine. You just respawn in your bed. Logan stole my camera. Yeah! Ah, Jake, Jake, chill. What zombie? It's too early for What'd this. What'd you do with Logan? I just told you, you respawn when you die. Oh, yeah. Wait, I want to try that. Here we go! Yeah! All right, uh, don't really know why Jake- I'm back, baby! 
Woo, that was actually kind of fun. Do not try that at home though, because at home is not real life Minecraft. All right, well, Logan, what is on the docket for today? Today, we are going into the ocean. We're gonna travel far and wide. We're gonna make a boat, Jake. Oh, I like this, Logan. We are gonna build the biggest boat, the Titanic of Minecraft. We are gonna travel long, wide, down, up. We're gonna need paper for TNT, all the wood. Logan, where are your diamonds? Jake, Jake, we don't have that kind we of have resources. Your gold block, though, Logan. And we're gonna need to use it for the boat. Jake, all we need is a little boat. That's it. No, 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 no. We're, we're, we're making a big boat. We're just gonna need wooden planks and we're gonna make a boat to travel the ocean. Logan, if we're gonna travel the ocean, we need to make a big boat, Titanic, cruise ship. There should be a water slide on our boat. What's this little boat nonsense? You know what? No, 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 I get it, I get it. I get what Logan's doing here. He's trying to say that I'm Logan and I don't need to use a lot of things to make things awesome. I'm gonna make a little boat and he's gonna, he's gonna, I'm gonna make, better than I'm me. gonna make it awesome. Okay, all right, this is a classic Papa Jake versus Logan challenge. Fine, you know what, Logan? You go make your little tiny boat that no one's gonna see and when the Kraken comes and chomps you up, you are gonna be calling for me in my big boat. I'm gonna take some of the wood off of here. I'm gonna go mining, I'm gonna go collect resources. I'm gonna have the biggest boat you've ever seen in Minecraft. All right, we'll just see who gets across the ocean first, Jake. I need to get some wood as well as some other building material. So I came over here to my secret mine shaft. I'm currently still only wearing leather armor, which really isn't my style. I'm more of a diamond armor kind of guy. Or netherite, that would be nice. But basically we need to find some new stuff. So I'm gonna look around here, try and gather some resources, and then we'll get back and start building our ultimate Minecraft boat. All right guys, check it out. We haven't found much, but I was able to find, looks like a coal deposit here. Oh yeah, there we go. That is a lot of coal. So at least we got something to power the lights and the furnace on our boat. I was able to get some more stone too, so that's gonna work for us. Now time to gather some wood. Uh, here we go, more wood those in the inventory. Guys, I don't know about you, but I think, well, I know nothing about making boats, but we're probably about halfway there to making a boat. And look what we got here, guys. We have an apple. Ugh. Now that is gonna be, oh, I don't wanna drop my apple. Ugh. Now that is gonna be some food for us when we're out on our long boating journey. And it looks like a sapling fell down. Now guys, you know, whenever you're playing Minecraft, you always gotta replant the trees. So I'm gonna replant this beside my mine. And hopefully that'll grow into a big tree. I think we got enough resources. Let's go see what Logan's up to and start building our boat because I'm pretty excited to get out on the open ocean and check out Minecraft underwater. Uh, there is a spider here, guys. Uh, Mr. Spider, okay, all right. Whoa, 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 chill out, Mr. Spider. All right, you know what? Whoa, whoa, I got a diamond sword and I'm gonna use it. Uh, 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 uh. Spider's crawling all over our base. What does Minecraft come to? Logan, are you in there? What are you doing in here, buddy? You're taking a nap? Jake. I have so much time on my hands. What do you mean you have so much time? I just have to craft a boat. You're gonna craft a house. All right, yeah, you know what, fine. Take all the time you want because I'm gonna be making the better boat. You're gonna see. Guys, Logan is a noob, okay? This is basically a pro versus noob situational situation we got going on here. I'm gonna show him what a pro really does. I got my resources, I know what I'm doing. It's time to craft my boat. The whole reason we're building boats and going into the ocean is the other day I was walking through the forest when I met a villager. Another beautiful day in Minecraft. Huh? What's this dude doing? Hello? I think this guy's just sleeping. Uh, hello? Hurry, you be trying to steal me treasure, aren't you? You don't mess with Pirate Pete. You be trying to steal me treasure, are you? No, not at all. I was just waking you up and seeing if you're okay. Sailed the seven seas of Minecraft for 40 years. Haven't seen land since I was a wee lad. We're literally standing on land right now. That's because I'm retired. Uh, okay, well, I was just making sure you're okay. I'll, I'll go on my way oh, now. You look like you are looking for a treasure. You be looking for the best treasure Minecraft has to offer. You see this apple here? Yeah, I see the I apple. Found her underwater in the great deep depths where people don't be going unless they know what they're doing. I I'm not really looking for any treasure, to be honest. Uh, but you are, aren't you? You be looking for a way to find the deep treasure that I could not find. My white whale. 
I mean, sure, yeah, like I, I guess I'd be up for finding some treasure. Uh, where is it? Deep in the sea, the depths so, so down low, you need enough air to last you four days. That sounds kind of dangerous. But she'd be worth it. Everything I've done has led me to the treasure. And I can tell you where she is. Uh, okay, tell me where it is. It'd be that way. Far into the ocean. Somewhere in that area. Could be right. Could be down. Could even be up. Well, it doesn't really sound like you have that many directions, but uh, I'll give it a shot. You'll be the richest man in Minecraft. You know how I lost me eye? Uh, how did you lose your eye? I tripped and fell on sugarcane. That, that makes sense. Sugarcane is pretty pointy. It is. Well, good luck with your treasure finding. All right. Thanks so much for the help. Kind of a weird guy, don't know if I trust them. So I haven't told Jake about the treasure yet, but that's why we're doing this whole mission in the first place. We're gonna get in a boat, we're gonna go in the ocean, and we're gonna try and find treasure. Whoa, 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 whoa. Logan realizes I can hear him from over here. I mean, he's not 400 meters away. He's talking about a treasure. That's why he wants to do this challenge. He wants to find an underwater treasure and take it all for himself. All right, well, guys, I didn't tell Logan this, but when we did that raid in the last episode, I actually got some emeralds from it. So I'm thinking we're going to use these to get ourselves a little more advantage. What I think we really need is a helmet of respiration. So I need to find myself a trader. Okay, I got some emeralds to trade. Any traders around here? Hmm. Okay, that was uh, extremely fast. Uh, hello, good sir. Well, I'm looking to buy something from you. Oh, you brought your llamas. Uh, hi. Well, I, uh, I'm i looking to purchase a, well, a, a, a helmet of respiration. Could be diamond, could be anything. I've, I've got some emeralds here to trade. How much would that run me? Oh, okay, your llamas are really, they're kind of just going all over the place. It made me control the, why, why do you have llamas? What's the point of the llamas? <laughs> Okay, yeah, no, if you could really just kind of get these llamas under control, they're kind of everywhere. I mean, really. That llama just spit in my face. Why did he spit in my face? Okay, look, I just want to buy a respiration helmet, please. 12 emeralds? Okay, I mean, that's a lot, but yeah, okay, I can do that. Okay, fine, here. Here are your 12 emeralds. Let's see the respiration helmet. Perfect. Oh, guys, this is gonna give us the advantage against Logan. Now we gotta get our boat ready, and I think I know exactly how we're gonna do this. Now that I've got my respirator, I am officially ready to start working on my massive Minecraft floating fortress, but I had an idea, you know, since Logan didn't tell me about the treasure, and you know, he was kinda sneaky about it, and he's gonna try and probably steal it from me, I thought to speed things up a little bit, I'll just take his house. Yeah, you know, I'll just, I'll just lift up his house, I'll put it on this platform, and then we'll have a houseboat. I mean, he's already off doing something. He probably won't even notice. Then I can add a little bit to it, and we'll have a massive Minecraft floating fortress. In fact, this is going to save me so much time, I went ahead and I crafted a little something. A fishing rod, because there's going to be lots of fish at sea, and plus, you can always find some extra treasure when you're fishing, so I'm going to use this to be fishing off the side of my boat. Maybe we should go right now and give a little test run. I'm going to see if we can catch some fish. I think I already see some kind of swimming around down there. Well. Maybe we can find some other stuff. Here we go. And now we wait. I don't really see anything down there. I mean, there's some, definitely some seaweed and stuff. Oh, oh, wait, we got something. Oh, we got something. Okay, all right, come on, Mr. Fishy. Where are you going? Where are you going? Oh, uh-oh. What? Oh, we caught a fish. We actually caught a fish. Look at that. We caught a Minecraft fish. Not too bad for a first fishing job. I think I'm gonna do pretty good at this. All right, guys, I'm in Jake's workshop now because it's time to start building my boat. First things first, we need some wooden planks. Now we're gonna take our crafting table, bring it outside. Now we just need to make our boat. What is this? Jake? Jake, why is my house on your floaty? Logan, is that you? Jake! Uh, I'm just taking a nap. Where did my house go? Oh, you see my house boat there, right? Isn't it nice? You can't just take my fort. Why didn't Tay has borrowed some inspiration? Taking my fort is not borrowing inspiration, Jake. I know what you're saying. She's nice. Ah, I even got room to walk around. Now this is a pro Minecraft floating fortress. I mean, I got a respirator in here. I've got a fishing rod. Oh, did I even show you, Logan? I caught a fish. See? My first fish. You stole my house. Borrowed your house. That's the right word to use. Also, good luck getting across the ocean, Jake. This thing's gonna move so slow. I don't think so, Logan. If anything, you're gonna hit one wave and tip over. And uh, I don't know about you, but I'd be scared of the drowned. I don't care about the drowned. Okay, here we go. I'm gonna build my boat. I'm gonna get that treasure. Three, two, one. 
And there we go, guys. We got our wooden boat. This thing is gonna go faster than Jake's houseboat. I mean, my houseboat. It's pretty much my houseboat, because it's my house. There we go, guys. My boat's afloat. I don't think Jake's gonna be able to even carry his houseboat. Yeah, this way. Three emeralds. Come on. Jake, you can't just keep giving away emeralds. We don't even have emeralds. Uh, yeah, that's right, we don't. Ah, sir, it's the biggest boat ever. Boat, if you will. Yeah, that's a massive boat. Okay, wait, I'm just gonna get inside my boat, Jake. All right, and we are inside my boat. Woohoo! Oh gosh, I'm gonna paddle away. Jake's boat's gonna take up the whole ocean. Wait, wait, oh! Jake! Oh, you gotta make sure Jake, boat. you're hitting me on my boat! And of course, Jake's boat looks like the Titanic in comparison to my boat. Oh, how's it going down there in your little tiny boat? Yeah, I can stand on my boat. We've got a little walkway here that we can uh, use to walk around. We've also got our entrance so we can go inside and chill out. It's like sleep, sleeping in a cruise ship. Now we just let the Minecraft sea take us where the Minecraft sea wants to take us. Once we get far enough out, we can start exploring some shipwrecks, go underwater. I mean, I've got a respirator. Logan doesn't. Logan, what are you doing? I'm coming on your fort. You're not allowed to come in my fort. Jake, Logan, what are you this, doing? This is literally my house. You're not allowed in my boat. This is my boat. This is my boat. Well, the fact that you already came over here and we've been literally at sea for five minutes shows me that the pro fort is uh, probably winning because it looks like you don't want to be on your little dinghy anymore. Look at that little thing. You can barely float. It can float just fine. And I didn't say I wasn't going to make a better boat. I just said we need a simple boat that takes us from A to B. Yeah, well, it doesn't look like your boat's taking us from A to B, but it looks like this is. I have a fishing rod. What do you have? I have my bare hands, Jake. You can go fish with your bare hands in the ocean with deadly zombies everywhere. Yeah, I'll just use my sword or my hands. Okay. All right. Yeah, you go fish. I'm going to use my fishing rod. You know what? Fine. Go explore underwater. I'm going to be up here high and dry in my pro fort. Guys, this actually works out because while Jake's fishing, I'm going to go looking for treasure. So while Logan's going to fish underwater with his bare hands and a sword, I'm really going to be doing what the objective is, and that is finding this treasure. I've got my respiration mask here, which is going to let me stay underwater a lot longer than Logan. I think we'll find this treasure in no time. See ya, Jake! <laughs> There's zombies in the ocean. This is not good. Finding this treasure is gonna be a lot harder than I thought. giant squid I am not down for a giant squid that's it guys we are going full treasure hunting mode I don't know where Jake is I don't know what he's doing but we are gonna find this treasure all right guys so while Logan's swimming around looking for fish I'm gonna be looking for treasure I got my respirator let's head down there see what we can find Woo! here's the respirator time to put it on got the air feeding through here just like in Minecraft I can hold my breath for a lot longer with this thing. That's pretty crazy. I can stand in there for almost five minutes. And look, I already found a jellyfish. All right, we gotta keep looking for this treasure though. So far, no bad guys. That's a good thing. So far, I haven't found any treasure. Found a couple little uh, jellyfish and a lot of seaweed, but nothing else is under there. I don't know where this treasure is. Guys, look, I caught another fish. <laughs> oh no, what's that? Oh no, that might be a drowned. Guys, I think we have a drowned coming this way. Oh no, we got more coming this way, guys. Watch out. I think there's one more coming this way. I don't know why there's so many of them. Oh, the seaweed is everywhere. Ah.
There's a lot of them. Jake? What are you Logan? doing? What do you mean, what am I doing? I went down there, there were zombies everywhere. Came out here. I couldn't find the treasure. Wait, you knew about the treasure? Yes, I knew about the treasure, Logan. I overheard you talking about it. I wanted to find it too. I didn't know what was in it, but I wanted it. Okay, well, Jake, I found the treasure. What? Dude, look at this. You actually found the treasure down there? This thing's heavy. I don't know what's inside, but guys, whatever it is, it's probably diamonds. This actually might have been worth it after all. All right, well, I say we open up this chest and see what's inside and find out all these goodies. We went through a lot to get this. We had to be drowned. Logan got attacked by an octopus and all four. Piece of paper? Well, technically two pieces. Of There's a coin. There's one coin. Okay, we went through all that for two pieces of paper. That really just, oh. you know what? I'm done. Jake, it's a map. No, I'm going to Terraria. Jake, we got what? a map what? with an X on it. What That's treasure. Wait, what? X stands for treasure. Oh, hold on. Here's a note. Check this out. If you're reading this, you have found the key to the bank of Minecraft. They are responsible for stealing diamonds and gold from the citizens of Minecraft. I didn't know Minecraft had a bank. Wait, I can't really read this handwriting. Use this along with the map to steal back from them and the riches will be yours. Beware of the dangers ahead. Yours truly CB. I know who this is. Charlie Buckingham. No, I actually don't know who this is. Charlie, do we know to CB? Connor. It's okay, just, just give up. Big. Wait, horse. Look at this. That's where the bank of Minecraft is. That means we need to go here and steal back the treasures from... This just sounds like stealing. Okay, no, but they're bad people. It says that they stole from the people of Minecraft. They're like Robin Hood. So we're gonna go, we're gonna go steal from the bad people, so it's not stealing. It's actually... It's still stealing. Alright, but look. If we're going all the way over here, we're coming from here. That's a long way to travel, and the sun's already setting. It's gotta be a faster way to get across land. And that's where that horse came in. Okay, but Jake, where are we gonna get a horse? I don't see a horse. Why don't you leave that up to me? All right, guys, check it out. We also got some new potatoes growing as well in our farm here, and ah, I was able to get some carrots. I got a fish. Oh, okay, and Logan has got a fish. Not too bad. All right, Logan, I see you head on over to the... M I just had the most amazing idea ever. Carrot on the end of a fishing pole equals a fishing pole carrot. Just like how you ride pigs, Logan. Let's see if it works with you. Giddy up. Jake. There we go. It's working. Jake, it's not working. It's working. Chase the carrot, Logan. Chase it. I I'm not interested in the carrot. It works with pigs. Chase it. No. Mush. Mush. No, no get up. Uh, okay, they didn't work with Logan. That was a bad idea. All right, you know what, Logan? We got carrots. We got fish. We got potatoes. We've got our house, but we're going to have to leave this land. And just like in real Minecraft, we don't know how long we're going to be. So I'd say we bring everything we have. Bring your respawn token. I'm going to bring my diamond sword. You bring your iron sword. I got a shovel. You do have a shovel, bring that shovel. I'll collect some resources. Why don't you head on over to my secret mine that you know about, try and find us some extra iron or something we could use. I'll grab some wood and we'll head to the forest and find ourselves a horse. All right guys, time to go to the mine. Maybe we can find diamonds. Haven't found any of those yet. <gasps> oh my gosh. Guys, did we just, did we just find diamonds? There it is. Wait, 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 wait. I cannot use this pickaxe. This is a cobblestone pickaxe and I will not be able to collect the diamond. I need to get a better pickaxe. I'm gonna sail across the ocean because ah, I have no time to waste. All right, guys, let's head into Jake's workshop. And perfect, we have an iron pickaxe. That'll do the trick. Here we go, guys, our first diamond. My pickaxe just broke. We only had one more hit, but we got the diamond. Guys, our very first diamond. So while Logan's off doing some mining, I thought I'd go ahead and gather some more resources. You know, you can never use too much wood. And there we go, we got ourselves a log. All right, let's put this in the inventory and get some more. All right, time to craft this log. I'm gonna do a bunch of planks in three, two, one. No way. Uh oh. Oh no. I may have just crafted the entire log into sticks. Oh, Logan's gonna be really mad about that. 
Okay, okay, well, you know what? On the upside, we have a lot of sticks to build really awesome things like torches and redstone torches and other things that use sticks like fences. Oh, looks like Logan's back. Logan, how'd you do? Jake! Whoa, what's going on? Whoa, whoa! this. What? I got a diamond. Where did you get a diamond? Crispy brand new. I want my crispy diamond brand new. Oh, dude, that is insane. Dude. <gasps> we can turn that into a diamond shovel. Jake, we're not gonna turn this into a diamond shovel. Who uses a diamond shovel? I do, for shoveling no, stuff. No, when we have a bajillion diamonds, then we do, but we have one diamond. Putting it in my chest. Okay, well, we got a diamond, we've got some wood, we've got food, we've got pretty much everything we need. All right, guys, it's time to head out on our adventure. If we look at the map here, we are quite a ways away from this bank, so hopefully we can find a horse and I'll speed up the process, but we got a ways to go. All right, Logan, now the first thing about finding a horse is you gotta know where horse like to sleep, eat. Jake, I see a horse right there. That is a horse right there. I have no thing to do about catching horses. You see that one? It's somebody's horse. That's gonna be a real tricky one here. Yeah? We have to get in, tame her, Gee, get out. You can't just steal someone's horse. That's obviously someone else's horse. Logan, whether or not it's someone else's horse or it's a horse in the wild, it doesn't matter. It's like if you find a dog. If you find a dog in the wild, it's finding a dog. If you find a dog in someone's lawn, it's still a dog. Not, That's just facts. Not how that works. Oh. Gonna follow me. We're gonna move up fast. We're gonna tame the horse. It's tied down so it can't move. All right, I've tamed the horse. That was pretty easy. Jake, of course you tamed the horse because first of all, it's tied to a post. And second of all, Jake, it's not even a horse. We don't- Okay, yes, Logan, it's not a horse, all right? It wasn't exactly in the budget to get a real horse. You know what a real horse would cost? All right, now watch, Logan. You probably don't know how to ride one of these, so let a professional teach you. Now this is gonna get us to that bank real fast. All right, Buttercup, let's do this. All right, Logan, oh, Buttercup's off. Oh, here we go. Well, I guess I gotta get the creeper. All right, one more hit. Woo, we dodged that. All right, guys, let's go find Jake. I am going extremely fast on butter. Okay, Buttercup, you gotta slow down now. No, 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 but you gotta slow down now, Buttercup. Where's the brake on this horse? Okay, Buttercup has slowed down. I am now probably a 40 minute walk from where Logan was. Um, he may no longer be with us. There were a lot of creepers back there and I might've passed two skeletons. Yeah. All right. Uh, oh, Jake. the creeper got you. It's, no, the creeper didn't get me. I got it, Jake. And it's getting really dark. Yeah, I know. I also realized I forgot the map. So I had to come back. Well, Jake, I have the map. Yeah. I mean, I also came back for you because I was concerned about you, but also the map. Here, I got an idea. Why don't we both ride the horse? We'll get there in no time. Come on. Jake, Jake, slow down. Dude, we're going to be at that bank in no time. Why didn't we get horses earlier? This is awesome. We should be at the bank in no time. Okay. All right, Logan, we're at the back of the bank. Oh, this place is massive. All right, Jake, the letter said we had to use a coin to get into this door. Okay, pass the coin. I don't have the coin. Right, I threw the coin. You know what? We'll do it the old fashioned way. Three, two, one. Jake, what's going on? Look, it's a skeleton! Jake, what's going on? Uh, ah! uh, oh! Uh, we got it! Oh no, look, we got another one! Oh no! Why do these ones have swords? They don't have bow and arrows! Look at what are you doing? You're not all doing I, anything! All I have is a candle! Ow! Ow! Jake, get him! Ow! <sighs> Dude, that was close. Dude, I really. Ah, it's oh. just a creeper head. Oh. Okay, I thought it was a creeper. Who keeps a creeper head? I don't know. I mean, it's some sort of bank. And why do those skeletons have swords? This place is supposed to be a bank? Hey, look, look! Haha, <laughs> look at Jake, 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 I'm don't touch the creeper head. Jake! Look! Oh! Gold Dude. bars! <laughs> Wait. Is this the entire bank? Oh, there's a chest. Open it up, open it up. Maybe all the supplies are... <gasps> Yo, diamonds. diamonds! Redstone! But wait, this can't be everything. I mean, this is the bank of Minecraft. What, they got one diamond ore, one redstone, two gold bars? Jake, there's probably a big vault somewhere. I see we go down here. Since I went first, how about you go first this time? That door does not look like a door for people. That looks like a door for tiny little zombies. You walk in that door, that's where baby zombies come from. Okay, Jake, I'm gonna go. That's probably the way. All right. Oh, Jake, oh, I just got hit by an arrow. There's suspensors on the wall. Uh, I think this place might be booby trapped. Okay, yeah, that's definitely a booby trap. All right, Logan, in my uh, infinite wisdom of booby traps, it means that if you hit a pressure plate, you are dispensing arrows at yourself. Okay, I'm gonna put the candle here and see what happens. Okay. 
Okay, that's uh, pressure plate activated. There's gotta be a way to get past this. I think I'm gonna have to crawl under the dispensers. Okay, let's hold it up right there. Oh, oh you still got him. Okay, I, I'm just gonna keep going. Okay, Jake, I made it. All right, I'm going to run extremely fast and get over there before a single arrow can hit me. I'm using my speed and intelligence here, Logan. Oh, oh. Oh, I did it. Jake, you have See? two. You have two arrows in you. What do you mean I have two arrows in me? Ah, one arrow in me. Ow! Okay, stop doing that. I think we we passed the dispensers. Okay, how do we get out of here now? Let's break through this wall. Whoa, whoa! You need a pickaxe to get through this. This is like andesite or metal or something. Ah, got it. Oh, well, another small room. All right. I guess, oh, Jake, why did the lights just go out? Uh, I don't, I don't know. I didn't know there were lights. Now there's no lights. Now I wish there were lights. All we have is this torch. What do we do? We keep going. It's another room. It's really dark. It's extreme. Wait, Logan? What is that? is that? Oh no. Logan, it's a mob spotter. Get back. Ah, oh, Jake, there's a skeleton. Uh, uh, uh. Logan, here, pass the torch. There. That should stop him from spawning. But now we don't have a torch, Jake. You can barely see. Yes, Logan, I realize that, but do you want more skeletons spawning out of this? It's the only thing we can do. We gotta keep pushing forward. At the end of this, they said there's great riches. Okay, there's another door here. Go! All right, come on, whoa! <coughs> Why is this place smoky? I have no idea! Hold on, I think I see something in the smoke. There's like wires here or something. I think that might be trip wires. All right, let me try cutting one, see what happens. <laughs> That's what happens. Uh, Jake, did a pendulum just fall from the roof? Uh, yeah, it did, and that would have really hurt my head. So I'm glad I was not in okay, there. Okay, okay. Um, you know what? Maybe we just, maybe we just no, go no, home. No, 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 Logan, riches, riches. No riches is riches. good enough. Riches. We don't know what that means. That's that's that could be uh, like a bajillion dollars in Minecraft diamonds. We don't know how many diamonds are at the end of this, but we are gonna make it. We're already halfway through. I've killed like four skeletons. Okay, let's keep going. We'll just cut the trip wires before we get to the pendulum. It's easy. All right, we're just gonna cut this trip wire here. And then we, ah, ah, there's a trip wire right I here. I didn't see the trip wire. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you just gotta keep an eye out. There's another one right there. I need fish. Give me fish or an apple. I'm just gonna. I'm, a, I'm like Jake, it's, it's okay. You can. You're okay. I also take a chocolate bar. All right, I'm just gonna be very careful and not touch the trip wire. Ow! I tripped it on purpose to hurt you. Ow, Jake, why would you do that? You wouldn't give me food. Let's just get rid of these. Old. Yeah, I don't want to be on the other end of that, Jake. All right, Logan, looks like there's some cobwebs. I know the easy way to get through this. Just got to jump through it and go really I mean, slow. You could just take it then. Nope. I can't even fight the cobwebs. Jake, there's an Enderman. Wait, there's an Enderman. Where's the Enderman? There's an Enderman. I can't see. There's cobwebs everywhere. Jake, just relax. There's an Enderman. What do you mean there's an Enderman? Oh, there's an Enderman. There's an Enderman. Oh, there's an Enderman. Where did he go? Oh, okay. Maybe he was defending the vault. Maybe we're here. There's a crafting table here. Dude, there's an enchantment table. Oh, I could definitely use an enchantment. Oh, oh boy, I need lapis. Okay, are we at the vault yet? There's a bookshelf, crafting table, an enchantment table, and a bookshelf. Doesn't look like a vault to me, Logan, and I'm a vault expert. Wait, Logan, there's something behind you. Oh. Oh, the power just went back on. Check it out. Oh, dude. I think that's the vault. What? Jake, that's the vault. Oh, I see gold. I see gold. All right, let's make our way through here. Come on. Oh, dude, we hit the jackpot. The guy was right. There's actually a vault. Jake, maybe we should keep it down. I don't know if there's like vault guards. Logan, it's an armor stand. Diamond armor. Jake, be careful. Oh, of what, dude? We're in the bank of Minecraft. We took out every bad guy here. Where are the diamonds? There's no diamonds here. No, they're probably behind there. One second. Dude, check it out. I've got my own diamond armor set. Look at all this gold, dude. We can make powered rails for days. We can have a roller coaster, a train station. Wait. You're right, there should be diamonds in here. Yeah, I mean, this is it? No, this can't be it, there's gotta be more. Uh, wait, Logan, look! It's a redstone trail. It's missing something here. Looks like it hooks up to the switch. All right, well, we can use the redstone we got from the chest before to complete the circuit and open this up. Hopefully this is where the diamonds are. Oh, there we go, redstone complete. Let's try the button. Oh, guys, check it out. Gee, something's happening. Logan Lee might have just hit the biggest jackpot in Minecraft history. Oh, dude! I see the diamonds, Jake. <laughs> diamonds for days! Dude, it's another diamond sword! Wait, yo, there's some enchanted items over here! Check it out! Enchanted sword? 
Knock back two. Gee, gee, give me the diamond sword. Dude, we've got like three diamond oh, swords, dude. We hit the jackpot, oh, guys. And a pickaxe. Fortune two, looting two. Efficiency three. Now this is a pickaxe for Papa Jake. Dude, these are Okay, so Jake, I think we need... Uh, Jake? What? What? There's an Enderman. What? He's back? Hold on. Whoa, what's he doing? Jake, hey. what? Whoa, 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 whoa. Jake, I think he just locked us in here. Wait, why did you lock us in here? Whoa, where'd Jake, you go? Where'd he just disappeared. Go? No, no, you can't leave us in here. No, 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 no. This is a prison. This is a bank. Banks are the opposite of prisons. Jake, I think we've just been locked up. Hello? Jake, yell Hello? yelling like that isn't going to get us out of here. Well, doing nothing isn't going to get us out of here either, Logan. We need to get out of this prison and get back to our house and fast. I don't know how we're going to do that, though. We're kind of trapped in it. Wait. Jake, is that what I think it is? Uh, yes, I actually did get an enchanted pickaxe with fortune three on it. No, Jake, not that. So yeah, that. I kind of have two no, enchanted ones. not what? that. What? Jake, what? behind that. Jake, what? that. What, a ball? It's an ender pearl, Jake. What's a pearl gonna do, Logan? You gonna wear it around your neck you and be throw... like, I got pearls? Jake, if you throw an ender pearl, it transports you. If we throw this outside of the prison or whatever this is, it'll transport us. That's not a bad idea. I mean, it's not gonna help us get out of the whole thing, but at least we can get through these bars here. <sighs> All right, I'm gonna probably try and do like a three pointer with this one. I'll go back here and throw it through this hole. All right, here we go, guys. If I miss this, we are in a lot of trouble. But if I do it this way, then it looks way cooler. All right, you ready? In three, two, one. Whoa, it worked. Ah, ow. I'm okay, I'm okay. Okay, Jake, maybe you could uh, help me out of here. I think I broke something. I'm gonna get all the golden diamonds, put it in my inventory, and then we're good to go. All right, here, let me unlock the door. Ah. All right, come on, quickly, grab all the stuff, let's go. I got the diamonds and the gold, let's nice. go, Jake. All right, let's get out of here. Uh, Logan, I think we got a slime here. Uh, Jake, what do you mean slime? There's a slime in front of us, what do we do? Uh, it's pretty easy, Jake. We kill it. Yeah. Get it, Logan, it's jumping all around. Oh, Logan. I got it. Oh, you got it. It dropped some slime. Ew. Ew, Jake, that's gross. Actually, this isn't bad. Ooh, you know what else? I'm gonna just put this enchantment table in my inventory, Jake. This could be good for later. if I do. Uh, all right, we got an enchanting table. We'll bring that home. And Logan, I got a slime ball. He uses for sticky pistons. Right, Jake, before anything else bad happens, slime let's ball. get let's get out of here. <laughs> Wait, slime ball. It bounces. Please, Jake, can we just get out of here? Okay, let's get out of here. Uh, Jake, what's that noise? That sounds like a nether portal. Wait, there might be another portal in here. That might be the best way to get out of here. Oh, Jake, going to the nether isn't really the best way to get out of here. In the nether, like six blocks walking is like the equivalent of a thousand blocks in the over. It's just simple math. All right, look, look, come on, let's go this way. Let's go through the nether portal. Oh, dude, check it out. It's a nether portal. This is gonna save us so much time. You got your armor? No, you don't. That's okay, I've got armor. Grab your weapons, let's go in, let's get out. We don't wanna spend too much time in the nether. All right, in three, two, one. Ah! Okay, guys, I guess it's time for me to go. Here we go. Whoa! Oh. Where are we? Logan? Yeah! Whoa, dude! Uh, guys, I don't know if we went through the wrong portal or something, but uh, this don't look like the nether. What is going on in the nether? It's supposed to be red and filled with fire and death. This is actually kind of beautiful. Uh, maybe we're not in the nether. We went through a nether portal, Logan. What, you think you go through a nether portal and show up a Chuck E. Cheese? That's not how it works. We're in the nether. Something's been going on here. I don't know, guys. This looks kind of weird. First things first, though, Logan, we're gonna need to find a way to get out of here. I mean, if we're gonna get back home, we need to find another nether portal. We can't go back that way. How are we gonna find a new nether portal? I don't know, Logan. I don't even know where this is. Why don't we cross this stream here, go to the other side, try and find something over there. Uh, Jake? Who are you? Whoa, 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 whoa. Watch out! Get back! Are you some sort of nether creature? Icy and dark armor. Yeah, what is that? Are well, you wearing coal armor? <laughs> He's got coal armor on. <laughs> he thinks it's armor. That's not an armor. Coal's not an armor. Coal's for burning stuff. This isn't coal armor, son. Name's Steven. I've been in the nether for 40 years. Looks like you two are new around here. Whoa, 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 wait. Okay, well, we're not new to the nether, all right? We, we were here yeah. just last year. I don't know what you're talking about, crazy sir, but you are wearing coal armor and you are weird and we are going to go now. This isn't coal. It's netherite and better than that diamond armor you're wearing. Whoa! Hey! All right, all right, you got quick moves. What can you block? Surprise attack! What the Wait, what? Jake, your diamond sword did nothing. It actually kind of broke a little bit. That's because it's netherite. You could spend a lifetime trying to mine this and never find it. You're in the crimson forest now. You best watch yourself. 
dangers afoot. Netherite, eh? So maybe we should be focusing on netherite instead of diamonds. I think what he's trying to say is surprise attack! What is this stuff made out of? Uh, Jake, maybe you just, you, you stop trying to hit this strong looking no, guy. I know what he is, he's a hacker. He's a hacker, I've seen him before on YouTube. He's hacking Dude, the game. Things change, maybe diamonds aren't the strongest thing. All right, well, you know what, fine. Let's, let's just get out of here because I don't like you and I'm medium on you. Let's go. Jake, looks like there's a zombie pigment right over here. Well, look if you know the nether like I do, they don't hurt you. Hey, what's up, buddy? We're just trying to find- Ow! Whoa! Ow! Logan, back up! Uh-oh. Logan, use the sword! <laughs> what was that? They don't normally mess with you unless you mess with them. I didn't mess with them. I said, hey, what's going on, bud? Maybe he thought I was threatening you? Yeah, they're not supposed to attack. All right, guys, I don't know what's going on here in the nether, but we need to get out of here. We need to find a portal and get back Jake? to the Jake? What? Look at that. I don't know what that is. Is that gold? I, it kind of looks like gold. Wait, Logan, I don't know about this. Dude. Could be a trap or something, Logan. I don't know, man. I've never seen gold in the nether. Let's get this, let's get this gold. I also got fortune two on this pickaxe, so I'm pretty sure we're gonna get a lot. I mean, hey, if we get gold out of this, that's pretty good. Whoa, dude! Oh, look at all the gold nuggets. Why are they give us nuggets? I don't know, but dude, there's so many gold nuggets. Uh, Plus, we got all that gold from Logan? from the bank. Logan? What? Logan, get up right now. What? We got problems. Uh, Logan, we are completely surrounded by those pigmen. This is not good. No, Jake, this is not good. You take the two on the left, I'll take the two on the right. If we don't make it out of here, I get all your stuff. Let's go. Ah. All right, zombie pigmen, let's do this. When I'm done with you, I'm gonna turn you into some bacon. Ow! I got mine. One more to go. Okay, we got another one. Uh, you know what? Let's try this. Logan, there's more coming. Uh, Jake, I see that. What did you do with that gold block? Dude, you saved us. That was insane. You actually came back to save us. What? I ain't never seen you two before around here. Oh, well, hi. Name's Zed. Been living in here for 70 years. Just got this netherite armor. Saw you boys in trouble. Thought I'd come over, huh? What is it? What's everyone's name here? Zed, Fred, Ted, or Led? I, I don't get it. Also, why is everyone here for 60, 50 years? Looks like you were mining gold near the pigs, you see? They don't like that very much. They like gold, just not seeing it mined. Okay. If you give them gold, they'll leave you alone, but y'all stirred up the bee's nest with this one, yeah? Oh, well, that's good. We have tons of gold. Okay, well, we really appreciate your help, but we're trying to figure out a way out of here, actually. We're probably not supposed to be here too long. Yeah, why don't y'all take one of these? I'll be out with your journeys, you say. Whoa, thank you. How do you get that? I mean, you have a diamond sword, so now I have a netherite sword. You must be uh, giving me the, your armor then. No, well, see you later. Oh, come on. Well, at right, least well, we got the sword. That's pretty cool. Why is that stuff so powerful? Okay, you know what, come on, we need to keep moving. We gotta find a way out of here. Maybe if we find some of that netherite, Pick some up for me. I guess we just gotta keep looking for another portal or maybe a dungeon or something. Jake, 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 look over there. It's another zombie pig. Okay, okay, we know what to do this time. When we see him, we give him the gold. Yeah, and I have lots of gold. Uh, hey, Mr. Pigman. We come to bribe you. I have gold. <laughs> it's working. Do you like the gold? Whoa, what, what is, is this? Target block? What's a target block? I don't know, but it looks pretty cool. Wait, I wanna try that. Hey, I, we got more gold. Here's some of my gold. What do I get? I mean, netherite helmet, netherite armor. You get a sword like Logan's. A compass? Oh. That's kinda cool, Jake. What am I supposed to do with a compass, Logan? You've never had a compass before. I mean, I guess it will help us find our way home. It's got some directions to it. Jake, not to burst your bubble, but the red thing isn't really moving. Oh, I get it, Logan. You don't know how to read a compass, but I actually do. I'm a survival expert. That red thing is pointing us to our way home. We gotta go that way. It's a compass. I know what I'm doing. Come on, this way. 
We move on. I don't think he really understands how to use the compass. It's kind of getting dark. What are we gonna do? We we need a base. This is kind of scary. We'll find a place to hide out for the night. It won't be glamorous, but we could use our shovels, dig down. We'll make a little underground base. We'll stay there for the night. Uh, Jake, what's this? Dude, it looks like netherite. Wait, this is netherite? Yeah. Use your pickaxe. Good thing we got fortune. Whoa, dude. I mean, it doesn't look as cool as diamonds, but I guess it's stronger. It's a lot stronger. Okay, I mean, maybe the nether's not so bad after all. We could maybe spend some time here. All right, you know what? First things first, though, we need to base up. Let's get an underground base going. I don't want an above ground base where every single pig in this entire place can see us. Once we got that built up, we'll stay the night. Tomorrow morning, we'll figure out our plan. Come on, follow me. Dude, the nether just keeps going on forever. And look at this place, look how big the mountains are. It's crazy. Jake, maybe we should just dig a hole and sleep in it. Why don't we get to the top of this mountain and we'll dig a hole. Come on. All right, well guys, I think what we're gonna need to do is base up now. This mountain's just going on forever and we don't wanna be out here for too long. So let's just do a classic old fashioned base. Let's start digging into the ground and make ourselves a hole. Yep, check it out, Logan. She ain't much, but she's a hole and we're gonna survive in there. That's a big hole! Now let's put some wood across the top and that's a fort. All right, Logan, I'm coming down. Oh, see, it's not that bad. It's, uh, we'll just crouch like this. I don't know, Jake, it's not that great. We'll put a roof on top. I mean, it's only for one night, Logan, okay? Until we can get out of the nether. Oh, Jake, there's baby spiders everywhere and it's kind of gross. All right, guys, check this out. I've got a soul torch. I don't know really much about it other than the fact it glows blue and the pigs don't seem to like it. So I'm gonna set this up around our base. Logan, I think you should get working on the roof. All right, guys, check it out. We built up our nether house. It's pretty cool. Look, we've got a window looking out into the nether, which kind of works because we're on the side of a mountain. And then above us, we've used our wood to cover the roof. And now we are chilling in our hole. I mean, it's not massively big. It's nothing crazy, but it's, it's really not fancy. It's not fancy at all. Not a five star fort. This ain't no steakhouse, but guys, it is our nether home. So I think what we're going to do now is try and get some shut eye, get a little bit of sleep. And in the morning, we'll try to figure out our way to get out of here. Jake, I don't like this. There's spiders. Everywhere. Oh, it's all right, Logan. oh it's all right. I don't like this. I don't know if I can sleep here. Just close your eyes and sleep will come soon enough. All right, guys, I'm gonna get some shut eye. I'll see you in the morning. Hopefully, no pics come in the night. All right, Logan, I'm fully recharged, ready to go. Yeah, I can't believe we slept here. You know, I was thinking, Logan, if we are in the nether and we're trying to get out of here, we're gonna be facing off against a lot of monsters. You did get that target block. I'm thinking, you know, you're always using the bow. Why don't we have a little friendly competition? I mean, why does right. the nether have to be so bad? Let's set it up right here. How about whoever has the best shot gets a golden ingot? How about netherite, Logan? Why don't we go even bigger? Okay, all right. All right, best shot gets netherite. Let's do this. All right, guys, we're all set up. We got our target block ready. Let's have this challenge start. First shot, bullseye. And that's a miss. All right, you get two shots, you get two shots. Best two out of two. Oh, hit the box. All right, guys, Logan is up. He has to go two for two in order to win this oh, challenge. this is pretty easy, Jake. Okay, well, let's see it. That was a miss. Okay, guys, time for our second shot. Whoa, Jake, there's a skeleton. Oh, no, Logan, you already got the thing, so why don't you take him out? Okay. Uh, Jake, I just took out a skeleton. I think I win this challenge. Okay, you only win because you saved us from getting eaten by a skeleton. So here you can have your netherite back. Thank you. That was already yours. But I am going to show you what a true archer can do. Let me pull off one of the greatest trick shots known to man. 360, no scope. Watch and learn, Logan. Watch and learn. Ah, oh, where'd that go? Jake, I think it went way over there. Well, it's a good thing you have a million arrows. Jake, I only have one arrow. Okay, fine, I'll go get your arrow. This guy wants me to go get his arrow just because I'm better than him and I can do really cool trick shots. You know what, I think it's... Did you guys hear that? Sounds up ahead. Shh. Mr. Dragon, your conversion of the nether is going swimmingly. The pig armies are forming and we are finally becoming stronger. Me and you, Randall and the dragon. Yes, my son. Soon my army of the nether will be strong enough to take on the overworld and burn it down. Yes, yes, Dragon, yes! We will burn it down. And all the people that made fun of me, right? Everyone that called Randall upside down face. Right, Dragon? <sighs> yes, and everyone that made fun of you too. This isn't good. This isn't good at all. It looks like the dragon's back. I need to go tell Logan. 
Oh no, I can't find Logan. We need to get out of here and fast. If the dragon is back for real, he could destroy our entire base. I'm starting to think the possibility might be we might have to leave Logan and get out of the nether ourselves Jake. and save ourselves. Jake, what are you what? doing? No, nothing. Logan, the dragon is back. What? Yes. What do you mean the, the dragon room, can't be the back? The rumors are true, Logan. Are you listening to what I'm saying, No, Logan? Jake, I'm not. Logan, are you listening? Open your ears, Logan. Jake, my ears open are open. Open the ears. Jake, my ears are open. The dragon's back. I overheard a conversation between the dragon and some other player. They're plotting a scheme. That's why the nether's changed. That's why this is all new update. This forest. That's why I have a better sword than you. Yes, that's why I have a better sword than me. Netherite. Okay, fine. I get it. Look, they're trying to build an army to take on the overworld of Minecraft. We need to stop them. And we need to get out of here. Well, I definitely agree. We need to get out of here. Not really my job to stop them. Logan, we're living in Minecraft. If the dragon comes and blows up our house, then we lose the game, Logan. Okay? First things first, we need to go home. All right, Logan, I got a plan to get out of here, but we're going to need as many resources as we can. I know this place looks weird and it doesn't look like normal Minecraft. Everything looks like candy. Trust me, it's not. You can't eat anything. Thing. I've already done that. We need to get resources, build up, and get out of here. You go one way, I go the other. We collect as much as we can. We find a way to break out. All right, Jake, I'm going to go try and find some netherite. We're probably going to need some wood because you always need wood. I don't know what kind of tree this is, but it looks like a tree. So let's just start breaking it. Okay, we got some sticks and some logs. Ah, perfect. If only we could find another portal. There's got to be another nether portal around here. I mean, why I can't just dig down and find obsidian in the nether? Wait. Uh, guys, I think I might just spot some netherite. Oh, I think it is netherite. We hit the jackpot. Okay, don't need to tell Logan about this. Uh, oh, all right. Looks like Logan's not going to be the only one with netherite armor and weapons soon. Okay, well, I got some netherite. I got some wood. That really doesn't help us that much. Maybe this whole idea was just a bad idea. Maybe we should have just kept walking. Let's go see what Logan's been up to. Uh, guys? I think I just found something. Whoa, what is that stuff? I'm not exactly sure what this is, but might as well collect it. Okay, don't know what that was, but maybe it'll come in handy. Logan, what'd you find? Tell huh? me you got something good. Another portal? Way out of here? Transportation device? I don't know what I got, but I got this. What is that, Logan? That looks like a piece of fungus. What's fungus? What, what do you mean, what's fungus? How is that supposed to help us get out of the nether, Logan? I don't know, it looks kind of cool. What are you gonna do, eat this? I don't Logan, know. We need Logan. a way out of here. We need a nether portal. A uh, Jake, Jake, we got an enemy. All right, hold on. He's got a crossbow. Ah, Logan, do we have any more gold? Jake, I'm not giving him any more what gold. Do you mean? Logan, he's getting closer. Ah. Logan, use your netherite Jake, sword. I don't want to use my netherite sword. I want to save that. What for do you a cool Ow! He hit me again. You know what? That's it. Thanks for nothing, Logan. You know, you really, you really came in handy here. You were like, you were like my sidekick. Jake, the important thing is we have fungus. What is that gonna do? Make soup? I don't know. You know what? The important thing is he actually, he dropped a crossbow. So that's pretty cool. I like my diamond sword, but I also like some long range weapons. We gotta get out of here though, man. Everything in this forest is trying to kill us. Aw, oh, Jake. What's that sound? Oh, it's coming this way. What is it? Slow down there, Bessie. No, oh, come on now, slow, slow. Back up, back up. What are you doing? It's my strider. He's attracted to your fungus. I can't get him to slow down. Wait, you're attracted to my fungus? Why? Not him, Logan. The strider, the thing he's riding. Some sort of animal. Okay, okay, back up. Oh, get the fungus away from here. Should I just give him the fungus? Do not give him the fungus. We don't even know who this guy is. If you put the fungus on a fishing pole, you can ride your strider wherever you want. It's actually really fast and cool. Perfect. We need to travel very far. Jake, why don't we get a strider? Yeah, we should get a strider. Jake, what did you just do? We need a strider. You said get a strider. So I got a strider. It looks brand new. We didn't need to exactly take his. New. We didn't take his. He's not here anymore. So now we're borrowing his. Come on. Where's that fungus? He said if we make a fishing pole, we can use it to ride wherever. If we use this, we can cross the nether way faster than on foot. We'll be able to find another portal in no time. All right, guys. I'm going to make a crafting table. Three, two, one. And there we go. We got ourselves a crafting table. Now all we need is a fishing rod. We got a stick. We got some string. Fishing rod in three, two, one. Oh, guys, we got ourselves a fishing rod. Look, I don't want to be the bear of bad news. In fact, I'd rather be cow of bad news, but we got pigment closing in on us and fast. We need to do this now. Where's your fungus? All right, let's hook it on to the fishing rod. Okay, then I guess we'll get on the strider and just make our way through the nether. Find another portal or someone else who can help us. Because that guy wasn't very helpful. Jake, how do you know he wasn't helpful? You didn't even give that guy a chance to help us. <laughs> Plus, why are you driving? It's my fungus. Because, Logan, you don't need a license to drive a Strider. Now, come on, get on. Whoa, whoa, easy there, Mr. Strider. Easy there, Mr. Strider. Yeah, yeah, we got the... Okay, well, Logan, you better get on right now if you want to come or else we're going. 
All right, Jake, I'm on the back of the Strider. Okay, here we go. This thing's actually pretty fast, Logan. No! I don't know exactly where we're going, but hopefully it's crash. crash. I'm not gonna crash, I know what I'm doing. Plus, if I crash, it's not really my fault because I'm not really driving. The Strider's ah! doing everything else. Jake, how is this gonna take us out of the nether? I don't know, until we can find a place. Maybe another portal or something. Uh, Jake? What? I see Friendly Phil. What? There. Wait, it's Friendly Phil and his manager. Oh yeah, this is perfect for the music video. I can already see it. Friendly Phil, big show, fireworks over there. The nether has never looked so good. This is gonna be your breakthrough, Phil. Are you sure, Mr. Manager Man? It's kinda, kinda scary in here. No, 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 this is where we film the music video. This is it. Phil, is that you? Oh, I've never been so happy to see you before. Oh, not these guys again. Logan, Jake, what are you guys doing here? Oh. Uh, maybe a little bit more personal oh, space. Oh, You guys aren't huggers. We're trying to film a music video here. There's no time for that, Phil. Look, there's not even time to explain. The dragon is back in Minecraft, and we have been lost in the nether for a whole... Could be five days, could be 12. I honestly don't know. But we need to get out of here, Phil. The dragon! We're leaving right now. Where's the portal? Where's the portal? I told you my cousin Jim wasn't a liar. Uh, this is going to put a huge dent in our production. We need to get out of here, Papa Jake. What are we going to do? Yes, yes, Phil. The dragon is back. We How do we get, get out, out of, here? of here? Where is your nether portal. It's just over here. Let's get out of here. Okay, come on. We need to go now. Whoa! Oh! Ah! oh! oh! We're finally home, guys. We did it. We made it back oh, home. Feels good to be Whoa. out of the nether. Yes. Where's Mr. Manager? Oh, I've never been so happy to be home. I can hug this fort. Logan, Jake, Mr. What? Manager. Yeah, it kind of looks like he didn't oh, make so wait, it. Phil, why is your nether portal next to our house? I thought it'd be a good idea to build it here. No, it wouldn't. How long has it been? Our house isn't looking too good. Yeah, we've only been away for like two days. Okay, well, you know what? First things first, I'm getting rid of this nether portal. No, my manager's still in there. No more nether portal, Phil. All right, we're done. There. My manager! Uh, Phil, you didn't need him. He yeah, was kind of kind of mean. No, you know who you know who's mean? The manager. He was kind of mean, alright? I didn't like that guy. To record my next big single. It's fine, we'll help you record, Phil. That's not that's not what's important right now. There is a dragon on the loose in Minecraft. The and our dragon! Yes, the dragon. See you guys! Right, okay. Alright, look guys, our fort is not in top notch shape. In fact, it is if I had to write it out a scale out of ten, it'd be one. I think we need to rebuild our bases and make four stories, Jake. Yeah. Logan, you know what? We're no longer playing a game. Before, this was Farmville. We were farming, having a blast. No, no, no. Now we're playing Minecraft. I think what we need to do is we need to increase the stories. We need three stories, three levels to the fort. That way we have good shooting range if this does get under attack by the dragon. I need you to build us an enchantment room. Minecart system, Jake. We might need an escape plan. Okay, yes, and a minecart system. I'll start working on a potion lab. I actually picked up a lot of nether stuff from that guy that I shot. <laughs> So I kind of have enough for Jake, a potion. This sounds like a lot of work. Yeah, it's going to be a lot of work. But if that dragon comes, we're going to give him a run for his money. Okay, guys. So we've been working on the Ford for a long time. And you guys need to check this out. We are no longer playing mine. We're still playing Minecraft. But we're playing Buildcraft. Because we just upgraded this Ford to maximum capacity. That's what you do in Minecraft. That is what you do in Minecraft. All right. But guys, we have added a check third story to the third Ford. Third story. Look at this, dude. It's so tall. You go all the way up here. It gives us a huge advantage with the range it also includes an extra room and like I said before guys we're gonna be building a potion lab along with an enchanting room because we need to upgrade our gear and get going here and guys look at this we converted our iron ore into a minecart system oh yeah guys check this out so it's not completely done yet we still have to add some more tracks but we've got a emergency minecraft track that we can get on our little minecart and just zoom like that we can't do that in the micro track. But we can zoom out of here if we need to. And we got our target block. But guys, I think it's time to show you guys what we've built inside. This out. It's been expanding pretty crazy. So obviously you start in here. This is Logan's room. It's my bad. bad. He's got his That's chest. My chest. He's got a light on the wall. But we go in through the hole that we made here into my crafting area. Slash my bedroom. Come on. It's my bed. Where I sleep. Oh, Logan, you need to get in your bed so we can both sleep. Jake, I'm not going to bed right now. It's daytime. Okay, well, I got my furnace in here. And then you come into the main room. So check it out. In here, we have all of the items that we have collected. We've put them all on the table here so we can see them and grab them at any point that we need them. We got Logan's netherite sword, which I'm kind of mad about because I want another Best sword in the game. Okay, all right, you know what? It's not the best sword because I still have my diamond sword, which is kind of broken. We also got our axe. We've got a gold pickaxe, which I have no idea why we have gold pickaxe. All our diamonds. Oh, yeah, guys. We got all the diamonds here that we got from the Minecraft bank, including all the gold bars, which is pretty sweet. And I got my brand new crossbow, which I don't really know how to use, but it's... 
Very dangerous. And we have a wooden bow and arrow, which we can climb up here and we can see what's going on outside and pretty much take out any enemies that come. Or you can climb even higher and get all the way up here for an even better point of view. Check this out, guys. We got a massive point of view. You can see the minecart track down there. We also have a vantage point over to the left and the right of our fort here. Plus, we got a little window here, which we can look through. And you can even see the Minecraft ocean from over here, which is pretty sweet. So I think what we need to do now guys is we need to grab our resources and start working on our two different rooms we need a potion room along with a enchantment room I'm gonna get working on the enchantment room all right guys before we get the enchantment set up going I wanted to do some crafting with our diamonds I was thinking we got a new pickaxe and a new diamond sword so first we'll do the pickaxe we got three diamonds we add our stick and here we go three two one Oh, and we got our diamond pickaxe. Let's go, guys. Add that to the collection, and we got two more diamonds. I say we make a diamond sword. Three, two, one. And we got our diamond sword added to the collection. Now we got two diamond swords, a diamond pickaxe. Now I think we got enough levels to do some enchanting. So you guys might remember when we went into that bank, there was an enchantment table that we stole. So I got that in my inventory. Let's put it down. Bam! And just like that, we got our enchantment table. Oh, guys, I'm excited to do some enchanting. We got a bunch of different enchantments. We got our bookshelf. Now, what should we enchant first? Okay, I think we should do one of the diamond swords. Oh, I just realized we don't have any lapis. Jake, where are you? Jake, yes. oh, yes, Logan. Jake, we don't have any lapis and I need some lapis for the enchantment table. Oh, well, that is right. You can't enchant without lapis. All right, well, it's a good thing I've got Papa Jake's secret enchanting mine. And by that, I mean secret mine. Why don't we take the minecart over there and we'll go get some lapis. Yeah, we only have one minecart, Jake, and I'm not gonna fit in it. So I'll see you later. Okay, well, it's your loss. I get to use the minecart. All right, guys, well, looks like we're on a mission to go get Logan some lapis so we can get some enchantments. I'll get working on my potion table after that. But as you guys can see, we have the minecart track set up here we didn't have a lot of iron so we couldn't make it as far as we wanted to but let's try this thing out and see how it works okay all right it's a little slow we don't have a lot of powered rails oh no we're off the minecart track all right definitely not the longest minecart track in the world but we can expand and i think we should definitely make a roller coaster but guys let's head on over to papa jake's secret mine and see how it's doing i haven't been back here since we've been to the nether so i'm a little curious what it looks like all right guys check it out we've got my mine shaft here it is extremely big i've been working on it for a little while now it looks like it might have caved in a little bit but let's start digging see if we can find some lapis luckily lapis isn't the hardest thing to find Oh, guys, I think we got some lapis. Check it out. Well, that wasn't too bad. That actually came pretty quick. All right, let's try and get this out here. Ugh. There we go, guys. We got our lapis. Okay. Pretty good haul for our first find of lapis. We're gonna be using this to upgrade all of our armor, weapons, everything we have we need to enchant because if we're going up against the dragon, we need the best of the best. I'm gonna keep uh, mining here, guys, trying to find some more lapis. Seems like we hit a little bit of a spot of lapis down there, so I'll gather as much as I can, and then when I get back, I'll start working on the potion room. All right, Logan, I'm back, and I've got a present for you. You got the lapis? Yeah, check it out, dude. Ooh. Here, you want some lapis? I want some lapis. All right, here you go. All right. There's all your lapis start enchanting. I'm gonna get working on the potion room. All right, guys, let's go complete that enchantment. We got our lapis. We got our diamond sword. Let's put our lapis in. And let's see what kind of diamond sword we get. Check it out, our first enchanted diamond sword. Ooh, we got unbreaking two, knockback three, and we got sharpness. Ooh, I think I'm gonna be the master enchanter because I have a lot more XP and a lot more levels than Jake does. We got our bow and arrow, we got our lapis, and let's see what we get. Oh, guys, no way. We have unbreaking and infinity arrows. Oh, this is perfect. Now we don't have to collect arrows or make new arrows. We just have infinity. All right, guys, so check this out. While we were in the nether and after we kind of eliminated that one guy, I actually picked up a lot of really awesome potion making stuff. So I'm not too amazing at making potions, but I think I know what I'm doing. I put together here our potion stand. I've got our potion bottles ready and I've loaded it up with blaze rods. So I thought we'd try and make our very first potion. And if we get good at it, we can make one to prank Logan with. All right, guys, now the key to making a good potion 
kitchen, it's all about mixing the right amount of ingredients. Now we're working with highly, highly active ingredients. So you wanna mix these right or you could end up with a very bad potion. So we're just gonna mix some blaze rods in with some water and mix it with the spider eye and you should have a potion like... I uh, don't think I mixed that right. Jake? Try that again. Yeah, it's low again? What did you just do? I don't know because I can't see. Uh, Jake, I see a creeper. Oh, you need to see a creeper. Where is he? Uh, there's a creeper over over, over there. I'm, I, Logan, I still can't see. I, I literally still can't see. I got my enchanted bow and arrow. All right, guys, we're on the third story. I can't see Logan. Where's the creeper? Jake is going to not help us at all. Go fight him. Uh, yeah, this is not a big deal, Jake. It's just a creeper. It's really not a big deal if I miss this arrow because I got infinity arrows. Oh no. I missed. Alright, and one more arrow should do the trick. Alright, crisis averted. The creeper's gone, Jake. I, I still can't see, Logan. That's okay. I'm starting to be able to see again. Okay, well, I messed that potion up, but guys, you know what they say. You try once, you try again. If that doesn't work, you keep trying until eventually it works. Jake, why is there a torch floating? Hey, Logan. Jake, why is there a torch floating? What do you mean, why is there a torch? Uh, uh, you know, what, what? Where am I? Where am I, Logan? Jake, where are you? Logan, it's I'm right here, Logan. It sounds like Jake's right in front of us, but I can't see him. Right here? I'll pick torch uh, up. Jake, there's a zombie. What, what do you mean there's a zombie? Jake, there's a zombie right there. Oh, there's a zombie. All right, well, since I'm invisible, Logan, Logan, I can actually take out the zombie. Uh, wait, Jake, you're invisible? Yes, Logan, I'm invisible, and it's time to beat this zombie. Z hey, zombie. Hey, zombie. Zombie. Oh, you don't even know where I am. Oh, zombie. Where am I? I'm gonna come over here. I'm over here. I don't oh, that's right, zombie. Yeah, no one can see me. I can do whatever I want. I can dance like this, and no one's gonna see me. No one's even gonna know where I am. Hey, Logan, Jake. where am I? Ooh, Jake. you Ow! I think the potion's worn off. Oh. I can see you. Oh, you're right, it has. Okay, well, Jake, I have enchanted a bunch of items and weapons. We have a lot in our inventory right now. I think today's been a pretty successful day. We got out of the nether. We expanded our base, built a minecart system. You built a potion system, enchantment system. I think that deserves 100 billion likes. Hey, Logan, is it getting cloudy or is it just me? Uh, Logan? Yes, Jake? Logan, I think there's a dragon! Mr. Dragon, today is the day we've been waiting for. Me, Randall, and you, the dragon, will take over the overworld and make everyone pay for making fun of my upside down face. Yes, my son. Today is the day to reclaim what is mine. I am ready to open the portal and rain destruction on these mortals. Yes! Yes! Open the portal! Open the portal! No, no, listen. I'm the only one that can open up the portal, okay? I say when the portal's opened. Okay, now we can open it. Open the portal! Time to rain my destruction! Uh-oh. Why are there zombie piglins outside of the nether? Jake! If we're gonna fight this army, I need Jake's help. Jake! Shh, Logan. What are you doing? What? Jake, what are you doing? I'm hiding. What do you think I'm doing? Here, there's not enough room for the both of us, but if they come in here, I promise not to tell where you're hiding. Jake, grab a sword and fight. There's like a million pigmen out there and a dragon, Logan. Which is why we need to go out there and fight, Jake. A dragon, Logan. Well, I, I, I didn't actually see a dragon. I just saw a lot of zombie piglin. Jake, Jake, listen to me, listen. You might not be the fastest runner and I might not be the strongest fighter, but we have heart, Jake. We have heart. We have heart. A sword just came through That's the wall. That's a lot of heart! Jake, yeah, okay, we need to grab a sword. Change we the need sword. to fight, Jake. All right, we use everything we got against the Logan. We take out every single pigman that's here, and we take down that dragon again. Get up on the lookout spot, start shooting them with the arrows. I'm heading out front. Jake, I have a gold bar. What's that gonna do? Uh. Oh, right, they love gold. Just use gold when you see a zombie pigman. We have three bars left, so... Right, pass one. Oh. Why are gold bars so heavy? Who invented this thing? Jake, behind you. Oh, no. Oh, 
Logan, more coming from the east. All right, we got one over there. Oh, headshot. Guys, it's a good thing I enchanted this. We got infinity arrows. That means I'm gonna take out this entire army. Ah. Got another one. Good job, Logan, but we got more coming. Oh, I got one on me. Oh, I can't get him off. Looks like I got an idea. Ah. Oh, you can't see me, buddy. I'm invisible. I got an invisibility potion. Where am I? Am I above you? Am I underneath you? Where could I be? And take that. And that. And that. Oh, I like being invisible. It's pretty cool. All right, guys. It looks like we need to take down every single one of the... Oh, I'm not invisible anymore. Every single one of these piglins before they can overrun our base. Logan, what is that? Oh, no. It's a piglin on a horse. I think he's I think he's dead Jake. Oh, you got him. Good job. Jake behind you. Oh, oh no, we got another one. Logan, there's too many of them. I'm getting back in the fort. Flash potion out. Logan, this is not good. We can't take on all of them. We can't just run away. We can't take them. There's an army out there. Well, what are we going to do in here, Jake? Hide until the walls cave in? There's no way we can take all of them, dude. There's too many. I think they're working with the dragon. He's created an army. Who knows how many of these guys there could be? There's like a bajillion. Maybe they're all clones. Maybe they all come right. back to life. I'm going to bed. Oh, you can't um, go to bed. I'm out. No, this is it. Going to sleep and maybe I'll wake up in the morning. I never thought we'd go out like this. Maybe the dragon is too strong. Maybe we can't. Jake, really? You have your cell phone? Go for Papa JJ. Hello, Papa Jake. This is the General of Fortnite speaking. Oh, hey, Mr. General. What's up? Fortnite needs your help again. Fortnite needs our help again. Logan, Fortnite needs our help again. What, Jake, why is the General calling? We're in Minecraft. Tell him we're busy. Uh, yeah, we're in Minecraft. Minecraft? You mean the game with the blocks? Yes, the game. Yeah. Yeah, the game with the blocks and the... But yes. Well, they don't even have blasters in that game. No, there are not any blasters in Minecraft. We have a serious issue. The walls have been breached and there is water literally everywhere. We need you here right now. Look, yeah, we're, we're sort of in the middle of something right now. We're in a bit of a pickle. Mm, I do love savory, juicy pickles. Uh, yeah, tell them, Jake, we're really busy. Uh, we got zombies. Yeah, but there's zombies, yeah. Okay, okay, how, how about this? I'll tell you what, Mr. General. How about you help us for once? You come to Minecraft, you help us defeat this dragon. Whoa, 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 did you just say a dragon? Y yes, there's a dragon in Minecraft. Just listen, send your best men and help us defeat the dragon and we will give you all the help you need. All right, Papa Jake, but you owe me for this one. I'll send my best men to help you out and then you need to save Fortnite. Okay, perfect, thank you, thank you, bye. General, out. Men, assemble! We have a mission. Wow, Jake, you're really uh, kind of bossing the general around. Yeah, well, he's about to send his best men here in a helicopter to help us defeat the dragon. Now we just need to hold up for now. All right, listen up, men. We have a job for the general. We are here today to take out that wagon. I mean dragon. Tree man? Yeah, I'm ready to go. That's right, Tree Man, you are ready to go. And DJ Llama, I expect you on the battlefield ready to go. DJ Llama's always ready to go, bro. I'm always ready to lay down some beats. All right, well, as captain of this team, Secret Agent Man has got you covered. See these pockets? Lots of pockets filled with ammunition. You guys need an ammunition? Holler at me, and I'll get you some ammunition. Tree Man, I'll need you to take lead on this mission, because you're our best shooter. Oh, boy, I can't wait. This is my first real mission, guys. Here, come on, let's keep moving. Oh, no, they're pushing it forward. Oh, Jake, the oh, is getting in. in. Jake, what's, what's going, going on? on? Ah! Jake! Quickly, quickly! Logan, just when I thought this day couldn't get any worse, they're destroying our hard work. We worked so hard on this fort. Jake, I, th I think this day might just get a little worse. I hear the dragon. Oh no, Logan! <sighs> ah, it's the dragon, Logan! No! 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 Oh, the fort! Oh no, 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 no. We're Jake, left exposed. the dragon just ruined our third story. Oh no, we got Pigman coming too. Where is the general? Oh no, 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 no this is it. Oh no, Logan, there's more. Wait, what's that sound? Is that another dragon? 
sounds like a helicopter. Wait, you're right. It's the general in the helicopter. We're saved. All right, everyone, prepare to drop. DJ Llama, you are first. See you on the ground, boys. Oh, here they come, dude. They're coming to save us. All right, bros. Now this is what I'm talking about. And these guys don't even have blasters. All right, time to lay down some battle beats, y'all. Oh, dude, it's DJ Llama. Ooh, laying down some groovy beats. I love it. Tree Man, you are next. Here we go. Who's that? Ah! I'm okay, I think. Oh, no, bro. You did not stick that landing. Tree Man. Oh, bro. <laughs> is, it, is it bad? Is it really bad? It's definitely not good, but we'll bring you back to base, bro. Don't worry, we'll fix you up. Here, let me lay down a sad song for you. Oh, that did not look like it ended well for that tree. And finally, yours truly, Secret Ancient Man, the most handsome man in Fortnite. Whoa, who's that cool looking spy dude? <laughs> Let's get this show on the road. All right, everyone, focus on the pig things, and then we'll take out the dragon. Look at them take out those piglins. I mean, to be fair, they have blasters and we only have swords. So, I mean, it's kind of unfair. I could have done that with a blaster, but anyway. Fortnite is kind of like future. So it's like the future's coming to the past. They do have an advantage. Oh no, that's terrible about Tree Man. But remember DJ Llama, you know what they say, always leave a man behind. The mission must go on. I just feel bad for Mr. Tree Man. Ooh, he took out that piglin good. Remember everyone, if you're out of ammo, I have lots of ammunition in my pockets. Just give me a holler. I got lots of ammo in my pockets. Uh, uh, guys, you're doing a really good job with the piglins, but the dragon, we gotta take out the dragon. Oh, don't worry about it, bro. I'm on the dragon. Hey, super agent man, fire the dragon, let's go. Oh yeah. Good idea, DJ Llama. Stick to the target. Defeating the dragon. Well, guys, it's a good thing I have so many pockets because I have enough space to keep an RPG. Ah, uh, here we go. An RPG. Here we go, dragon. Bullseye, look at him fall. Dude, dude, the dragon's gone. I did it. I saved Minecraft. Of course you did it, Jake. Well, of I mean, course. I, I accepted the phone call and I arranged all of this. So, you know, if I ordered the pizza, I didn't make the pizza, but I still got everyone pizza. So I saved Minecraft. Bro, we totally saved the day in this cube world. You're welcome, cube people. I think it's time to head back to Fortnite, though. We got to get our little tree friend back in one piece. Well, Jake and Logan, it looks like we did it. You're very welcome and you owe us a favor. Looks like I won't be needing all this ammo, so you guys can have it. See you guys in Fortnite. All right, Fortnite out, everyone. Well, guys, it looks like Minecraft is officially saved, and now we kind of owe Fortnite a lot of help, but that's okay. We've defeated the dragon. We've built, we've mined, we've crafted. 50,000 likes. But guys, this has been Papa Jake. And Logan. And we'll see you guys next time for another awesome video.